Hello and happy Friday. Welcome back to another Retro Roulette stream. I'm your man, Photogenic Justin, and we're here to play The Adventures of Cookie and Cream as part of the FromSoft Marathon. Yes! These are the same folks who would go on to make Dark Souls and have made Kingsfield and Eternal Ring and Armored Core and Cookies and Cream! <laughs> Very out of left field, I know, but um, that's exactly why I wanted to play this. <laughs> Alright, so there's no other options. By the way, the save file for this game is apparently twice as large as the one for Eternal Ring. So hopefully that means this game is twice as good. Alright. Yeah, I, I'm only playing this in single player tonight, so only type A is available for me, because otherwise there's two other control schemes. There's one where I think both players can share the same controller, and then there's another one where, like, it's something like we both use one stick. I don't know. It's, it's weird. <clears throat> Alright. What's going on, Sam? Are you ready for this? This is gonna be, this is gonna be a trip. I've uh, actually never played through this game, so... <laughs> We'll see what's going on with this. I've never played a PS2 version. I played a DS one. I don't know if you guys saw the intro, but the intro is crazy. It's also really cute. Okay, so Jungle World is first. Okay, that's my save. What's going on, HK? All right, let's do this. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Look at that save. Look at that loading screen. Oh, that's good. Ready? Go! Finally made it, huh? Where have you been? We don't have much time, so let's get started. Anyway, I'm about to give you some hints. I think you'll find that I possess a great deal of useful information. Hint number one. If you get stuck or lost, come find me. But you finally press the action button, I'll give you hints, just like the one you're reading now. Okay? Hit number two. There are many obstacles that will prevent you from advancing on your own. You must work with your partner to move forward. If your partner falls behind, you should always wait for them to catch up. Don't think you can do it all alone. So, alright. The way this game works is, you have these two bunnies, right? And so I'm controlling them both at the same time with the analog sticks. One controls Cookie, the other one controls Cream. And the R2 and L2 buttons interact with objects, and R1 and L1 jump. So yeah, <laughs> it's that kind of game. Like, can I interact with that barrel? I guess not. Alright. And basically, we want to get to the end of the level within the time limit. Huh? Who are you? Oh, I see. You're the ones who, you're the ones the old guy brought over. My name is Blackbird. I'm a helper, just like that old guy over there. Well, it's nice to meet you. Okay. See? And that gives me some extra time. You see that alligator? You have to move him in order to get past. Have your partner pull the chain on the left. Yes. So, hold on. Did I not, like... Can I still get past this dude? Let's see. Maybe I could jump over. Okay, cool. Perfect. Oh, I almost forgot. To... You can jump one more time when you're in the air. For your information, it's called the double jump. You can use the double jump to get to certain places or grab items. Be sure to practice this move. Let's see what's going on. I'm calling it now, hardest game in a marathon. I know, right? It would be. LOL. You think I'm kidding? 
Did they deadass steal the Coco sound effect? <laughs> this looks more like a ca Crash Bandicoot game than something from software. I know, right? All the chicken <laughs> sounds are just stock effects. Oh my goodness. Yay, that's right. Give me that time. Do you see that pond? You have to lay down a bridge across it. This would be a good time to get some help. The bridge will lower when the lever is turned 90 degrees to the right. But be careful, if turned 90 degrees again, the bridge will be raised. When the lever is turned, a gopher will pop out of that hole when he does jump on his head to defeat him. Most of the enemies you meet on this island can be defeated by stomping on them. Be sure to give it a try. Oh, I see. Okay. So... There we go. Whoops! You just turned the lever on the right to cross the bridge. Had you turned the lever, did you just push it? That's okay, of course. But you can pull the lever too, remember this. What about the other one? See that switch? Step on it. Two platforms will rise out the water to your right. Then Cream will be able to make it to the island. Yeah, there's like secret items you can get as well, and I kind of skipped over a couple of them. Good work! The gates up ahead take you to the next stage. Go through them together. Let's go! Go in! Rank E? Jeez. I want a chocolate, and yes, mmm. You know, I kind of wish I had cookie and cream ice cream right now. Oh my goodness. So yes, this is cookie and cream. Yeah. Oh no! Yeah, falling in the water gives you a bit of a time penalty. Kind of like in Nights into Dreams. No, get off of me! Now things get different, you'll need the logs on the right to get across the river, but how can you get them over here? We need cream to push these logs. Oops. Aw, oh, damn it. Shot out again. Okay. Oh, damn it, that thing made me fall. Alright, let's go get that clock again. This game is so weird. But I also kind of dig it. That's the second level. 
Damn, how fast do I have to do this in order to get a better rank? I gotta decide what's for dinner soon. Maybe someone can deliver me pizza. I kinda doubt it. Love that move that looks like a spinning cap from Mario Bros. <laughs> it does look like a spinning cap. Are, are they like dead or something? Oh, okay. We get two camera angles. Wait, I need to grab onto this. Did I not grab that thing? Oh no. That's not good. We are running out of time. Oh, I gotta move it this way. There we go. As you've noticed, strange creatures fly out the sky every so often. If they can grab you, it can be a real pain. These guys attack anything that doesn't move. So just sit around when you're so don't just sit around when you're waiting for your partner. Oh, if they grab you, move the stick around to, to free yourself. Okay, so we gotta keep moving basically. Okay. Can I not? Okay. Okay. Yep. I got a double jump. Oh, damn it. You know what? It's okay. We don't need it. I was supposed to move that, and then she could get up there. Okay. Dead tired. Yeah. Okay. So let me go ahead and move this first. Perfect. Okay. Okay. We're doing it. We're doing a thing.
Okay. Okay, let's go. Awesome! There we go! And they did much better, too. Oh my god, these bloody screens. <laughs> You're in pretty deep once you pass the stage. You'll meet your first boss. Take this with you. You don't want to run out of time, do you? Nope, I don't. Log on the left will turn when you rotate the lever on the right. Turn it to the angle you want, then jump across. There we go. Oh, you know what? I probably gotta turn this again then. Yeah. Switch, the bridge will move into place, but this time stepping on it just once won't complete the bridge. <laughs> Step on the switch twice to complete the bridge and then cross it. Really, once is enough though. Oh, wait, what? That boy, rope, Tom, you want it? It's yours, my friend. Okay. As long as you have enough rubies. Now it's a new kind of bridge. To make the bridge move left, you have to step on the right button. Wait, but wait. the bridge will now move back into place. As the button is released, don't move it to your partner has crossed the bridge. <laughs> Welcome Robin to and I are here to uh, cover you and read chat. Yes, we are seeing that time from software decided to make a puzzle platformer. And after this, the first boss will be waiting for you. Are you ready? The boss of wow, this nice world is rock to hard. You. So you'll need to hit him with logs. The boss is what? Rock hard. Hey, I thought this was a children's game. No, that's just you. Game. It's not a children's game. FromSoft couldn't make a children's <laughs> game if they tried. You got your mind in the gutter. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, we got a cutscene. <laughs> what? He's just zoned out. <laughs> Well, I'm assuming that's Cookie, and Cookie seems very determined. Oh shit! What? Why do I hear? Oh my god! It's uh, what other game did did boss text like that? That was uh. It's, oh okay. It's, it's like the Zelda games. Yes. The Zelda games did the, did it like that. Rock Beast Golem or. or 
uh, giant dinosaur King Dodongo or something like that. Also, all I hear in my head now is Vork of the Boreal Valley, so, uh... Phase 2, specifically. I yes. do! That sounds hellish! So, was this game designed so that one person was to play it that way? Or, like, did, was the whole point of the game, like, you're supposed to have a friend help you? Probably have a friend, but... I ain't got no friends. <laughs> Come here. You get there we go. You get something. I don't know what it's but your miles and miles from your nice wood bit. Yes, we can save. Honestly, it's not that bad a control ball for them. Which one is Cookie and which one is Cream? I'm pretty sure Cookie is the yellow one. Oh, uh, okay. I can tell you in just a second. Let me get the manual out. Okay. Just think, one, this is a PS2 game. Yeah. One console later and they would go on to make Demon Souls. They go from this yep. to Demon Souls. Okay. Like this was their only game. So no, I know, but like, all right, I will read off the character descriptions. That's what the manual says. Character descriptions. Hey, okay, but can you do it like, like you're you're doing that thing where 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 you, uh, friendly narrator voice. Yeah, that. Yeah, do that. Do what? Uh, he says, child friendly narrator voice. A young rabbit. He possesses both an adventurous spirit and an easygoing personality. He's been brought to the mysterious island by his helper and is enjoying his adventure thoroughly. Cream, the pink rabbit. A young rabbit. Her personality is marked by impatience. She wants to get this adventure over with as quickly as possible so that she can return home. Oh, and uh, helpers also have some descriptions too. So, um, the white rooster, literally called white rooster, is Cookie's helper, the moon guardian. He is the one who has sent our two heroes on their adventure. Indeed, it's said that he used to assist many adventurers as a helper. He retired so that he could spend his time doing whatever he wished, but was forced to return because of the disappearance of the moon. The black rooster. While rooster's twin brother, oh, white, white rooster's twin brother, Although he is getting along in years, he still talks and acts like a youngster. He really doesn't want to work, and as a result, he's somewhat irresponsible as a helper. I'm uh, I, I'm I'm legally obligated to read um, the comment that Nick just left. So, uh, it's, <clears throat> it, it's a sequel to the Dark Souls. It's it's a game called uh, the Cookie also, and Cream. I love the art. This was in the intro too, but like. Look at look at this. Ah, uh, it's adorable. <laughs> the instruction the manual on, is actually really cool. But the look on Cream's face is just like a oh my god. So another thing about this game is there's a versus mode that's like very different from the main game too. There's like characters and all sorts of new mechanics. Like there's an entire section of this manual that's just dedicated to the versus mode and all the different stuff in that. So yeah, um, if you guys really like this game and want to see more of it in the near future, we'll we'll do the two-player mode. Yeah, she's impatient. She just wants to go home. Wait, hold up. This is the one-player mode. This is the one-player mode. Yep. Oh. Okay. Oh wait, I can pick which world I want to go to. Music world. Music, music world. world. All right, let's go to the music world. Oh. I just love how out of left field this game is. Welcome to Music World. What a noisy Thanks, place this is. Happy and cute. Yes, where it just replaces your character with cookies and or cream. Sound plays an important role here in this world. They'll probably have to use different musical instruments in order to advance. 
I see. I don't even know how that would work. Like, I'm trying to figure out, like, how that would work in my head. Like, I'm just trying to visualize that. <laughs> oh, no. It's got a very interesting flow, and I dig it. It's like... And you're gonna, oh, eyes are gonna roll when I say this, but it's I'm actually doing very horrible. Like this one part in Majora's Mask, where you kind of have to jointly control uh, Link at the same time as Cafe, but it's not quite the same because there you kind of like alternate. Um, but it's the same kind of premise where what you're doing on one side is helping the person on the other side. So, it's it, it, I, I yeah, we'll do like that. concepts like this. And, wait, there's a time limit? Get the fuck mm -hmm. out of here! Oh yep. wow, Sam was not kidding. This is gonna be the hardest game of the fucking marathon. Oh, those hurt me too. Hit, okay. Lose. Yeah, if you I get hit, you lose time. If you get hit, you lose time. Yes. It's like nights into dreams. <laughs> Kind of like, like Goof Troop. Why isn't she grabbing it? There you go. Yeah, you gotta keep moving. And also jump on enemies when possible. So you have this physical? Yes. Oh, damn it. I wasn't sure how to get past this, though. Man, I feel silly. The only the only FromSoft game I own, I think, is... No, I've got two. I've got Dark Souls 3 on uh, Steam, and I've got a physical copy of, of Bloodborne. But I like this. This is like a really nice change of pace for what I'm used to seeing from FromSoft. Yeah, I'm just not sure how to get past that puzzle. Okay. <laughs> this game is so hard. It's like a goof troop of from soft. Games. It's like a goof troop of from soft games. <laughs> How did that hit me? <laughs> okay. Nick, 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 you should do stand up. Really, like you just really fucking. <laughs> Nine, eight, seven, <laughs> six. Wait, 20. Okay. No, no, that's cool. Yeah, so another thing with this game is, and probably the thing that makes it really hard, is you have to keep moving. If you stay in place for too long, an enemy will come and start taking time away from you. <laughs> so as you see me, like, moving a character around like that, that's why. Oops. I just don't know how I get up on top of the xylophone. It's called the Cookies and Cream. It's a prequel to the Dark Souls. <laughs> Could you imagine? I want the fanfiction that ties them together too. Holy shit. Could you imagine? Could you imagine that this is somehow linked to Dark Souls? <laughs> I don't know how I'm supposed to get up there. You need to get to the top over there on the left, but how are you going to do that? Yeah, how the hell do I do that? Is there something I'm missing? Hey, 
Can you jump over the drum using the drum? Like, bounce on the drum and then jump, jump over the taiko? Uh, no, I was trying to jump on the taiko. Huh. Uh, game bad. Okay, cool. That, 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 that's wrap. All right, you check us out next week yep. for. Uh... <laughs> what, what is next week? Demon Souls. Um, I think we're still playing some PS2 games. Like I know I am doing Lost Kingdoms. Sam says that a special guest is going to be streaming Metal Wolf Chaos. Uh, how is that special guest going to stream that? Actually, that reminds me. I've been meaning to ask, speaking of Metal Wolf Chaos, is it on Steam? Yes. It, it is. is absolutely okay, cool. on Steam. I think it'll be easier for the special guest to stream it if, if there's a digital copy. No, let me see. Yeah, it's on Steam. I'm like... 90% positive it's on Steam. Okay. So... Yeah, Melo Chaos. It's only twenty five bucks. Maybe I'll get it on on PC. Popular user defined tags for this product. First one, America. <laughs> Is there something Action that, Max, like... cold classic and funny? I feel like I'm missing something with this level, and I don't know what. Do you want to try a different level? We can do that, just I don't get what I was supposed to do for... Oh, 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 okay. That's right, the drums can hurt me. Yeah, I have no idea how to, how to, how to get past that. Uh, Renuzo says, may I suggest something? Feel free to suggest something. Squid would like to inform us that there is no effect for cookie and cream on AO3. That is good to know. No, it's bad to know. It's bad to know. I want, well, you know what they say. I can't say yeah. I actually want a cookie and cream yeah. pick. <laughs> that, that's just me. I'm I, speaking for I, myself I, on that one. I think it's time for Robin to write the world's first uh, fan fiction that connects uh, Cookie and Cream to Dark Souls. The fiction is literally one sentence long. It just says, Cookies and Cream takes place in the same universe as Dark Souls, the end. Let's see, with that section of the level, can you try jumping from drum to drum on the right side? Yeah, I was trying to do that, and it didn't seem to work. Actually, you know oh, what? Yeah, Hold on. If, if I have an idea. all five drums, maybe it'll lower the, the wall or something. I have an idea. Actually, I think I might know how to get past this. Let me try something. Hmm. <clears throat> Yes, this is a true test of my gamer skills. Oh, wow. Your gamer skills, huh? Ugh. I mean, we've seen me pull off some pretty crazy shit on stream in the past, so. That is very true. I mean, Justin is probably the most hardcore gamer I know. Okay. Let's get you over here. All right. Which does beg the question, Justin. Why are you gaming? <laughs> okay, so... There we go! That's how we do it. Now I gotta find a way to get back up there. Well, you've got 149 seconds. You're doing great. So you need to kill the fire keeper. 
Justin, Justin, you gotta kill the fire keeper. Path is blocked by merrymakers that probably won't understand our language. So I guess we just have to force them aside. Yes. That's an excellent message to send to children everywhere. What's that? What's that? That person doesn't speak your language? Just shove them! <laughs> Do you see the gong over there? How about oh, yes! That? Violence! The universal language! Oh! Oh, it's an antique phonograph. It'll make a sound when you grab the handle to turn it. Okay, so get out of the way. That's actually really creative. I like that. <laughs> Perfect. All right. Oh. All righty then. Way well, hey, we did it. Everybody, well, hey's in the chat. If you're a sub, you've got access to it. Uh, yes, I am going to ignore those comments. Wait, where, where the fuck? Hmm. I was talking about the emote, Sam, but I guess that works. Oh, it's tier two. Oh. What a shame. And yet, and yet our Peter Griffin Lawash is tier one. The priorities. I'm not supposed to get that. Okay. Here, I'll put them in since I have access. <laughs> because Lois. Ah, uh, yes. The generic FromSoft uh, skeleton. Uh, monster. Watch that be the final boss. That's a trombone up ahead. When you move Is the slide, this game it gets will change dark the souls. trombone's pitch. The head of that platform over there changes with the sound pitch. You don't get the pitch right, you'll have trouble later. Oh no. Oh, wait, I probably gotta push this in a bit. Now, excuse me while I test something. <laughs> this is a trumpet. I used to play this instrument all the time when I was younger. Okay. I right, hashtag ER Elden Ring giveaway. And our Elden Ring game. Oh! Okay. Well, I'm entering. ER. Yeah. Cool. And the channel has now entered its own contest. Nom, 
where? Where's the the dang my dang phone? Oh, I'll enter on my personal. See account. what's going on there. A greedy motherfucker. The channel wins. If the channel wins, then uh, the copy goes to Justin. What? What am I winning? Oh, the Elden Ring giveaway. If the channel wins, then the copy of Elden Ring goes to you. Uh, see. And I have no idea where I'm supposed to go with this. M says, no, the channel is not eligible. I'm sorry, who died and made you king of retro roulette? To be fair, Anthony's won like two of my giveaways. What? You've won like two of my giveaways in the past. I have won two of your giveaways. And, uh... I appreciate that that you let you actually let me play that play in those. Mm -hmm. I mean, I figure if it's RNG, my odds are just as good as anybody else's. No, I, I mean, I, yes, I did leave it upstairs. Oh wait, I gotta go play I this. Need to refill on water imminently. Uh, also, enter the giveaway. Enter it! And you yes. don't want the Elden Ring? People, enter giveaways. It's, it's, it's a sequel to the Dark Souls. Because, like, sometimes when I have giveaways, like, nobody wants to participate. I'm like, guys, enter. It's a free game. Okay, then tell you what. Enter <laughs> it, and then if you win, give it to me, so that way I don't have to pay for it myself. Oh yeah, that's right. You have to. You still have to oh, redeem chicken. Oh, that's why. Okay, <laughs> I, I get why this didn't work. See that in the chat for Sam is screaming, Anthony, my God, driving Sam crazy is ninety nine point nine percent repeating part of the fun. I mean you, that. It's, it would be your gift copy. You could do with it whatever you wish. If you want to give it to Sam, then go for it. We were supposed to get it. That it wasn't funny. <laughs> the club literally can't even handle me. Oh, I'll never be. I'll never be upset if a friend of mine gives a. I got that fifty dollar key, but honestly, I could give that away because I'm like actually trying to save some money lately. Wait, you got a $50 key for what? Oh, you 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 got a you 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 got a $50 key for Elden Ring? Is that a promotion or something that I don't know about? And more importantly, is that still going on? Oh, well shit. Better go and uh better go and grab that. There's something else. I, I probably saw that there. and then probably totally forgot about it. It's called the Elden Ring. It's a, it's a sequel to the Dark <laughs> Souls. Nihilism bot. Wait, what was the thing to type? It's here, I'll scroll up for you. It's hashtag ER giveaway. But after the hashtag ER giveaway, you have to type all as, as all one word, it's a sequel to the Dark Souls. Yeah, I don't. Hold on. Let's see. Let me look at ah, chat. Shit, I should make that a requirement. <laughs> I live for the George R. R. Martin meme. Holy fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Justin, have you seen the interview that, that that we constantly reference? Yes, I know what you guys are talking about. Is it not just fantastic? It, it is pretty the funny. Man is so is so confidently wrong. Like he says what he says and it's funny, but he says it and it, like it's so matter of fact. Like it's like it's elementary and rudimentary and it's, it's so wrong. <laughs> Shit. Okay. Wait, I thought you beat the music level. Why are you back here? Well, obviously there's more in the world. Oh, okay. So it's a world and there yes. are multiple levels. Okay, gotcha. Yes. 
Just like all the old school platformers. Which is cool. Can we call the, I guess we could call this a platformer. This definitely. is absolutely a platformer. Yeah. And you know what? That's fine. It's refreshing to play yeah. a game like this. We don't really have enough of them anymore. No, we really fucking don't. It's a shame. That's why I'm so excited about Kirby. Because while Kirby is a terrible platformer, Kirby is an amazing... Kirby games are always a good time. I'm really kind of excited for, for the Forgotten Lands because, like, this is the first mainline game that's going to be in 3D that is just solely oh, combat-based. No. What? I don't know how to get up there. Can you jump on the bell thing? Well, I just did. Yeah. Yeah, uh, I should probably tell you that even in Discord, you're a couple seconds behind. So when I had asked that question, you hadn't actually done that yet. I don't know how to, I'm supposed to get that gold clock in the corner. Uh, let me time out. That's fine. <laughs> Ant, I have a conspiracy for you in Soulsborne. Okay, well, fuck. Don't have to tell me twice. I love me a good conspiracy, so I could usually end up screaming about it. Uh, all right. Uh, all right. What do we got? All right. Um... Let's hear this conspiracy. Uh, it's a Metroidvania map. Um, I'm assuming this is from a Castlevania game. It says, uh, Red Scarf, a talisman from Hakuba Shrine, said to suppress Dark Souls. Uh-huh. So that's why that game never came out. It's all because of Castlevanias. <laughs> yeah, so blame it on the Castlevanias. I... Which Castlevania is this? Uh, the one that Oh, okay. So I think I understand. Oh, and look, and look at this. The Elfin Robe. But Elfin Robe is one letter away from Eldin Robe. And Robe starts with the letter R and is four letters just like the word ring okay so what i'm saying is that there's an axe and an axe is a weapon that you can use in elden ring which is coated in elfin robe and also there's a red scarf which is said to suppress dark souls therefore uh elden ring is in fact a sequel to the dark souls Confirmed. There, I do a good job of unpacking your theory. Lois. <laughs> you got it, sir. Oh, come on, I jumped on that. Those Wait things look yes, like, um, Opa Opa. Wait. What you're, what you're saying is, is you're playing Castlevania Dawn of Sorrow. Now, Dawn has four letters in it and starts with the letter D, which is just like the word dark. Castlevania games are also notoriously difficult, so you could almost say that Castlevania games are the Dark Souls games of oh, the Metroidvania seer, uh, the Metroidvania uh, genre. Then, also... <laughs> That's how we do it. God, you told me to come down here. No! <laughs> Just like, this is what you would have missed out on if I did not force you to throw some for your prank. Oh, oh my goodness. Shit, that... <laughs> okay, at least I figured out how to get past there. I just gotta yeah. make sure I get the jumps right. Mm. Yeah, I think Justin, you saw that, right? No, I didn't. I was. Oh, 
You were Ooh, playing? That was close. Yeah, no, I, in the middle of my conspiracy theory linking uh, Castlevania Dawn of Sorrows to Dark Souls, um, Sam redeemed we delete our Twitch. <laughs> I mean, I don't disagree with him. DS is the Dark Souls of Nintendo handhelds. In other words, you're welcome. And holy shit, I didn't even think about that. And then there's the 3DS, which if you take the 3 and you move it after the DS, you get Dark Souls 3, which means that Dark Souls 3 is coming to 3DS next year, baby. I mean, there is already a Dark Souls on DS. Wait, there Dark was? Souls, bro. Dark you... Souls was ported to 3DS? I just said Bleach Dark Souls. That's literally what it's called. Oh, Bleach Dark Souls. We okay. actually had the Dark Souls of anime games. <laughs> well, hold on a second. I know it's a fighting game, but is it hard? Uh, it can be. <laughs> I, I don't know what that emote is that Sam just just shared, but it implies suffering, and I'm, I'm, I'm here for that. <laughs> not sure if it's that's a man that says, "Well, I took a gamble." Oh my goodness! And I was wrong. <laughs> oh my goodness, no! So what Nick is really saying? <laughs> Sam is just finding every morbid face that he can to express his displeasure with this conversation. <laughs> Oh god, you're on a rec like it was like a giant oh, I thought it was a recorder, but no, it was like one of those I'm saying party. Yeah, that's the that's the that's the thing. <sighs> Woo! Okay. Laugh are right. good. So, what do I do for this? I'm like being fucking held in suspense here. I cannot wait for what Nick is really saying. I hope that he just, like, stops typing whatever it is. And then pretends to forget. Oh, I'm supposed to hop over this. Okay. <laughs> What's All even right. crazier, though, about Castlevania DS is that you are fighting creatures of the night, just like in Dark Souls. Why can't I blow on the whistle? Uh... Oh, oh. I'm supposed to go to the other side. Oh my goodness! I had it! Okay. Okay. I got it. Alright, here we go. Nick's finally finished. The words Dark and Souls are two of the most common MacGuffin buzzwords used in video games ever. Which makes Dark Souls the ultimate distillation of every video game MacGuffin into the MacGuffin game of MacGuffin games. I mean, to be fair, the, the name Dark Souls is as generic as it gets for fantasy. It Not is, gonna lie. It is pretty fucking generic sounding. Like, it's, a, it, it's so generic that you honestly... It, it could be a mobile game. Yeah. It could, it could honestly be, like, if there was a mobile game called Dark Souls, I'd believe that in a, in a fucking second. Has anyone ever else noticed that, like, 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 mobile games have the most generic names that are devoid of creativity? And I don't understand why. Yes, Justin summed it up, but I was being over dramatic reasons. Also, I have another question. If you were to... If you were to... Use the word souls... In a game title, do you think FromSoft uh, would come after no. you? Probably not. So if I called my if I called my game Flaming or Burning Souls, um, and I called my game Burning Souls, you don't think that FromSoft would come after me on that? No, 
Do you know how many indie games have the name Souls in it? Okay. You can call your Ooh. game <laughs> Souls and it's legal. Oh my god. Honestly, you probably could. <laughs> Blade and Soul is an MMO that is quite large for one. Oh god, it's a giant recorder. He's hopping along a giant recorder. There we go. Alright, so like once I figured out how to get past that, this wasn't so bad. Wait, did that say 69 seconds left? I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> I could have sworn it did. I know. You know, just in case it did, I'm going to type it nice. Just, I mean, it's just nice that I completed the level. There's so. nothing thing you can't. Wow, what a beautiful garden. I want a garden just like this when I retire. I just don't understand why this game felt the need to steal the cuckoo sound effect from Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask. It just... I don't think oh, that boy, was boy, right. boy, 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 I mean, boy. they probably just played Chicken Dot Wave. Uh -huh. Hi, James. How are you? Now, can I go into the water? I'm going to assume no. Assume the James just popped in and then immediately left. Just yes. like him. Yes, he did. Bubble booey, bubble booey. Yep, I, I can't go into the water like that. Pity. Uh... Hmm. Oh, that's what I gotta do. Oh, that's actually really cool. What's really cool? That the puzzle. Hopping. Y'all know me, I'm all about that sick level design. You seem to legitimately be enjoying yourself playing this and Whenever you're happy playing a game, that makes me happy. Oh, I just like that the the puzzles are creative. So if they're too close, you'll be flattened. I wonder if there's a way to stop it. Perhaps. Oh, 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 oh. What? Uh, James, how's your Friday evening going, my friend? Oh my goodness. It's just wow. gonna keep on okay. attacking me. I, I believe this enemy is what you'd call bullshit. Come on, come on, come on, there's some time up there. No! Oh. Okay. I mean, honestly, this gets a lot of fun, and I don't mind having controllable characters. Honestly, it's probably easier this way. <laughs> It doesn't seem to be that impossible. No, it's, it's not. Certainly, like I feel like if you're if you were a drummer, this game would be easy as shit to you. Because they 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 desynchronize all the time. Oh, that's the the thing you were talking about that you thought was a really cool solution. Mm -hmm. Yes, I see it now. Okay. <laughs> James says I like weekend. James, do you have any cool stories from school, like of any of your children doing anything stupid? She's got plenty of those. I would love to hear. I would love to hear like a like a good uh, student X did stupid Y at this point. Like I just, I would love a, a good story like that. Oh my goodness, I am getting destroyed. Stop trying to jump into the chubby sun yeah. stroker thingy. Okay, let's try it again. It's 
called the Elden Ring. All right, let's restart that. That's fine. Ah, James says he does have a story from today. Ooh, I do love stories. Current events, even. All right. It's a sequel to the weekday. Uh, James, if you want to pop into voice chat to tell the story, you are welcome to do so. Or if you'd rather type it out, you can do that as well, and I'll read it for you. It's story time with James. No. <laughs> There's a problematic kid in my school. Let's say his name is Bobby for privacy purposes. Dang it, Bobby! So he says things to harass teachers and is just insane. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh. I, uh, when I was in high school, we had a, we had a guy like that. <clears throat> that was a good amount of our grade, as James would probably tell you. So he would go, like, eat my laptop or some nonsense. <laughs> That's not the funny part. Okay. Eat well, my laptop? <laughs> eat my laptop. <laughs> I don't know if you guys heard Robin just now, but he said, The sequel to Eat My Calculator. Finally! <laughs> he always ends whatever he says with, I'm Bobby. So it's kind of like you ending the things that you say with, I'm nice. So he'll be like, Eat my laptop. I'm Bobby. I don't know why, but I'm like, in my head, I'm reading that in, in like, like Bobby from King of the Hell's voice, so I'm like, like, eat my laptop. I'm Bobby. I'm not doing any homework. I'm Bobby. Dang it, Bobby. I told you you need to do your homework. The only way to reinforce the lessons you learned in class today. I don't know, Dad. <laughs> Waluigi, bait, bait, bait. There we go. You did it! Mm. Yeah, I earned that drink. <laughs> James says, how about this? How about what? Oh no! Oh my goodness! It's like Bowser in the, in the fire sea. Okay. Alright, yeah. We'll go one at a time. <laughs> her out by accident. Yeah. Today I was emailed unprompted by a student a photoshopped picture of Muslim explorer uh, Ibn Battuta wearing airpods with not written or with no written message. They all that all they sent me without any context. Oh that's all they sent me without any context. So, so this is Bobby who who said this said this to you, or another student? So, just another student sent a Photoshop picture of a Muslim explorer in Batuta wearing iron pots with no written message, and they all sent me, and that's all they sent without any context. So, I, I can imagine like you getting that and being like, 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 uh, Tim, T uh, Jimothy, Jimothy, what the fuck is this? Why did you send this to me? Another kid, yeah, so Jimothy. Okay. We'll call this one Jimothy. <laughs> Jedediah. Jedediah, wh 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 what is this? <laughs> Dang your antics. 
It's so strange. Like, like I hear stories like this of James, of James in the classroom, and I'm like, now, are his students reflective of, his, of James's insanity, or is James reflective of his students' oh, insanity? Oh, okay. Yeah, you got a catapult. Yeah. There we go. Yeet! That's really cool. If I didn't just fall over like that. Over okay. Okay, that's, that's fine. A learn it, 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 like, like in many FromSoft games, there's a learn like yep. a lot of it is trial and error, learning, and that's 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 good actually. Yeah, I think it if anything it builds to the sense of satisfaction when you finally beat the level. Yeah, and it helps that like these puzzles are actually pretty cool for the most part. Though I say that now, watch the final level be some bullshit. I mean, it's a FromSoft game. That was a guarantee, regardless. You know what? That works. They can go that way. That Bobby story is really funny. I'm Bobby. <laughs> They're in high school. He teaches high school history. T he teach. <clears throat> yeah, and like, and like, it's high. It, it's it's high school history, which I'm not gonna lie. I'm like low key jealous of because. James is living one of the many, like, dreams I would have, like, or paths I would have considered going down at one point in my life. Like, if I was going to be a teacher at all, history is absolutely what I would have taught. I would have come in, when we got to, like, United States history, I would have come in with, like, a, like a colonial wig on and would have been like, Yes, yes, you see the British were raising the taxes again. And we just said, I don't have it anymore. I don't stay <laughs> Wait, step on the keys to duplicate the sample melody, then you can move forward. No, they don't. No, the students would probably find it hysterical, and then I'd probably be widely and highly regarded. That, that, that was the thing. The more of a personality you had in my high school, the one I grew up in, the more of a personality you had, and the more oh. like different you were from the other teachers, the more you were commonly regarded as cool. A better, you were just a better teacher. Forget to move the other one. Yeah. So, okay. I'm gonna no. have to look this one up. So I have to replicate the tune. It's just that it's kind of hard. Hold um, on a second. Let me let me listen to it. All right. So you're gonna start with the the left. Oops. I already fucked it up. Sorry. No, it's okay. All right, so that's going to be the top one on the far right. On the far right? Yeah. I can't jump on that. No, no, no. The top, the, the, the one to the right. So this one? With the, the green? One. Yeah, to the right. And then the next is... Uh, um, between the two, between the two bottom black ones on the right side. Between the two bottom black ones on the right side. So, do I go right or left? Uh, left. Down. Left. Mm-hmm. 
One more. Okay. Nope, you already fucked up. Okay. Uh, hit the button again. I actually did it. Yeah! Uh, okay. But I have five seconds left. You got this! Totally. <laughs> oh no! Oh god damn it, I didn't mean to hit quit. No! Oh, oh don't no. Tell me, don't tell me I gotta Please, do that whole world again. God, don't tell me you don't need to do the whole world again. Okay, phew, I got- okay. That's good, I can select it. Okay, Whew. crisis averted. Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit, I think that would have been the end of the stream, right? <laughs> and I think that the tunes are random, too. That's what, I, yeah, it was random. It changed every time, which is why I was listening to it. And then, like, yeah, the I'm gonna need court. your help for that because it's hard for me to do that while listening to the capture audio. It so, would, yeah, it would help if I, if I retained the piano lessons I took when I was 12 better. Yeah, I'm gonna need you guys' help, and when I get to that part, I'm gonna need some quiet. <laughs> that was not smart. I gotta do one at a time for this. Yeah. I gotta do one at a time for this part. If you get that golden clock thing... You get 50 extra seconds. It's just I'm bad at getting it. I love how I just turned around and looked at you. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't do anything. It was like, it was like eh, he's a little far. Not this time. You cut me some slack. Okay. Honestly, yes. Also, yes, am I fine, please? Alright. Here, go with me. Listen. Which oh, ones? What? Do you want me to reset it? Uh, yeah, I'm sorry. I wasn't paying attention. Do it again. Uh, um, last one on the right, closest to the middle. After that thing is done molesting you. Oh, okay, that wasn't was it. Yep. That was not it. Yeah, I, I, part of it's... Okay, middle and the bottom. On um, the left or right side? Left. Middle. Mm hmm. Wrong. Okay. Oh. It was. Yeah. Um. I'm. I'm trying to learn the the keys. Uh, I'm gonna say the second one. Uh, from the from the right. So. Um, in between the two black keys on the top. Yes, right there. What? Okay. Alright. Far right. Far right. Okay, okay that's one. Uh, I'm gonna say, uh, the next one down. <laughs> Um, yeah, so, no. that one? Nope, okay. Alright, hit it again. Alright, bottom. Bottom this, one. This like, one? bottom, bottom, bottom left. F bottom, yeah, bottom left. This one? No, no, to the far left. To the far left. Nope. Oh, okay. That should be easy. Um, it's it's uh, it's all on the bottom side, and it's just go go down from right, middle, left. Right, middle, left. Yeah. Or I'm I'm an idiot. I don't I don't fucking know. 
thing's hard, dude. Alright, this is what I'm gonna say to do. When, when we inevitably have to do this again, uh, real fast, just play all of the notes for me so I can kind of try and memorize their sound. Yeah, that's what I would do. Just, oh my goodness, okay. Yeah, we gotta redo this anyways. Time up. Yeah. Let, let, let's, let's tackle it that way next time. Because I'm trying to, I'm trying to try and figure out, like, what note that is and where that corresponds on the keyboard. Yeah. The world ends with you. Fuck. Yeah, it's one of those things, like, it wouldn't be so bad if I was playing this off stream, but having to listen to the capture. Mm -mm. Oh, damn it. I, I moved there by accident. Okay. If you don't want your berries, I'll take them. Okay, cool. Fish them out and just put them in here. Okay. Let's just listen to the notes. Alright? Yep, let's do it. Okay, go ahead and play something. Alright, that's gonna be right, uh, far right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then it's gonna be uh, the middle one between the two between the two um, black keys on the bottom on the right side. So, so third one from the right. So this... Oh, third yes. one from the right. Okay. Okay, one more. Alright. On the... It's gonna be uh, right, down. Down. Uh, this one? And, uh, f far right. Far, far, right, far on right on the left. On the left? Far right on the left. This one? On the left. Okay. No. No. Justin, it's it's the third from the right. So the okay. No 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 no. Said no. third from the right. That yeah, you was the same one. Yeah, um That was third from that the right. That was third from the right. Yeah. I meant third from the left. I panicked. I was gonna say it should be on the left this time. Because that was a much lower note. All right, so let's do. All right, that's gonna be bottom. Uh, we need to assign these keys names. Bottom left on the. Or how about you just tell me like third from the yeah exactly just do it like third from the left, third from the right. Be like left one, third from the left. I don't know, like that will make sense to me. Or go like a king chart even if you want. <laughs> I don't know. Or just number them. We could say, like, this could be number one, number two, number three. All right, okay. then we'll do that. We'll Four, do that. From left, right, five, 12, six, please. seven. All right, let's number them and let's give it one more shot. All right. All right. Oh. Hmm. Seven on one side. Seven? Five on the other. No, no, no. That's one. Okay. Okay. So we're gonna do oh, one from. Oh, we're going from the right. Oh, yeah, okay. I, yeah, I said this will right. be one, two, three. Okay. So how about this? Cream side will be one. All right, and then cookie side will be seven. That work? Yes. Yes. Because I'm going from high notes to low notes in my mind. So that's why I'm I'm counting from I'm counting like. I guess from left to right, it'd be seven to one. This game is vicious with its fucking, like... With its like, oh, you, you held still for exactly 0 0.0001 seconds too long. Can we look this up on Parsec? 
I wanna play. Now the funny part is, I think I'd actually play better by myself than with someone else. Probably. Alright, come on, Cream. Beat these guys. Alright, cool. No, we're not doing too bad at this level, anyways. Yeah, Cream these guys, Cream. Ooh, that was close. I almost ran right off. Alright. Okay. Alright. Are we ready? Uh huh. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Okay, key number one. Okay, I'm an asshole. Uh, hit the button again. Hit the change. Okay, got it. Alright, so we're going from highest to lowest, right? Um, so it's gonna be. Key number three. Three. Okay, I was wrong. I meant two. All right. <laughs> yeah, please. I thought it might be two. Yeah, it really doesn't fucking help. Also, I couldn't hear that one. Just yeah, reset. that's fine. We'll reset. It's different every time. Huh? Well, I hit the right one that time. Yep. Dun. What? No. Okay. And then it's All on right. the other side. Three. Three. Hit n no, number three. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Yep, there you go. Let's oh, go. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking guessing music right here. Does each so I meant to ask? Does each one of them get like a stick of their own? Yes. Like one gets the right stick, one gets the left stick. Yes. And then that's they exactly jump the R two and that's, okay. Go oh, boys. Let's zoom in the camera a bit. Oh, come on. Get out of the way. No! I'd like to apologize to the audience. Um, like, my brain knew what buttons to press, but I could not effectively communicate that to Justin. <laughs> I'm never asking Ant for directions <laughs> anywhere. <laughs> to be fair, I don't ask myself for directions anywhere. Um, Oh, I'm suddenly Oh, driving come up on! I had that. I'm basically the Joker now. <laughs> I'm the Juggernaut. Also, hi, Nick. Okay, cool. Hi. Perfect. I was cooking, but now I'm eating. So I thought I would join. The I was boss is just up ahead. Anyway. This fight will be a little bit different. It seems all you have to do is hit the pipes where the legs are placed, but that won't be enough. Not only do you have to hit the pipes on which the legs are placed, but you also have to hit them at the same time. <laughs> all right. Mm. Early rich. Mm. It takes right. the top. Damn, that's quite a. Oh, it's a stage. Yeah. Oh, is that Marks in the corner? Oh wait, never mind. That's Sunflower. Not Marks, the the God version of. Yeah, God version of. Anyway. I think you mean Nova. Yeah. You're thinking of Nova. Yeah, that's who I was trying to think of the name of. <laughs> this really <laughs> is like really awkward of time. He fuses. He fuses with Marks. Yeah. I, I like oh, the uh, the boss names. It's it's very Zelda like. Oh, we get a oh, hammer. He really fused, his remnants fuse in in the true arena version where Marx's uh, soul merges with. Yeah, okay, I, I see what you mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. As, as someone who knows how to read music, that was painful. I say, then why weren't you in the fucking? Yeah, I was gonna now? say. Wait, who said that? Wait, Blanca. You had to play it by ear. There was no music to be read that I saw. Yeah. And to be okay. fair, I am also listening to this on a delay. If this was just by myself, it would have been fine. Offline, I could definitely get through this. I think they said um, we have to big... hit them at the same time. We mean to say you're big leaguing us? I know, right? Game? Um... It said that we have to hit it at the same time? Is that how that was supposed to work? 
you gotta face the music. F A C E, every good boy does fine. Yeah. Ow, get. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, oh okay. I'm thinking of that big, uh, what was the name of the Cadence of our Roll enemy that's a big glockenspiel dragon or whatever? Oh! Oh my goodness! I just realized now! So, they inverted the freaking characters. Holy shit. Yeah, I see. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, you mean they put... Yeah, they put them on different sides. Yeah, but, like, the control scheme's the same. Oh... So now you're Lord playing like, have mercy. Now you're playing as if you're confused in a video game. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> that is pretty funny though. I like that. Oh, 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 oh wait, okay. Other way. Yeah, we gotta do it like that. Well, this okay. has been a delightful dining experience, wouldn't you say, my dear boy? Mm. <laughs> Hello, Dixon. Thank you for watching over my water. Never touch the stuffed fish fuck in it. <laughs> Shut up. Um, yeah, who knew that the... That should be a headcanon. Who, who knew that FromSoft would be a music game? <laughs> Honestly, Under like, protest. looking at this at a glance, this Under game looks protest. like... At a glance, this game looks like a Mario Party minigame or something. It does! Like a Mario time, Party a Mario Party mini game, or uh, God, something else too. Crash Bandicoot level, but split in two. Yeah. No, there was something else that reminds me of. I cannot uh, place my hand on it though. Is it another mini game thing, or is it like something else altogether? Maybe I I don't know. It definitely controls like a Mario Party minigame, play it that much. I had a feeling it did. Tell y'all what? Tell y'all what? If you were the loneliest Mario Party player and were just playing against yourself because you didn't want to go against computers, I guess. But that was kind of a cool boss fight though. Then you got stuck in like dungeon duos as like your um, minigame or something like that. Actually, oh, some, sometime tonight. I would say that what we should do is, before we all go to bed, we, we pop in Mario Party, and we there's this mini game that I really want to play, like, on stream, and huh? I think it would just be a lot of fun, because this game, this mini game is my favorite mini game, and it's the stupidest fucking mini game, but it is just so much fucking fun to play, and it is Bowser's Big Blast. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. That that I, I remember you saying that before. And the reason it's so much fun is because it is Russian roulette, but in a way that won't kill you. And it, it is, blows you away. Yeah, it, but it's it's so much fun. R Russian roulette is also what 100 years early calls this channel, which is pretty funny actually. It is actually really funny. <laughs> He's like, oh, it's Russian. I'm like, yeah, that's yeah, <laughs> Russia. That's right, comrade. We uh, we here to play the retro video games on this Russian roulette. <laughs> I love this rooster. If you try to walk across it, you'll die for sure. Right. <laughs> Prepare to die. Uh, so basically, what you're saying is this is a FromSoft game, and this is now Dark Souls. Cookie and cream. Shadows died twice. Mm -hmm. I might be playing that later tonight. Um, so I, I gotta actually, I got a question. Oh, the cat's have, eye hurt me. Or actually, at least Justin has played it's Sekiro. Tough. I know. So I have not played it. I have not. I wish I, I. I honestly think I maybe should give it a try sometime, but I get the feeling that I'll play it for five minutes and go, nope, no. Nope. Oh, it's so fun, but it like, is. I got to this one boss. Damn it. That, like, I, I technically am able to move past it to the next boss, because the next boss is just, like, right around the corner. I actually went and saw. But, um, there's an optional boss I want to beat, and I almost have, like, multiple times. But the reason he is so much more difficult for me than any other boss in that game so far is because I cannot figure out his tail. 
I can't figure out when he's about to strike, and by the time I see that he is, it's too late to, like, actually do the, the deflection most of the time. So instead, I go in and I just have to, like, keep on hitting deflect whenever I think he's going to strike, and half the time I miss, like, the stuff, because he has, like, almost... He, it feels like he has almost no Q at all. Like, it's, um... I forget what his name is, but he's, like, up in this dojo, and he does, like, Iado style with his sword. Like, where he, he just, tried. like, draws from the hip and, like, does two super fast, two or three super stri fast strikes, but I can't tell when he's going to draw, but because by the time he rears back to do it, it's already too late to hit the button, it feels like. Have you talked to Sam about it? I haven't. But I was going to ask him. I just thought about it now, because I got. Would probably oh, be it's when I release it. Okay. Oh, yeah, it feels like he doesn't have a tail. Uh, like normal have, bosses do. I have played many FromSoft games. Um, at this point, I have played Dark Souls Three and Bloodborne, and I have played enough of them to know that some bosses, even if you've, even if they've got their, you can see their tail. It doesn't help. Well, like, yeah, in three, just, they do sometimes that, like, you just have well, to. That wasn't so bad. The thing is, in Dark Souls anything. three, like, it's hard to know when exactly the the strike is going to land because a lot of times in Dark Souls three, especially, they have a tail, but then they delay their strike on purpose, like randomly. So that's what that's the thing that kind of actually annoys me in dark souls 3 a lot of times is there's a lot of bosses it's like okay it's clear the tail was there but he delayed the strike just to fuck with you um but like in this game it's been mostly more clear about what the tail is like it's it's a lot lot more obvious in sekiro like when exactly because you just oh that's actually so funny. see when the blade's about to hit but with this guy, you can't even see the blade because he's so fast. And I'm just like, I don't know. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do. So I'll probably have to ask Sam about that later. That's a pretty cool little mechanic. Cool. Nice little Wait, puzzle. Supposed to, oh, I was supposed to just walk through it. So one thing that's pretty cool is that like the little enemies that come attacking when I stand still, they change with each world. That's cool. Yeah. <laughs> I like the design of these little scorpion dudes, too. Oh, yeah, they look nice. Yeah. Wait, was there, like, a totem pole in the desert? I'm confused. Well, there were some native tribes that lived in, the in, in like, the Central America deserts. Yeah, that's true. That's true. I don't, I like, it was just kind of a, it felt like weird placement for it. But, yeah, now that I'm seeing the rest, it does look like one of those kind of, one of those tribes. Yeah, like, think Aztec. Oh man, how did that hit me from up there? Aztec would be like in Mexico. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, but they the Aztecs were a native tribe, and yeah, but that looks more like a north like a North American tribe kind of totem. I mean, Mexico but I mean, is in North America. It's in Central America, technically. Mexico is in North America, dude. Okay. Yeah. I, I mean, it sorta of is. No, it it is it, it, is one of the it Hold on a minute. I'm 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 going to Google this right now for you. I'm not that worried about it, but okay. Is Mexico? I mean, I guess it's in North America. Oh, here we go. Mexico. What? Anyway, Google says, Mexico, officially the United Mexican States, is a country in the southern portion of North America. <laughs> well, okay. There we go. Central America Central America is not actually a continent. I believe it, Central I'll America is considered part of North America, if I recall correctly. I didn't say it was. I didn't know there was, like, a technical specification we had. We had yeah, I had to go f by on what that was. I was just like, did not think about it that way, is all I was saying. Allergies, dear Nick. I just realized I have been using the wrong voice for the entirety of this conversation. Yeah, that's I was going to say. When you correct me, please do it like with with a little more gumption and style. Uh, um, I need the extra. 
I, I'd love to be extra insulted whenever I'm being corrected. It's great. <laughs> oh, I know. Oh, that's actually pretty cool. I was just, like, surprised to see it in, like, a desert level, I guess. Because, like, I don't... Like, while there are plenty of tribes that, yeah, live in areas that were, like, deserty, for, like, the the vibe of desert in video games, usually it's not something I think of, like, being there, is what I was actually trying to get at with that comment. What you're saying is that the totem pole was used more by northern tribes as opposed to by southern tribes. Uh, the ones that look like that, I've usually seen, like, northern, more northern tribes, yeah. Okay. I That's actually, all I'm I also googled it, and you're not wrong. Um, North the the totem poles were used by Northwest tribes, and um, the tribes. I'm I'm probably gonna butcher the pronunciation here, but I'm gonna do my best. Uh, the tribes that use totem poles, so like in Montana, and Nebraska, them. and such. It says Northwest. I'll I'll get more okay, well, geographic in, this, a, in, in a moment, but the uh, the tribes were the 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 Tinglet tribe, the Haida tribe, the Bellacula tribe, the Quaquitul tribe, uh, the Simshian tribe, and the West Coast tribe. Hmm. Um, let me see where. Let me see where where where, where are these. I don't know those tribes as well, so I could not, like, tell you if you pronounce them right or not, to be honest. I, I can guarantee you the only one I pronounced correctly was the West Coast Tribe. <laughs> <laughs> maybe I got the Haida Tribe right, but maybe. That, that's a hard maybe. Could be. Could be. Um, that one sounded like could be. Hey, so... it's the Parquet Wood up! Hi, Stuffin'. I'm trying to figure out where the northwest, northwest coast. So, oh, that's bullshit. That oh, actually yeah. reminded me of something. We we were um, in Nick, school. Nick, you were right on the money. Like, like totem poles were not in the south at all, or the southern desert regions, or at all. Like this, you're right on the money with that. I was, I was thinking like maybe there. there was a chance like in like the tribes around like the Death Valley area, maybe there were some that might have had some, but I'd only heard of, like, ever heard of, like, northern tribes having them, was the reason I was like, that's kind of, like, feels out of place there. Then again, this is, is just, like, good. a random island, so, I mean... That's true. Who knew, who knew we would learn so much from Cookie and Cream? Uh, the name of the Death Valley tribe oh, damn, are I called completely the, uh, messed that up. Timbishia. Yeah, I, okay. Ooh, okay. Okay, I, I get that now. They look kind of like cat, giant cactar. Yeah, I was going to say, those are like cactars and gyroids put together or something. Yeah, they also do look like gyroids. Which, those both look pretty similar in some ways, but yeah. That said... Uh, I want to reiterate, this is on an island, guys. I don't think it's no. adhering to reality. Okay, We're playing a but... game about two <laughs> bunnies jumping on scorpions. Okay, and you guys are trying to, games. well, actually, the desert. I'm going to go Kotaku <laughs> here and say, the game appropriates the cultural icons of the Northwest tribes in their... <laughs> Uh, what the fuck did I just walk into? They're trying to, well, we have a bunch of people, well, actually, the desert. Kotaku, no, I was I was genuinely curious. I was genuinely curious. It was not like a, the, my, the whole reason to start is because I was surprised to see a totem pole in the level. I wasn't like, oh, I'm actually totem poles are in the desert kind of thing. I was just like, oh, wow, there's a totem pole there? That's kind of like not expected. And then it got into um erm actually territory, so <laughs> but we also learned something from it, so it's okay. Okay, yes. cool, great. Hey Ant, can I speak to you in the other chat for a minute? Yeah, sure, hang on a second. Let me uh jump in. Ants All right, cool. in trouble, Ant and okay. Also hi everyone. Uh -oh. <laughs> I'll, be, I'll be right back. Fuck 'em up, uh, Sam. What was I gonna say? <laughs> oh wait, alright. 
let's jump up here. Can I get that? Yeah! <laughs> I know, he's about to be in trouble. Sam's okay, but what if we took Bikini Bottom and pushed it somewhere else? <laughs> I was, gonna, oh, I was I just like, it's, no, okay, no, I didn't. it is funny, um, but there are a lot of cactus-themed, like, creatures that do just happen to look very much alike. Between Cactar, Togemon, and I guess gyroids aren't really that, but, you know, gyroids are actually based on, like, the clay statues, I think, aren't they? Yeah, um, there's... Aren't they, like... Was that which which one was that? Yeah, is it um Honeywa? I think. Ink? Oh yeah, may have been. I can't remember which particular group. I'm that like was pretty that. sure it was the Honeywa statues that the gyros are based off of. I could uh, be completely wrong on that, but I think I read that somewhere. Yeah, I remember reading about it um, somewhere, and I cannot figure out what it was yeah it's Haniwa you were right mm. um awesome. they're buried with the the ancient ancient Japanese sculptures that were buried with the dead wow Animal Crossing uh making your ability to dig them up in Animal Crossing world is a little morbid wait that's uh oh that's interesting one. <laughs> uh, Wait, what? Let me see. In the Japanese version of the game, gyroids are just called Haniwa. Like, straight oh, so up. They don't even have, like, a fancy name. Yeah, which, I mean, it translates to clay cylinder, but still. I mean, I like the name gyroid a lot more. I do too. Although I'm sure there's some localization nerd out there who's like, I am the fucked it up. That's funny because I was reading a <laughs> Legends of Localization article earlier today, but because that video that I linked mm -hmm. earlier that we were both watching um, brought up the Tales of Fantasia, um, infamous Tales of Fantasia fan dub, and they actually, there's actually an article where they were. Um, uh, on Legends of Localization, oh. where they were discussing, Frame. like, the actual differences and such, and, like, why, and what was the actual intent of that scene? Uh, I, oh, sorry, also, Subpark so 8, is Justin, I think Justin's right, sounds familiar, I think I saw that Gaijin Goomba vid. Yeah, it's kind of wild. Okay, yeah, sorry about that, Steven. Oh, I think Or Lenny. But yeah, like, um... It was the line from Tales of Fantasia that... I, the reason I looked this up in the first place, because in the video, she put that she had to skirt around naming the fan translation group, because their name sounds like a... is like, either accidentally or intentionally, we don't know, mm -hmm. um, a little racist? <laughs> but, um... Anyway... That group had apparently translated a part of Tales of Fantasia to have one of the characters say, say, I bet she fucks like a tiger. And I was like, actually looking and it was like, they just went like, that in that fan translation, they just went way over the top with everything. Yeah, dang. It was more like there was a light suggestion of, uh, it was actually not even... That line was insane because, like the uh, like the basic translation, was just like, oh, uh, they were they were talking about two the their two girl party members and they're like, um, what it was like, oh, this one is prim and proper and has a nice calmness to her, but uh, this one is hard to turn down too is like the basic translation, but then like they translate it to. I bet they, I bet Arch fucks like a tiger. Oh no. <laughs> I was like, my god, that is way extra. Speaking of localization um, discourse, there's like, there's some folks online right now who are kind of screaming about the Tokimeki Memorial. 
patch. Oh yeah, the fan. Yeah, because are they, they decided mad about something or are they. Yeah, speak? because they didn't leave the name Tokimeki in the title. Oh yeah, because they called it Heartthrob. Yeah. yeah. And people it's... like. It's one of those things where I'm like, I mean. That's it's... the literal translation, basically. Yeah, and I think it's one of those things that's just kind of okay. Like, it, it, it's fine. Yeah, it's not. It's not a maker, but uh, people always do this kind of shit. It's uh, that whole they didn't translate it like close enough is like very annoying. I get in some cases where they make something that's a completely different context in the game, like not that mm -hmm. or something like that, where they're like like in this situation I just mentioned, they they took it way far. Like, I guess if you want to be, like, really extra, you can do that, but, like, the actual game, it's, it, the, the game's original dialogue was very, like, not, was not even suggesting anything like that. Yeah. Um, That's, like, some work and design went, shit right there. Yeah, it was, it was just, like, they went, like, way overkill with it, and, like, it, it's, like, a case in which it could paint a completely different, like, picture of the character. <laughs> like, a, it, because, like, in the actual translation, they were showing, oh, they were a lot more, like, they, like, modest mm -hmm. about this whole thing. These characters aren't like that, but they, it, it just felt like really, like, a weird out-of-character moment, rather, yeah. for some of the translations they did, that they were showing. And I think that's a case in which, like, you can actually go a little too far and, like, n not exactly ruin something, but maybe, like, well, okay, maybe in some cases, yeah, just ru straight up ruin. But, um, most situations, it's just like, eh. They were talking about another game on that video called, like, um, what was it, like, Lady Minerva or something like that? Oh, yeah, or, Lady Minerva. I played, yeah. I played that for a little bit. <laughs> well, they said that the fan translation, like, actually put a note the the fan uh, the fan translators put a note out they were like hey listen we took some creative liberties in the dialogue here because the majority of this dialogue is the exact same thing over and over again so we threw in just like a few jokes and stuff here and there to break up the you know just like the mundanity because it was literally just we would have been writing the same thing over and over again if not yeah there's sometimes where I actually like when fan chances do that, or what they'll do is they will release two patches. One that's like a 90s localization style patch where they kind of like go crazy, and then one that's uh, closer to the Japanese original. Like the Samurai Pizza yeah. Cats Famicom game, which by the way, y'all should check out. That game's actually really good. I think I've heard good yeah, things it's, about Yeah, it was by Tecmo. It's, it's like really good. Uh, I actually have a physical copy of it upstairs. Uh, I got very lucky with it because it's kind of a sought-after game. But, like, yeah, so you can get that yeah. game. Um, play the ROM of that. It's pretty cool. They have two fan translations for it. They have one that's, like, that's done the way the old Samurai Pizza Cats cartoon was done. And then they have one that's closer to the Japanese original. Yes, Steven. You've never heard... Hey, wait. Yeah, Samurai Steven, Pizza you've, Cats. You've, you've heard of Samurai Pizza Cats, right? It was, that's like... exactly what it's called. Yeah, I was going to say, is like, if you haven't... Just keep in mind, hmm. this came around in the same era as Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Yeah. So, you've probably seen it before, because I saw it as a kid. I also, mean. I love how this, <laughs> they said, this one confuses some people. You know it's bad when a FromSoft game has to tell you, yeah, this one's this one confuses folks. <laughs> oh, yeah, that just, <laughs> my God. But Man, you don't have I to jump believe... to grab the rope. All you have to do is press the action button. So... I was gonna say we've been well. I'll, I'll save this because I want I want to. Well, I'll read I'll read Steven's other car comment here in a second. Hi, Steven. Because I want to say real quick. I can't believe all this time we were saying how is this connected to Dark Souls? No, this is connected to Sekiro because it's a rhythm game. <laughs> <laughs> oh, true. In okay. a sense, yeah. Uh, but no, uh, Steven said earlier, and I, I was meaning to get to this comment. Uh, I think I've seen similar discourse with Final Fantasy Tactics, PS1 game being poorly translated. Upstairs, use the restroom. I'll be right but back. But I guess I okay. love it because nostalgia in parentheses, and the PSP version, which is I'm pretty sure more accurately translated, that kind of hated. Yes, 
people make very there, there are crowds of people that make extreme nitpicks about translation mm -hmm. and like some people like the more extreme stuff because they're they, there's like a spectrum when it comes to like the translation uh, in games and, mm -hmm. and there's always going to be groups that will complain about one thing or another and so yeah like you you hear all kinds of shit but there are some that are like held in much higher regard than others. It's just interesting to hear about stuff like that too. Yeah, uh, interesting. In fact, like um, there is a what happened episode about the Trails series and how and unlike most what happens, it was not about the actual making of the game. It was about the localization of the game being the nightmare. Oh, interesting. Oh, yeah. yeah. The, I mean, it the came trails? out good, but holy shit, it took it took a lot. Of, it's an it's a fascinating video. Yeah, there was a lot that went into localizing those trails games. And did if you, you read the, the XC blogs, like the XC blogs, they talk about that a lot too. Did you see the picture of the script, like sitting on the floor in that video? I have. By the way? Well, I've it's seen like... that. I've seen the script, uh, not in that video, but I've seen it like elsewhere. I don't know what picture like, you're talking about. Yeah, it's the one where it's like stacked up to like at least waist high, and it's just like regular paper. Mm-hmm. That's how thick that script oh, in that shit. game was. Uh, I completely messed that up. It's thick. It was thick. Why can't I? Van translations can be kind of charming, yes, but um, like it also kind of like depends in some ways because there are some cases in which you want to. Play a, a game and weird. be immersed in like, uh, like especially like if the character writing is a strong point. A lot of people would not like it as much whenever stuff messes with like the original intent of their characters. I guess. Mm -hmm. But yeah, bad translations can absolutely be very charming. It's not always the literal translation so much as like the actual localization behind it and like how things are portrayed. And that's not always the easiest thing to get across in text in the first place. So, um, if you if you screw with the intent, or not really the intent, but like the tone too much, take too many freedoms, a lot of people don't like that. Yeah, I tend to I tend to side with Steven on this argument. Yeah. As long as you're getting the main point across and there's little sacrifice to it yeah okay that's fine well like like i i, I get that also but oh, I, no. think the, I think the nuance really comes in when it comes to like character development and such like trying to portray characters in games like a certain way and um i I've, I, I understand the argument of like oh if it's localized a certain way this character would sound like a completely different person than what they're intended to be. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, that's you know, what I mean. It's like, as long as you get the main point of the character or the situation across... Oh, yeah, yeah. Then I'm cool with it. But if you're going to completely rip it and, and come out of left field, then, yeah, then that's a problem. Because then you're changing the story. Gotcha. Oh, oh, I see, Steven. The thing about FF7. Yeah, I don't know... Funny little translations in that game that I'm fine with. I mean, yeah. Uh, if it's just, like, some weirdly written sentences every now and then, or some, like, typos or something, that's not, like, a huge deal. I don't care about oh, that. No. Yeah. Also, Steven, did you enter the giveaway? A lot of those old um, Super Nintendo and PlayStation RPGs have some weird translation issues in them. But what's funny is that, like, people will defend them to their death. The same folks who will argue tooth and nail over localization today will be like, oh, but, like, those translations had charm, and... Oh, okay, so... Right. No. Status effect sadness is supposed to be something, like, sedated, which makes way more sense. I always thought that was yeah, weird growing I, up. Yeah, I always thought that was weird, too, that, like, sadness is a status effect. It could be, like... Well, honestly, if it's, like... If it's like oh SMT, where, I, I don't know if this. Yeah. I don't know if this is an in. Oh yes, Steven. Very many SMT games, but I remember in Persona Five you had despair. 
which was actually like the character gets depressed and just yeah. like if you if you go too many turns with despair your character will just like straight up die which i i don't know if that's like they just off themselves or what but <laughs> it's, it's weird <laughs> well i mean i mean they're they're far more oh, nonchalant you know about I... that in japan than they are here oh yes of course oh so. I, I messed this up also, also hi brian right okay hi hi hello Frankie. Jackie. hey Frankie. Bronco. Bronco. <laughs> Spare rib bronco. Oh, I might have messed this up. Yep, I messed that one up. Alright. Bronco's here, gotta go. <laughs> Dang, Steve. Effed up. Honestly, fair. Effed up. Or, um, did, did your sister and Joe leave? Oh, uh, yeah, they both left. Oh, okay. Did you have a nice evening? Yeah, it was fun. You're lying. Oh, okay. You're on edge. Okay. Edging? Oh, What's no! Oh, on? I messed that up. Okay. Alright, alright. We'll restart that. That's fine. You can you can talk to me. This level's Understand. really cool. I gotta say, I really like some of these puzzles. Yeah, it's it's been wacky watching this. One of these days, we will have to do the single controller. Yeah. Okay, I'm back. Hello. Hello. Uh, Brian's mad at me, and he won't tell me why. Oh, dang. Brian, why is your profile picture bargain Ben Walker, Texas Ranger? Are <laughs> uh, you screaming? <laughs> <laughs> okay, before I do that, let me hit this Actively in advance. Huh. So, Pork I said Brinkles here, gotta go? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but he said JK <laughs> with a heart. Oh, really? That didn't load for me. I'm kidding. <laughs> Wait, what do you mean? <laughs> what are you talking about? Okay, so I want her to be in here. Okay, shit. Oh, come on! No, I had that! Damn, now that you're here? Okay. I can so I can ask then. you about um that guy up there in that dojo that is definitely an optional boss, but I still want to beat him in Sekiro. Um, uh, oh, I don't no. go, oh, I almost had he, it. He does like the. Oh, I almost he, had that. He, he does like that Iado style blade where he like draws from the hip thing, you know, and like oh, you can't see so his blade. Okay. So my problem I'm having with him is I don't know when he's going to strike, and I cannot see his tail in time to like the flip. Oh, oh, you mean um, you mean the guy who hits you real quick? Mm -hmm. mm hmm. Oh yeah. Okay. So there's um. Yeah, that's a tricky one. It, basically, the easiest way to take him down is to time your double parries. So he will he will strike you twice, always. I got him down uh, one bar one time. Yeah, yeah. I know it's, I know it's twice, but the problem is I don't know when he's going to strike. And by the time I figured, like every time yeah. that he went to do it, by the time I, time I saw any kind of tail. It was too late. Like I, I hit the bumper and it just would not do it. So I was like, so the yeah. So the trick is, um, his tell is his sword will glint before he strikes. Oh, so look for a little shine at his hip. Oh, okay. that's how you know. Are you guys not that. gonna? Oh wait. Hmm. I was like, I was having the damnedest time trying to figure out where that was. I was like, I, I got, I started basically just like. Tapping the bumper on repeat. One time I actually got him stun locked a bit with the double Ichimanji because I managed to unlock that. Oh wow, you already got that. Awesome. <laughs> yeah, it was Good only shit. like. Good yeah. Shit. It wasn't that expensive actually to get to it, but. Uh, Hell yeah, brother. But like, that doesn't hold up because whenever you restart the Ichimanji, if he 
tries to attack at all between it, you're, you're screwed. So oh yeah, he doesn't he doesn't really give you much of a chance to mm -hmm. to fuck up. Like you got you got to shoot your shot. That was just a very lucky run. <laughs> that yeah. Time. Yeah, no, it it, it but, is un unfortunately the best advice there is it is literally about timing. Like watch out mm -hmm. for the glint, and then just LB LB. Watch out for if, the glint LB LB. If I can, if I can spot the, yeah, if I can spot the glint, I shouldn't have any trouble because whenever I caught it, I got the timing on the strikes right, but I couldn't yeah. tell what the tail was. I was just kind of like, whenever I saw him like get you know in stance, I started like tapping and if i caught it the first time i had my timing well enough where it would block both typically mm -hmm. but um it was actually just trying to figure out when he was going to do it was my big problem with that fight yeah oh shit it's beater hey what's up it's a beater cream and cream. yeah we're, we're playing cookie and cream we hanging out i, I saw I which for many, which for many, before. many, many years was my favorite ice cream flavor. Mine too. Nice. Yeah. I still like it, but. Oh funny. yeah, I I used to love it. Um, growing up, my my aunt and uncle used to take me to a place a couple towns away, that uh, I think it was just called Scoops, that that had an, an amazing cookies and cream milkshake. Zoink scoops. That uh, that I and that I paid for every single time. I I, <laughs> I physically paid for <laughs> every single time I ate it, but it was delicious. Paid for with my own body. With my bowels, yeah, yeah. my bowels. <laughs> Hold on. But it was very, very. Oh, good. that was bullshit. They right. should have. They should have ignited that. What'd you finish, Peter? I caught him, Vinny. Oh, nice. Oh, uh, so did you know that the case cracker is me in the shower? Me in the shower. I. I still, that is actually my favorite part of the entire movie. It's fucking great. The, 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 his delivery of that line is hysterical. The case cracker! You got it. You Me got in the it. shower! <laughs> it's good. Case cracker. Anyway, Justin, guess. Guess who started Monster today? Oh hell yes! Oh my See, god! So. I'm f I'm five episodes in, and I can Isn't tell it, like, awesome? it's gonna be one of my favorite shows ever. Yeah. Yes. It's yes. So good. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Bruce so Sala I don't know how to be a fuck good writer. This part. Yeah. Yeah. I I have heard. Pretty and... excited to see how the anime adaptation oh, of Pluto goes. Oh, I know how this is well. supposed to work. I've heard, I, I mean, I obviously don't know anything about the manga, but I, I've heard it's very faithful. So oh my god, that's good. that's oh, how this monster. works. Okay. Yeah. Well, I mean, I've heard that they're they're supposed to make an anime adaptation of Pluto at some point. Um, soon oh yeah, Pluto Nash, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Um, <laughs> the, oh, cool, okay. The pre-Norbit movie, yeah, who <laughs> knows? <laughs> no. Uh, yeah, it's pretty normal. Normal. Yeah. yeah, I've uh, I've heard that they're supposed to make an anime adaptation of that. I don't know when that's supposed to be coming around, but I hope it's just as good as everyone says Monster is. So, yeah, we'll see, man. Because I've actually read some of Pluto. I need to finish it, but I was trying to get more volumes in it of it, of it, and I just haven't gotten around to getting those yet. Yeah, speaking of which, I just got a, I just got a right stuff package, <laughs> okay. and it's the it's the last package from the summer sale, and I think it's Chainsaw Man Volume Two. Attack the Noise. boss by swinging the hammer at his base, but be Great. careful when he lands. Great manga. Oh, yeah, I didn't I didn't realize this game had bosses. <laughs> oh my goodness! Probably one of my all time faves, actually. Now, it's it's. I really enjoyed that one. What, uh, Chainsaw Man? Yeah, it was. It's in. It does so much unlike. I'm. I'm honestly surprised that it made it in Shonen. With how it is, mm -hmm. like. Yeah. When does when does that anime come out? 
Uh, Third. I want to say I think it's let's like go. Oh, but I'm let's go. Prepared. Third boss. Oh my God, Justin is cracked at this game. <laughs> Justin's quitting his job in speedrunning cooking <laughs> know, on right? the channel. This would right. be a fun game to speedrun, actually. Well, yeah, it looks like it. Looks like it's built for it to me. So you even got so the timer like for you. People have actually heard about this game, but like that kind of gets you like. <laughs> Like, I feel like they always do that block in uh, GDQ of, like, games that people don't know too much about. Mm -hmm. And I oh, love yeah, those. That's, I just hate it because, like, those are always at, like, 6 in the morning. I know. Yeah. That's so yeah. annoying. Like, oh, well, nobody actually wants to watch these games, so we'll put them here. But, like, some of us kind of want to see those games, Yeah. You know? and, like, the yeah, most interesting runs are always, like, at dumb hours, and I hate that. You can't be up Jean Paul? Paul? Like, we can Oh my god. <laughs> what? It's it's Jean Paul. Jean Paul! My god, this totem oh. is hot. Oh shit, that's good. Oh my god. Good balls. Epic balls. Oh, that's cool. So you can throw the hammer at each other? Alright. Oh my god, I, I love it. <laughs> I'm gonna lose, but it's okay. It was worth they, it. They knew they knew what they were doing <laughs> with yeah. that name. They they knew what they were doing. <laughs> Hidetaki Miyazaki, where's the interview about Sean Paul being your favorite artist? Well, we can't, we can't name Sean Paul. That'd be too awesome. Yeah, we have to name him John Paul. John Paul. I wonder. Paul. I really. John I honestly. Paul. I honestly wonder, like, if they were to ask Miyazaki what his favorite musical act would be, what his answer would be. That's a good question. I hope it's something good. I hope it's it Sean Paul. It would definitely be Coldplay. I hope. Oh God. <laughs> John Paul, honestly. I bet, I bet I'm Miyazaki just listens that. to Gregorian throat chants all day. <laughs> I just listen to ambient dungeon noise. <laughs> yeah. yeah, there's this YouTuber named Skeet Skeet 64, and I just love his 10 hour Skeet upload Skeet of ambient 64? dungeon sounds. <laughs> Dungeon like, I would love if Miyazaki just found a random YouTuber with 300 subscribers. I was like, oh, 10 hour ambient D and D noises. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna work to. This is the, old, this is the only music I need. His favorite, <laughs> his, yeah, his favorite artist is Godspeed You, Black Emperor. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Oh that would, shit. That'd, that'd be. be cool, that'd be, that'd cool, be dope. dope. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they do have a lot of actually, ambient sounding songs. I actually heard today. I, I haven't checked it out myself, but you know, you know, with Godspeed You, Black Emperor, they're like, they have that like first album of theirs that like nobody's heard. But it's like, sort of like what a, the like a, hell? Like a urban legend of like, bullshit music. Whoa, yeah. from oh. soft. Y'all know how to bullet hell? Huh? Yeah, they do. Okay, that was actually a really cool boss. Well, that was cool, yeah. But yeah, what what about it, Peter? Yeah, so like they have this like first album before like F sharp, A sharp, or any other like kind of like well known post rock kind of stuff. Yeah, that, like is like basically like a straight up punk album. That was awesome. Like, nobody had heard it for like forever, and I think it just just today somebody finally found it and uploaded it on YouTube. Wow. And I'm not 100 wow. percent sure. I'm not 100 percent sure if it's real, but um, if it is, like that's a pretty Ooh, big like long standing legend. myth, like Damn. musical urban legend myth. That um, that has finally Let's come see. to light. Which one do we do? Do we do yeah. Trick World or do we do Water World? I was not sure about that. I, I heard. I can't remember uh, where I first heard about that. What was the second one? Man, but... Trick World oh, or like... Water oh, World? Oh, oh Water World. But I knew they were very mysterious in general. Philly. Got those yeah, hungry, hungry hippos. It only features like three members of Godspeed, and it's basically like a punk album, like a Fugazi sounding kind of punk album. Oh, before interesting. Before they actually made or like they like kind of developed their post rock sound. Um, yeah. And I, yeah, I just heard today that like it's been found and it's like the real deal, but I'm not 100 percent sure on that because I haven't wow. listened to it yet. That's so. pretty fucking cool if that's real. <laughs> that is. Cool. Yeah. yeah. Like there haven't been too many things in music like that of like lost albums and things like that. Yeah. So that would be a really cool one if it's been uncovered. I found one on Spotify recently that whole thing was that it was like a lost band that was that somebody apparently years ago like an. Early 
Rooms had thought thought somebody just made that shit up and like had posted it on and like was trying to be mysterious because they said they just found it beat up in a parking lot and it had like like the actual audio they uploaded just like hey, stuff that was cool. like little hiccups in it and then it turned out they, they found out years later somebody actually found uh the people who were in the supposed band and confirmed that it was like real and i can't remember what the name was but i remember that the album art had like an some band from like the uk hmm. it, it was cool. a pretty decent album um i listened to it but i was it was just like in my random like recommended stuff on spotify one day and i looked at like the i like to go to, like their artist pages if they have like a description and that one was like just a full-on internet myth story and i was like the fuck <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about <laughs> i think they were called like what were they punchiko yeah the, there they are punchiko. Punchiko. Oh, i still have to listen to that band you sent me oh, that was, gonna, oh yeah Col coltar Sorry, is, uh, been no you been no problem this. that sounds like a cool band actually i'd like to listen to them too yeah. coltar the deeper so i found out whenever i was I, I I was just like I saw that they had a new album for the first time in a, quite a few years since I had last listened to them. It, it it's actually yeah it's been quite a few years since I last was listening to them heavily. But I listened to that new album the other day and I was like, dang, I really did like go through a phase where I was listening to this band just like a lot. And um, yeah, I never heard of them too. I looked up uh, whenever I was looking up um, some of their stuff again or like just. I, I think I was looking up to send like a link to you, but I found something. Or I, out of curiosity, I looked at their Wikipedia page or something when I was looking at it, and I learned something about them that I did not ever realize. But well, actually, it was because I was reading like the U under that out under that Yukari Telepath album sent to you, Peter, and somebody said, "Oh, they were they were gone for like this many years, and oh they just goodness. now put out something new." And they said, well, the lead singer, he actually does a lot of, like, music production work for, like, yeah. just other artists and anime and stuff. And I was like, he's involved with anime? I had no clue. That's cool. So, well, I looked into it, and he actually has a remix of the song Snowflakes on uh, Persona 4 Dancing All Night what? that he did, Aww. that he produced. And I was right. like, I looked at it, I listened to it, and I was like... That sounds exactly the style I would expect him to remix it in. Hmm. Let's oh, check out this one. It was interesting. But um Yeah, I, I'm kinda I'm curious to see what you think about Coltar of the Deepers. I I like them a lot, but I feel like especially like with his his voice is kinda like weird and dro and drony and like very not normal <laughs> in a lot of ways to what you normally think of oh this is cool singing like he can definitely carry it it is a weird sound um there's some weird sounds that kind of come out of his mouth in, in a way i guess i would say but it's not the weirdest shit maybe i'm like priming you too much for it but um it's the kind of thing that i listen to is like i like this a lot I'm not sure if it. I don't think it'd be for everybody, but they're a really cool shoegaze band, and they've got some. They get some pretty heavy stuff here and there too. Okay. Okay. Double jump. Good. Good. I was also looking up some other shoegaze stuff, and I discovered that they actually have more than like. That that they actually have a lot more luminous orange Spotify than I thought they would. And I was like, oh shit, I haven't heard anything from that band in a long time either. Going back to the lost media conversation for a second. <clears throat> yeah, no, no, go completely I find, back. I'm off on I, tangent. I find it very interesting how some people just come across that stuff. Like, yeah. there was, um, there were episodes of Oswald the Lucky Rabbit that were thought to just be gone forever and some kid in japan just like bought tapes at a flea market one day and and it ended up being like a very historical and significant find in their archives like how does that even happen like 
I guess like it like maybe an animator oh, no, no, just no. like I ah, fuck it or like the studio just loses track of it. Like, it's nuts. That's, that's crazy. crazy. <laughs> it's like we're we're gonna. I mean, we already are hearing like similar stories in like video game media media with like stuff that was we thought was dead and buried and is mm -hmm. just like people have found it now. People have uncovered it now or something. Yeah, but it's so crazy, it's, man. It's crazy. Oh, there, that's how I do that. Okay. There's so many like old '90s shows and like or like or '80s and '90s and like beyond shows that are like lost to time almost. That people like uphold them as like myths now. Yeah, the Nintendo PlayStation thing is one. Yeah. Oh uh, yeah, Elle, man. Or yeah, L is real. The whole that whole Mario Zelda bird shit, which spawned the the very annoying thing that I was seeing all over YouTube of the blank iceberg explained. I'm like, please stop. I, I was enjoy I enjoy those, like, even though I know they're dumb. No, I mean, uh, like, I enjoy like... the actual, like, stuff. Like, I enjoy when there's actual content, but I, what I didn't enjoy was that there, there, it seemed like there was a, a big iceberg mystery for everything after that. And I was yeah. like, this feels fake. It's yes, I... Yeah, I get yeah. what you mean. Sometimes yeah. I kind of feel like, what kind of creative stuff could they come up with to make an iceberg theoretically interesting for, like, a certain topic? And sometimes it's like, alright, there's nothing, and they're just, like, trying to, like, make up shit. Mm -hmm. That doesn't the have any sort of, like... You know, like if, if I can, like, suspend my disbelief enough with something, then it's like, okay, it's cool in, like, a sort of creative sense. Yeah. Like, I really love <laughs> the Mario 64 one, because, like, that game... That game has such a level of like, like everything about it is just kind of there and not really like easily explainable. And when you kind of go into it, it's like, all right, the Mario game. I'm not gonna think too deeply into it. But then like putting it in that context, when you raise questions about like little things in it, it kind of lets you. It kind of like invites you to suspend your disbelief a little bit, and being like, huh, this weird thing in this game could lead to something weird or cryptic. Like, yeah, yeah. I have no, I have no better explanation for it, and it's just kind of there. And like everything in that game is just kind of like blocky and colorful and just like nonsensical so it yeah. allows you to kind mm -hmm. of like inject any sort of like meaning into it which that's cool um, yeah for sure doesn't, that doesn't work for it everything is. though you know and like some things it just kind of comes off as like pandering and like trying to like make up make something up that has no actual like sort of like balance for it you know? yeah and yeah, un yeah. one unfortunate side effect of those things is that you sometimes get people who get too invested in those theories so that when they do get debunked, people get upset. Mm. Yeah. I think, like, yeah, um, like I, I was going to say, like, unfortunately, right. a lot of, like, modern-day media, it's kind of harder to do those things because yeah. so much is documented these days. And also, like, yeah. we as a community has become far too savvy of mm. how things are done. <laughs> yeah. Because, yeah. like... Bro, inside baseball. Right, they can't hide anything from us. They release a demo, and then someone's gonna data mine it and find out everything about the game before it even comes out. Yeah, so yeah, like, one hundred percent. So like, they could, to... yeah, they could never pull an L is real thing today because yeah. it's gonna get debunked instantly. It would be found. Yeah, it will be found yeah, that's very I'm... quickly. Like that's where like Mario sixty four kind of fits in that perfect sweet spot of it, you know, because it was definitely before, like like widespread internet speculation and digging into things was a thing and so many of us like just grew up with it as like mm -hmm. children or even later that like it just had that sort of like and, like especially like i think it really connects with me because that was like the first big that was the first video game i owned and like played a lot of from like when i was like four or five years old mm -hmm. so like i already have that yeah. like attachment to it from like a very young age of like it just being new in general and like anything about video games being new mm -hmm. so then kind of like dissecting little tiny elements of it and, and to, like what kind of weird meanings or just even pointing out like this thing is in this part of the level and it doesn't make any sense why is it there like yeah. yeah, like obviously it's probably it's not. It has, it, there's, obviously there's nothing actually cryptic behind it. You know, it's just like game developers doing things to cut costs. You know, and like this yeah. and that. But like it's just weird enough, and there's just this level of like oddness to all of it that like if you just kind of put yourself in the mindset, you can suspend your disbelief and kind of just have fun with all the possibilities of it. You know. Well, sure. it's also just fun to like see something that's supposed to be like cut content that's still technically yeah. in there because like yeah 
you don't you oh, know, like absolutely. either we don't have time to take the workout or there's nowadays like a lot of it gets like uh, with the way games are just patched constantly it's hard to recreate a lot of stuff like that because it's just not gonna happen much anymore because they can just do an update and it will be gone or something yeah if like if need be but um oh. There's always, like, that cool thing that's, like, it's fun to see behind the scenes, even if it's not something that's, like, inherently mysterious in some, like, mystical way, I guess. It, or, like, yeah, of course you can always make, like, the the fun little theories about, like, why, why they might put something like this in to hint at this. But I, I guess the closest that we've gotten to things like that is stuff like where... You guys remember in the first Batman Arkham Asylum game... Where after like several years, like I think Arkham City was already announced and everything, and mm -hmm. somebody finally found a random wall in the game that had no markings on it whatsoever, but you could blow it up three times and it would actually reveal a secret where they had plans for Arkham Asylum in the room. Or Arkham City in the room, rather. And like, other unless you do just like weird stuff that's like almost like hidden in plain sight I suppose like that people are just gonna find it right um like that that's just something that's almost like cosmetic you're not gonna get something that's like that visual just a random data mine necessarily every time like it might it, it's not that it won't be there it's just something that I feel oh easy to overlook right mm. But when people finally figured out how to do it, it but you you can't hide stuff that well and you, it, if you want yeah. it to be, you know. Yeah, you're right. I do love the whole mystique about it, though. Like, even if it's a game that I know shit could easily be debunked in. Yeah, catch me at 2 in the morning at a random YouTube video for 25 hmm. minutes. Like, yo, oh, <laughs> this yeah. thing actually exists. You know, it's, it's kind of like, <laughs> it's like the forbidden fruit concept. It's like we we want we want what we can't have, and the second we know that there was con content or even like the idea of it, <laughs> it's like nope. Okay, our brain's going into overdrive, try, trying to <laughs> trying to visualize the concept. Yeah, um, I but just yeah, but you're right though. Yeah, yeah, it's like with the with these days, it's yeah, you can't really as much, but <clears throat> yeah, like a good mystery is like always going to be fun entertainment to me, but that that's the thing is like it's not. I'm not, I, I can't, um, what, how was I going to put this, is what I'm trying to remember, um, it's like, it's going to be a mystery for a little while, the internet's going to uncover it, and it's not, it's not something that's going to be easily recreated right now, but, right. yeah, it's, it, the thing with the iceberg, yeah, that's where I was actually going to go. So the thing that with the iceberg, the only thing about that that bothers me is whenever, like you said, Peter, earlier, if it's somebody trying to make up something that is not really there, it's not really substantial to be one, and the sheer, like, number of those that I saw coming out on YouTube, the blank iceberg explained for, like, everything you can imagine, that's whenever it was kind of, like, losing its charm. And it wasn't that I hated the idea of the iceberg, it was just that... Not everything has an iceberg. You don't need to try and force one in there, right? Sure. Yeah. Sometimes there like really isn't an explanation. To... Yeah, people make them to like make YouTube videos and mm. stuff, and like get views and likes, and you know, some of them are cool, but then others are just like, you know, there's really you're 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 stretching it, and it kind of just makes the whole thing less fun. You know? Yeah. Yeah. So. <laughs> People yeah. taking it too far to, like, profit on it, mm -hmm. like, which, like, ruins it, kind of. Like, takes it too far the wrong direction. Yeah. Which is why you could always safely do a speculation video on a David Lynch movie. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Because <laughs> no one, cause no one, literally, no one knows what's no about. Knows. And Lynch, about and Lynch never divulges about. the meaning of his movies, yeah. either. And he'll talk to a monkey before he will. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, Steven said, I think the Forbidden Fruit idea is what drove me to find and play Mother 3. And content farming and algor algorithms are poggies. Yeah, it's true. Poggies. Do be poggies. 
Well, they definitely make it on the iceberg one. And I, as much as I want to enjoy a good iceberg set of theories, I... Yeah, I just, it's harder to the more of them I see because I halfway expect it to be some, some bullshit they made up to try and, you know, make a content that you will watch. Oh, what am I doing? Fuck. Oh, oh. Should I, I be myself. scared that, um, this game's home and this boss is pretty tough? Uh, yeah. if, if, uh, if I'm software's telling you, I would be scared. <laughs> If it were any game other than that, I would be scared. <laughs> oh my goodness. Listen, Cookie and Cream is gonna be the hardest game on this marathon. I didn't realize you were still here, Anthony. Trust me. Yeah, I'm, I'm still here. I've been listening for a while because uh, I didn't want to interrupt. But, um, no but you know, when it, come, when it comes to, like, lore and cut content and shit like that... Oh, um, okay. <clears throat> I'm more in it. I'm more in it for lore than anything else. There's a YouTuber called Mossbag who has done some fantastic videos oh, no, explaining, uh, explaining Hollow Knight, which I found immensely helpful because after I finished the game, I was more curious about everything that had happened that led to the events of the game. And he had a, he has like an hour and 20 minute long. Like, that's, that's fine. That's worth it digest video and uh, I found it to be very helpful and it, he, he acknowledges that a lot of it is some uh, that, that there is some of it that's theory and then there's a lot of it that is more or less just canon and he's explaining it and you know it's it, it's helpful um, because it could make sense I'm like and I love the Soulsborn community because the Soulsborn community is is very um, is very accepting and very like uh, you know welcoming and stuff like that. But I have tried watching Soulsborn lore explanation videos on Bloodborne, and I just I still don't get it. Like, like so. Uh, point is. Sometimes those iceberg explained videos can be can be really helpful, and sometimes they can be kind of overwhelming, and a lot of it can be like people mixing in their head cannons with actual. Cannons. That's actually that's my issue with it is that yeah when, there's... when it becomes like all right that. it's just a head when it's like blatantly obvious that it's a head cannon it's just like okay dude yeah. Is like this is just my speculation, but yeah. And like, like they, for the record, I have no problem with head cannons. It's just that some people, and I mean some people, only some. Like there's some that they go way far with it. Some it's people, like, really? it's not. It's not even that they go way far into it. It's that they become so invested in that head cannon to the point where that's all they accept. And if like let's say. Oh. The next the game cannon, yeah. goes against that. Then all of a sudden, they're upset and throwing a temper tantrum about it. It's like, dude, like, okay. uh, like I'm sorry you didn't write this game. Like, <laughs> maybe there's a reason you're not writing games or you're not writing stories. Yeah. Well, actually, uh, actually, the sequel's wrong. I yeah. was right. Yeah, actually, they're wrong. Um, I wrote this head cannon like five years ago, and that's the only correct thing. Like, no, fuck you. Yeah, <laughs> that's a that that's one other thing where it goes to. Like there, are, there are multiple things that it that it can definitely be. I, I'm not gonna have like an issue with people just having a head cam, um, unless it's just like they're Whoa. being toxic about oh, it. Oh, this puzzle looks crazy. Dang. Whether or not you can get across depends on Cream's luck. Oh what? no! You probably want to wait RNG until the best people? pillar combination appears. Oh, oh no. no. Is this going to be like the Kingsfield minecarts that are literally all RNG and you can't do anything about it? Holy <laughs> crap. Oh no, it is. Oh my god. <laughs> Sam, are you playing the bowl right now? No, I'm trying to do Gyobu skip. Which I, I did earlier just fine, and now I'm having Peter a little skip? trouble. I'm doing Peter Skip. Right. Peter Mr. Skip. Peter Skip. I told oh you I'd name one after you. 
Yeah. I'm waiting for that. Come on, just... Just do your stabby stabby. Yeah! Cream is lucky! Nice. Yeah. Hell yeah. Hell <laughs> yeah. Hey. Hey. <laughs> Let's see, once you get oh, on the hurry. boat, wait for Cream. When Cream uh, gets on a boat, you can move the boat. Okay. Sam, if there's any reason to not leave the campaign... It's I. I. Yeah. It's absolutely that, because you would miss every single... Wait, what? You're right, I've changed my mind. Hold on. <laughs> um, Just hang on uh, is to it, that is it, You won't be able to move Is it too much to ask why you are considering oh. the campaign? Or is it, just, is it just like a you're too busy thing, or...? Uh, yeah. It's an abundance of issues. Gotcha, uh, gotcha. I won't pry then. Oh, that's all right. We can talk later about it. Okay. I was just curious because I pry, this pry, pry, pry. not the first time I've heard it brought up. Hey, you talked your yeah. DM yet? Wait. God, Sam, this is rough. Yeah, I, man. the The thing is, is like I, I there are sometimes I can get it like first try, and then sometimes there's like 10 times so i need to like bridge the gap in in between that inconsistent time window uh i feel like y'all been talking about that for a year now i won't quite say a year just talking about what anyway nice weather we're having i guess <laughs> we... i'll about... say watching this game it kind of like watching this game if i like looked at it for like a second it kind of looks like a mario party mini game yeah, yeah, we, yeah, we were I saying know, that. Really. Yeah, I was saying, saying, you know, at a glance, this looks like a Mario Party mini game. It does, for sure. When you pay attention, um, like, more to it, it's like, yeah, it's got a lot pink hippo. going, but... Yeah. Just, like, at a glance... I just fed us some cabbage. Works. All right, we got next boss. They said it's tough. Cookie and cream. Peter's favorite new Where game. Where are the cookies gone? Inside of Hershey's cookies and cream. I'll be back. <laughs> Where's the cream filling? <laughs> now that's the stuff. Host it. Now that's the stuff. Uh, I'm gonna put on shallow hell. That's it. Hell yeah. Battlefish torpedo. Whoa! Look at this boss. <laughs> no, I'm, 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 a little, I'm a little Debbie all the way kind of person. It always tasted like. Come okay, on, there's like... one Don't one exception. Yeah. One exception. Ding dongs were okay, but every. other... Like, not Little Debbie Swiss Miss Why did you let him kill yeah. you? He hadn't destroyed nice the Talon yeah. Rolls. Give me yeah, a second. Yeah. Had perfected the Swiss Roll. Compared Swiss to roll, Swiss, Swiss are Rolls better. are the best food that's ever been invented. They're way better than Yodels. Uh, yodels oh. are literal raccoon poop compared to L Swiss Rolls. Yeah. Little Debbie, like those Swiss cake rolls. Oh man. Those Zero out of ten shit. times I would I buy a Yodel most over Drake's, a Swiss most Roll. Drake's most Drake's, like, uh, confectionaries or whatever you fuck you call them. Like, they're good, but they're not, like, they're not good, you know? They're yeah, good. they're not, like, incredible, but they are, but they are like just... Devil Dog is, like, Devil Dog is, like, it's enjoyable, but it's not good. Yeah. You know? that... Just give me, yeah, I, I'll sense. just have Swiss Rolls over at basically any other supermarket pastry any day. I mean, as I get, as I get older, that's how I feel about every snack cake. Like I don't Except really. Oh, that's true. I guess oh, yeah, I guess, but, but that's but that's a personal preference because I personally have always preferred salty over sweet. But when I was younger, I oh, used to be really okay. into snack cakes, and I just never like as I would eat it, I'd be like, "Well, I know it's not Why great, I but oh, like there's, okay. but there's some there's something about it. There's certainly something about it that I like, but it, well, I mean, because it's low sugar, but uh, but yeah, no, I. I, yeah, I I personally yeah. just always have been weird That's about snack cakes. That's how this works. Okay. There were things love in that room. Like, Every now like and then I do love me a mommy? good cheap snack cake. But... So I, I have to really be in the mood for it. That's I have to be like, oh, how I am. Definitely, how. Definitely an appeal I honestly feel like I could like... down one any time, but yeah. Yeah. But sometimes like... No like, idea like why I would disgrace my elegant palate with one of those plebeian grocery store cakes oh, when man. I could instead grace What is the kick button? I'm actually deleting the Twitch now. <laughs> there's, um, cause there's like, I'll say like, I think like a cosmic brownie. Like, in theory, you see one, it's like, cool, I want to eat that. Like, that looks good. And you, you, feel, like you, have fond and you feel like you have fond memories of eating them, so it's like, I'm gonna eat this. And then you eat a cosmic brownie and you're like, 
I just ate a brown rectangle. Yeah, you're like, why did I do yeah, this? Yeah, okay, okay, so, per- what, great, what great. the fuck was I'm, that? I'm glad, I'm glad you brought oh, that, that was, specific example. That was nonsense. Be- Me too, because, because I always thought Cosmic Brownies were on the lower end of the because, spectrum as far as those go. Because they are. Because, you know what? If somebody's like, hey, you want a Cosmic Brownie? I would probably just eat it. Like, I'd be like, yes. I For, so, I, for some reason, this seems right. And then I eat it, and I'm like... What the fuck was that? Like, yeah, Peter, I did. I did the same fucking thing recently. I in my last grocery shopping, I was. It was like the last ten minutes I could place shit on my order, and I'm like, you know what? I haven't had a cosmic brownie in like fifteen years. Yeah. I'm gonna. I'm gonna order a box of them, and I'm sure okay, it's I'm gonna be horrible great. Horrible on this boss fight. And and I ate one or two, and I was like, eh, that's pretty much what I expected. Like yeah, it was, good. it was, it was a brown rectangle of sugary sweetness. You're it wasn't like, anything. Yeah, you're never. At no point are you ever like afterwards. You're like, I'm glad I did that. Yeah, I'm glad. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I know. Not, certainly not worth it. All right, there's a bunch of this this a bunch foods I feel that way about. Empty, cal- Kill me. empty calories. It's like All right. fucks you up. Like it makes you feel sick you a little bit that too, boss? and it's not even. What? Like, look hard, it's dude. Like, uh, it's not that bad. It's just I, I get it now. I didn't understand it before. But basically, as long as it doesn't have the Umihara mechanics on that tether. Oh no, it does not have the Umihara quasi. <laughs> yeah, mechanics. no, I'm sure it doesn't. <laughs> that would be hell. But no, no, no. I, I, I'm just like I, I, I would, like I. My little brother loved causing brownies for a while. I was always kind of like, eh, you know, I, there, there's too much else I would take before cosmic brownie. They're, they actually make like some of the little Debbie ones are actually like very. I don't know, like, they're not an amazing, but they have a, a good better. texture to them, and they yeah. taste what? pretty good. Is that gonna hit it? Like, I think, I think that's, yeah, I think I that's the biggest thing, is that Little Debbie, they always had the texture at least right. Yeah, like, Little Debbie Swiss cake rolls are definitely, like, they feel, like, pretty good quality compared to, like, considering what you're buying. Christmas like, rolls are the best thing ever invented. The... I Those buy a box like of them every time I'm at the grocery store. Like, they never, they never get old. They're the best tasting thing. Ryan, in the world. Have you had your uncrustable yet? Oh, I um, haven't. I should, I should go grab that after this. Um, panel. did Little Debbie do the the nutty bars? Oh, yes. I, got hints. So. I also, I so. dude, I used to eat nutty bars. Like I love like, nutty bars. I also like I, the uh, the crumb cakes. cakes. The, the crumb rolls. cakes. Are really I could, good. I could, I know, I know confidently, I could buy a nutty bar tomorrow and fall in love with it again. Like that. Like on coffee cake, coffee cake, crumb cake. Like, that was never a big thing for me. The no, pecan, pecan swirls. I like crumb cake swirls. and coffee cake. I, I've never been a huge I can't eat it too one. often, though. It's a trigger. Like, I feel like I like cons I like now crumb more cakes. Than, I, than I ever did growing I up. So like those crumb cakes. were not super my thing, but I get crumb that, cake. too. Oh damn it! I'm trying to think of the what was it like? Zebra cakes weren't terrible, but they weren't like fine either. Yeah. Give yeah, me crumb like cakes and Swiss rolls. They definitely don't belong in the pantheon of snack cakes, but yeah, they're, no, they're okay. no. But um, one that I I think there was another one I'm trying to think of that was like um, maybe it was just like the regular chocolate cupcakes that Little Debbie made, but they were just like, they were like a ding dong, but they had little plus uh, across the top was all, you know, they were like it had the chocolate shell all around, rather than just on the top like the Hostess one. And it had like little swirly thing like the hostess ones, but it actually tasted good, unlike the hostess ones. I guess the timing on this is very specific. Yeah, oh no, I, I messed like up. An easy fight, they even said it was a hard fight, so. Yeah, I gotta. Oh. I have a very specific window yeah, yeah. to damage it. No! Oh. Also, the music's oh, been pretty damn. cool in this game, too. Damn, you're definitely down for Terracaba tomorrow, right? Uh, I don't know about definitely. Are you probably? I'd say there's like a 75% chance. Of you being in? Of me being in, yes. Are okay. you in? So or are you out? <laughs> Uh, what time could you do if, if, you know, if we go to lunch? If, if it, if it's a thing that's happening, I would say, like, 1.30 would be fine. That's perfect, because, yeah, um, and then, uh, yeah. 
So 130 would be good because that'll be you and Robin and Betsy. And I think my sister's going to be at her. My, I'm, ex I'm excited about tomorrow. My, my, my little sister and my brother are coming. Nice. Nice. Very cool. I am. Oh my god, no! Oh my god! Oh my god! It's, I literally just had that moment in this game. What? <laughs> also, I gotta take a massive piss, but I'm gonna do it after Snake Skip. Good call. Ow, that hurt. Oh, so you're supposed to fight the snake here? Oh, you're not supposed to fight it. What you're supposed to do is um, you go in that little panaquin thing, that little hut, and he he like peers in. What the? Uh, fuck? I'll actually show I'll actually show you, Amp, because it's really cool. Uh, so you so you sneak in this little panaquin. God. And the snake it'll Why enter an animation me? where the snake like looks into it, and then you just fucking bop him right in the eye. <laughs> And then that's your chance to escape because he starts like flinging around. But I need to pick up that snap seed. So, so you, yeah, you encounter this snake multiple times in your game. Yeah. Well, I mean, well, so you ca you actually can, but one or two of the times Come you, on, cream. you get actually the time. get the time. Oh sure, you gonna do it? You get gonna the do time, it? cream? <laughs> I'll, I'll do it. She gets the time. Yeah, there's some some encounters with the snake that, like, unless you go out of your way looking for it, you will not encounter. So, funny story about the snake. There we go. I was screaming the part about the actually, snake. Actually, I got Sam it. and, uh, who else was on stream? Anyway, I w <laughs> It may have been, I, I think it was Sam and Peter. I don't remember if anybody else was. We were having, like, a conversation while I was, like, on that snake part. And I was just, like lost on where to go for this thing because I didn't realize you were supposed to go in the panic one. I, I was like I didn't oh, see yeah. the indicator. I kept going like behind it and I'm like trying to sneak off to the side and just like how do you get past this thing? He keeps seeing me. And yeah it turned out it was all scripted. I was like wait a scripted thing like this in a Souls game? Or not a Souls game but a FromSoft game? Like you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> yeah, it's a fun little encounter. Also, I got a rocket piss. I'll be right back. Okay, so do we do cool. Trick World or what was the Ice World? I think it was Arctic World. Yeah, Arctic World or Trick World? Hmm. Wait, what does Trick World look like? <sighs> Ooh, those both look really cool. That's a tough choice. You know, we'll do Trick World since I'm here. Start with, yeah, start with Trick and we'll go to Arctic afterwards. <laughs> Dang. What are you guys watching? And your food porn is coming through your mic. <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> uh, I'm watching chicken, chicken video. And, and chicken? is currently pulling a Randy Marsh. Yeah. On stream. Uh, <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Hey, uh, oh, I have, no. I have a, uh, fa fa Facebook understands that I'm a fat ass, so what they'll do is they'll show me these, like, TikToks of people oh, that's... cooking, like, really delicious-looking food, and then I'll be like, oh my god, that looks like really amazing fried chicken, or oh my god, that looks like amazing barbecue, or oh my god, I need a house so I can have a smoker and a deep fryer so I can do all these fucking things. That's right, baby. You marinate that thing. You get that. You get it. You get up in there. You put that dry rub up on that steak. Oh, hell yeah. Get in. God, yes. Uh, also, Brinky, how you doing, baby? Good. How about you? I've been better, but I've also been worse. You never uh, called me back yesterday. I understand and realized this or at around <laughs> uh one in the morning and said i'm an asshole fair that's fair no i'm just you kidding meant to say you hate me no <laughs> honestly <laughs> i am screaming honestly Potentially. wait what the fuck 
What is this all-in-one device that's got, like... Wait, does that do what I think it does? Are those all just... Oh. Oh, my God. This thing looks like an aneurysm. What is going on here? Oh, my okay, God. that brings me up here. Spooky. With pillowy mouth. Oh, come on. Potatoes. I jumped on you. You good? Oh, good. You dozed off for a little while there, snoring pretty loudly there, partner. Harder. You're tired and you need some rest? You need some rest. You good? You, you wanna go back to sleep? Howdy, partner. Howdy, okay. partner. Howdy, partner. It might be a little quieter upstairs if you wanna go upstairs and conk off there and then I'll wake you up and tell you to come on down or you can stay to stay here whatever's more comfortable for you no. take yourself a little siesta little cat nap little cat nap yeah yeah you do have to get up early actually if you go to bed now you can just stay asleep upstairs because you'll get enough sleep this do be a castlevania that i'm playing currently good night friend Night night. Is that going to bed? That, Everybody say good night to Robin. Good Robin. night, but some dreams. <laughs> Are you in bed? Good. That's right, me. folks. Hi, Jintoki. Uh, that's right, folks. We have. I love how Jintoki comes in just after Robin goes to bed. Live falling asleep action on stream, baby. Oh wait, hold on. I s Robin was snoring really loudly. It was adorable. Um, <laughs> I think I only heard the wake up. Um, you have a snoring fetish confirmed? What? Dang. Uh, Justin, Justin, we all have our kinks, and uh, <laughs> that's that's that, that, it, it's not cool to kink shame it's on screen. You, it's between you and God. That's... Sick wind bite. I mean, <laughs> sick wind. <laughs> 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 Oh my god. Uh, Nick, I Nick, I've been what? inviting you. Oh over no. Like... Oh, I said win invite though. <laughs> Can I get that time? Yes. I thought Sam said he was going to go take it. No. A large oh, piss. come on. Sam's so taking a wicked piss. A large yeah. piss. <laughs> This is, this, is, this is the most wicked of pisses because God, he is a wicked pisser. He's doing the Austin Powers pit. He's trying to go for the next record after all. <laughs> I was not expecting the Austin Powers reference in 2020 or 2022 for that matter. Uh, what I the fuck think, do I do? I think there's a certain channel in the retro roulette just not been paying attention to then. I don't pay attention to half those channels. Dang. Hon honestly, very relatable, Justin. <laughs> Dude, y'all just like shit posted ninety percent of them. I can't keep up with that. That is true. You do have a point. <laughs> how do I? How do I explain the retro roulette Discord? Well, one day James came into the Discord and suddenly chaos broke loose. Well, you're suddenly the mod. <laughs> Oh, what? Don't take control of the whole Discord like that. <laughs> what am I gonna do? What am I? You really be a mod. <laughs> he also has no. Guy just says, hey, James, do you think we could have a little order in this Discord? How fast do you think the entirety of of, of the Bubba crew would just like burst into the Discord and just raid and destroy? Them? <laughs> Uh, hey, we're all right. Cool. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Be the degree. And also, of... I do kind of look. He enjoy the shit posting. Like, well, like... I mean, you do it too. You really don't have a place to <laughs> say anything. So I do. I, I know. Apologize. I know. I, I, I just apologize if I... I do apologize ahead of time. Peter, Peter, don't one. apologize. I, like I, <laughs> I definitely the fact, the fact that. that you're interacting in my Sam also. Also make, the Sam also the fuck out of me with that. So. Listen, we need traffic, and that's it. That's our content. <laughs> if I post a, if I post a mumbo token gif, then he also posts a mumbo token gif, and then that's what we're doing all day. So like, it's, you know. I mean, I'm I'm only following suit here. Yeah, saying like Fraser gifts are just my main motive, like. Actual communication, so 
I think, yeah, I think I could say a lot by posting Niles holding a sword and doing, like, a little, like, <laughs> pelvic jig. Yes. Oh, come on! I fell Don't right in that hole. Cookie. Don't forget to move Cookie. Oh, I am. I'm, like, flicking the stick. Cookie. I fell something. right in a hole for that one. Come on. Come on. I can do this. I can maybe do... No, nope, no, nope, I fucked it up. Down in a hole. Oh dang. I saw that. Uh, the problem is, I get stuck here. Oh heck yeah. Skill of ring, baby. Actually, I need to do this and then... And then... Get her up there. No. Okay. Yeah, I'm missing the tr little puzzle piece over there, but it's okay. I just want to get through the level. Hmm. Jintoki, have you ever played this game? It wasn't your fault either way, Jin, by the way. I meant to say that earlier. Wait, Justin, are you playing with somebody else right now, or are you controlling Oh, no, I am controlling both We're of doing them. doing both, yeah. <laughs> also, yeah, what do you mean by, tough. I didn't mean to, Jin? It was in reference to the thing about as soon as he got in, but was doing the sleepies. Not really his fault. Not really Indeed. his fault. Not your fault. I'm beginning to think that everyone in Zeno chat has like this gigantic, like everything is my fault complex. Yeah, a lot of us end up with that, you know. Yeah. Kinda, it is a common fun. enough thing nowadays. Yeah. Also, uh, I think part of, of our, I... I think all of our boomer parents were control freaks, and now that now we have this like complex. Don't even you know, fucking get me started on that shit yeah. later. Oh, it was yeah. a, it was probably a mixture of that and that my entire my entire extended family is a bunch of trolls. So I feel the need to have to like say, you know, that was a joke. I'm. Oh. It's your character arc, Jin Sophie. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's part of understanding Zenosaga's yeah. learning to apologize trolling, for everything. Trolling, <laughs> trolling, overbearing boomer parents. Yeah. Ain't, ain't it the truth. Anyway. Yes. Wait, what? I don't understand this. Hold on. To get past your cookie, you has to jump on the wing nut. To rotate the wall, block on the right side. The wing nut is screwed on pretty tight. In order to move it, you probably need to use your double jump. Sam, Hal just Sam, uh, Hal was just hypnotized. Uh, in the in shallow hell, so now he's going to see every woman that he meets. As not the, oh, it's Sam. I'm back. Here. Oh, hey, there Sam is not here yet. <laughs> anyway, well, I'm here now. Dang, I'm that was a wicked pursuit. I'm just giving you an update on shallow hell. He was just oh, good. by Tony Robbins, so uh huh, he's, yeah, yeah. He's the inner beauty in women instead right. of what they actually look like. So huh. you just met the girl with the cab. You know, oh yeah, you know. it's Katrina. Katrina. It's me, Katrina. Austin. Austin. <laughs> also, Hydrant Toki. I don't. I barely remember anything from that movie. By the way, Ooh, all you need to know close. is Shao Hao wants to go. I've watched Shao Hao. Yeah, like pure... Thirty times. Like, yeah. I've watched this movie way too much. My, it's one of my dad's favorite movies too. If you ask him, it's probably the movies. Yeah, my. Like... Mm -hmm. Oh, I was just gonna I urge say. You to go... I urge you to go watch matter. it. I don't know about that, but I don't know. <laughs> oh, I, mean, I, I, I would. I would urge. At the same time, <laughs> I kind of think you should watch it. It's um, it's pretty good. It's Fun, good. and it's got a good message. It actually yeah, does. Like, like, it's I, like yeah. it spends most of the movie being like, "This is a terrible message." And then, like by the end of it, it's like, "Well, it's, it's well, I of, think well, it's actually well, kind it's, of a good message." Yeah, like, well, it's, it, it sets though, right? uh, it sets it sets the character up for the good message. 
Yeah, you know, like, it's... it spends it spends most of the movie making a joke of the wrong message, which, and I can get why most people wouldn't see that movie immediately that way, because like you know most of the main jokes of the movie are like oh like you know what? he's dating a girl that he thinks is really skinny but she's really overweight and there's all these different all these jokes about it through the movie, but like by the end of the movie, like in that last like kind of quarter of the movie. It kind of like flips that whole message on its side and actually kind of makes something more meaningful of it. Um, yeah. Yeah, and, for sure. Oh, it's over here. Like I've I know I've seen at least it in bits and pieces, but it's like one of the few Jack Black movies I've just not really watched yeah. all of. I think it's the first, yeah, I think it's the first Jack Black movie I've ever seen in my life. I, I it was the first I one I had heard of for sure, but wow. um, I just. <laughs> I don't know why, it was just one that I always, like, missed, kind of. It's, like, very much not a typical oh, no. Jack Black movie. Like, his character in the movie is, not, is to me, like, not Jack Black, but it also kind of is. Alright, yeah. Do this. He can't help yeah. but not be himself a little bit, even though the character is yeah, definitely tripping not, in the like, finish line, but Jack What the Black fuck character. were you supposed to do? Yeah, I gotta figure that one out. So, Jin asks, hello, how is everyone? Well, I am uh, doing, doing good. pretty all right, actually. Doing pretty well, yeah. yeah. I, if I haven't met you yet, my name is Peter. Hello. Uh, oh, this is Peter. Uh, actually, yeah, also, we can also get the puzzle piece. That's fine. Grab the puzzle Let's piece. See. Good. Yeah, doing well. I got my good buddies on a Friday night and a cold yeah. beer that <laughs> just <laughs> right. Dude, that cold was coming. It's just right. I said a cold beer. Sure. Right. And I would write nothing. I would write nothing. It's not the pair of jeans. It's the cold beer that fits Rain just right. Rain does make corn, though. And corn do be making whiskey. That's corn true. does make whiskey. Oh, Jintogi says, hello, Peter. Hello. hello and I say, hello, nice Mario. Nice to meet you. <laughs> hello, Mario. <laughs> hey, Peter. Hey, Peter. <laughs> <laughs> Giving out free ones, huh? Right? Oh, bull skip in one try! Let's go! Oh, baby! Yobu and bull skip in one try. Freaking epic. Um, epic. you're like... How's, everybody's fr how's everyone's Friday been today? Actually, um, not too bad. I was just ready for work to be over, was about huh. it. But other than that, it was great. Understandable, oh, have a nice day. God, today is bored. Uh, other today... than some fiery poops, man, yeah. I've been doing well. Okay, nice. It wasn't even that work was like bad, it was just like I was, I was just like, I just I'm really wanted tired. to be the weekend. It's just, it's too close to the weekend. I don't want to be doing this right now. Ladies and gentlemen, the weekend. Ah, oh, the weekend. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen. Everybody coming in the world to be crazy. People work so hard. <laughs> ah, fuck, I missed Everybody the. Everybody is that partying. Ball. Come, come down with that. Grab weekend. your ball, grab your pet. And I've watched that video every Friday for like a year now. Because Good. Of, because of posting it on your. Oh on my your Garfy Facebook. baby. Yeah. Posting on my Garfy baby. Oh God, Peter! Oh, did you see my cursed baby. tweet today? Peter, hey, what? Peter, Bo, Peter. Did you see my cursed tweet today? Hey, I saw your. Uh, saw the one of you wearing a Norbit shirt. Yeah. Know, my cursed tweet. That, that one? Yeah. I saw it pop up on my phone, like in my notifications. Hey, you. And Your cursed what? Oh, My cursed Norby. tweet. I like Norby. I like Norby's response. Like his <laughs> oh, did you? Yeah. 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 <laughs> I I sometimes I sometimes am. <laughs> I will laugh when when Blake retweets my shit, but there are some times I'm like, why did you do that? And today was one of those instances. <laughs> I'm like, th over 300 people liked a scruffled looking man child wearing a Norbit t shirt. Oh my uh, god. Oh, you're my scruffled Where looking man child? Like, Shut your Where'd you get that Norbit shirt? Uh, Blake made it. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, who's Blake? That man knows how to make Blake, Blake, Blake is uh, a, a, a good friend for many years. And oh, who also does the podcast with me. Oh, that Blake? Oh, do I, do I know Blake? That. Yeah. Bad friend, we don't like Blake. Wow, I was doing so well in this run, and I'm just fucking it up now. Let's see, Jitogi says, Had another snow day, but I had today reserved off anyway to help reset my sleep schedule. Except, of course, I stayed up until 4 a.m. last night to beat Scarlet Nexus. A game I very desperately need to begin. 
It do be oh a my god, look, look at this. Yeah, I've been wanting to play that for a while. You have to perform your very best jump when the dish is at its highest point. Then you should be able to <laughs> just barely clear the ledge. Wow, even in a child-like game with bunnies, From is really asinine. <laughs> They're like, nah, <laughs> you're gonna fuck up. <laughs> just so you know. I'm about to kill the firekeeper now. Brian. Uh, no. Brian. Oh, See, Brian, what sucks Brian is that, like... Is, Brian is excluded from Ravi Bri Holy Night. Brian. Kill okay. the firekeeper. You're excluded from Chicken Cutlet Night. You're excluded from <laughs> Surf and Turf Night. You so, excluded from, from Chicken Cutlet, Cutlet Night. night. <laughs> oh my god. Oh I fucking my hate it. <laughs> <laughs> you can do it, Justin. I believe in you. Oh yeah. no, not if I Oh keep... shit! Hey Alex, what's up? Got that subscriber oh, badge, baby. Oh yeah, you goodness. do got it. Oh she What do you do? Or maybe oh, not. Oh come on. Well, you got two months, yeah. HK was lurking for a long time. Is Alex Sutter didn't not. gift this Oh one. no! Did you guys oh, see that? God, you... Oh shit. Oh. Dang, Justin, Justin, bad gamer confirmed. I need more wine. Holy shit. <laughs> I can't oh. cope. I need more wine. Oh. HK, you've, you've got your emotes made. Holy crap. I did not realize those were... Wait. All right. Oh, are these HK's emotes? Oh, those are those are adorable. Oh, HK? they're fucking awesome. I love those are them. The, are those the ones that... um? <laughs> is this shrimp's 24-7? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. All right. Are I will be right that... back, guys. We're going to have a quick break. Oh, you bought those. Okay. Sounds good. Sounds good. In the meantime, for everyone... Wait, did you go to break yet? I did. <laughs> yeah, okay. he is now. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> and y'all ready for my BRB playlist? Yeah. No, dude, your playlist slaps. Honestly, the elevator music is so iconic, but like... Uh, give, me that, give me that William Hung. But uh, your, your playlist. playlist is dope. Oh. William Hung. Yeah. We're, all, we're also still coming in on the BRB screen. Hope you know. I mean, I don't think there's anything wrong with that. No, okay, perfect time to plug the Elden Ring giveaway. <laughs> As a matter of fact, ladies and gentlemen, we are giving away one Steam copy of Elden Ring for PC. Oh, Steam, you knew that. Anyway, the redundancy aside, if you'd like to enter for a chance to win Elden Ring for PC, all you need to do is type hashtag ER giveaway. That's E-R-G-I-V-E-A-W-A-Y. And you will be entered automatically to win a free copy of Elden Ring by uh, Hidetaka Miyazaki and George R.R. R. Martin. So, like, that's true except for what Ant-Man says. You will win all 12 seasons of hit show ER. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> of ER? Remember. I don't remember how many seasons there are. I just know that... My entire, it felt my like my entire childhood up was every like certain night every week my parents. Oh my God, Peter, that fucking cursed uh, family guy. <laughs> so you got the game, Joe. Get the game, Joe. Get the and I hate, and I hate that I know the exact line. There. Yeah. Wow, already nine entry. Well, minus all of Anthony's, so more like six entries in the giveaway. Okay, look. I have okay, okay, Anthony. Time. Okay, Anthony. I'll level with you. You can have you can have the one on you can have the one on your personal account, but the one on Retro Roulette does not count. It's fine. Well, the one for on Retro Roulette's account was never supposed to be for me anyway. It was supposed to be for Justin. <laughs> yes, I, I was gonna say if if somebody if so, if one of us wins, it's going right to Justin, basically. <laughs> Because I told him I would I would pay for his copy. <laughs> anyway, we can no longer speak. We must vibe out to the music and spam dance. The music. We must dance. We must spam dance emotes now. Well, I guess I have to put it on my on my, on my, on my everyone's jiggy. Everyone's jigging down right now. I'm just gonna keep the same emo going, so <laughs> because I love it. Is this oh, Sonic yeah. CD? Maybe? This has got to be. It's either from Sonic Man or Sonic Man. I wish I 
<laughs> it sounds like. It does sound yeah. like Sonic CD Japanese version. A little bit. It got a little. It, it, see, it's definitely that sound font, so it's either that or Mania. I want to make a will be right back. For, for I just can't for, remember which song this would be, though. You should do a beer. That's what I'm saying. I think it's like... Uh, you know what I think it is? He's a big fan of that, like, Wild Western level in, in Sonic Mania. So I'm thinking it's that. Ah. Uh, I think. Could be. Brian, what are you <laughs> God damn it, stop! <laughs> Richer! <laughs> Alex, subscribe with Prime, they've been subscribed for two months. Richer! Richer! On subbing. Honestly, the Salt Shaker Dwayne emote is like the best for this particular song. We are at 15 viewers, guys. It always, it, it never Friday ceases night. to fail every time we go on break. <laughs> so, um, it's more of you. I actually had a few friends uh, show up and raid my stream really late last night. I'm there. This, yeah, I was gonna say I mentioned this to them, so make in case. Oh, that would explain the two follows at like two in the morning. Oh, yeah, that might be it. I was, I was like, cool, but who are these people? <laughs> There, um, I, I know a friend in, uh, the, my other Zeno server, Mira, that, uh, streams sometimes, and I sometimes watch his stream, and he ended up sending me a raid last night, whenever I was, at first I was about to go to bed at that time, but I, because I'm in, I'm having fun and whatever, but I, but it worked out, it was awesome. Hell yeah. And Alex, thank you again for that subscription. Thank you, friend. <laughs> Richer. Oh, oh, and Anthony. <laughs> it's called the Elven.
All right, and we are You're back. back. Oh, shit, we back, baby. Hope y'all like the BRB playlist. As oh, always. Uh, Alex have... posted a video. Hey, Let's see what that is. Do you have Sonic help. Mania uh, music in there? Not tonight. No, it was me at the club, dude. I was gonna we say, I don't this. think that one. I was gonna say, I didn't think that one sounded like one I knew. Onyx, so I, I don't. Oh shit, I, Alex. I, I like the same font, but still. <laughs> Alex posted uh, a nice John Mayer cover. Twelve years ago, fifty-nine thousand. Oh yeah, I didn't even look at the view count. Holy shit! Wow. You got fifty-nine thousand views Alex, on that is video. Is Alex's body a wonderland? And speaking all your comments, count, all your comments are probably "fuck this nerd body. playing." It also, like of speaking of view count, we got like eighteen people watching us. It's dude. It's without nice. fail. Every time we go to break, anytime any one of us goes to break, view count goes up. <laughs> I don't understand. Hey, um, I, I keep question. telling you, it's of, the uh... best part of any stream. It's the sequel to the Dark Souls. <laughs> uh, the comments are brutal as fuck. Okay, I'm gonna read some of the comments. I mean, it was Brian spamming Reggie's LinkedIn, I think. I mean, you don't want to connect uh, with Reggie. Oh, he spammed a lot more than that, don't worry. <laughs> yeah, there was a lot. Why wouldn't you want to connect with Reggie? I mean, I would love to connect with Reggie. See? I'm only giving people oh, useful my information. My body Can I restart ready? this? Let's restart oh my this. god, I the comment. Oh shit, we got an bear! They're not wrong, I was bad. Well, some of these comments are asinine. Like the one from Tyler Johnson. Relax, dude. You're, you're going in there. You're gaslighting. You're, you're, you're gaslighting. I'm gaslighters. You're, you're gaslighting? You're gaslighting. You're gaslighting the Joker now? You're gaslighting the Joker. Gaslighting the Joker, yeah. When Sam said he couldn't come over tonight, I just messaged him back, I'm the Joker now. And then I didn't talk <laughs> and to I did him not for like respond. six hours. I'm the Joker. <laughs> <laughs> I, I texted my mom that and she said get fucked <laughs> by the way sam in voice channel chat this bottom one i wanted to be oh, one of my goodness. emotes kind of but it might be cool to tell what but it's oh, a great hang on let me see great dance sam, emote. you don't come over yeah, again sam, i'm spoiling assassin's creed yeah it's the one underneath Thanks oh yeah it's the, it's the momo token yeah yeah, yeah. It's, that's the one that's the one well, yeah that'd be a fun emote oh my god <laughs> the real story of why Peter got banned from Retro Roulette. Yeah. <laughs> Not clickbait. Okay, where do I leave off in this fucking stupid speed run? The game, the game that you can where play with those, with those tokens is like you, um, you scroll up just enough for one to pause the GIF, and then you try to get them in sync again. Yes. It's great when they freeze and they just stare at you. Yes, yeah. I agree. The new Retro Roulette logo in the in the top left hand corner is for the FromSoft marathon. But uh, Sam appreciates your comment, Alex, because uh, he takes his graphic design work very seriously and he's yeah. extremely good at it. And no one tells him that enough. <laughs> well, thank you. But the the yes, well, the controller uh, was Betsy's idea, but uh, I I fucked with the actual texture of it. I fuck with that. Wait, you, you consulted her for the FromSoft? No, no, the controller. I meant, not the FromSoft. And Moobot is sending out a beautiful reminder. If you just type in the words hashtag ER giveaway, you will be entered to win a free copy of Elden Ring. But you, you also have to be following the channel. The, the hit game by Nicocado Avocado. If you if you win the giveaway and you're not following the channel, your entry is void. That is true. You do need to. You, you do well, well, there. I think there's actually a condition in, in in the um in the trigger that says if you are not subbed or following, you do not get an entry. But uh, anyone, anyone out there, to give it a shot, see what happens. What if Ninja wins? I want, I want to, but also at the same time, like, I don't really use Steam right now, so I don't know if I. Oh yeah, well. If I win it. I mean, I, I I'd say do it anyway, but yeah, I mean, if you don't, if it depends well, on your computer, Peter, can you, you run? If you win, then you basically just got yourself a, a free code that you can give away to somebody as like a gift or something. 
That's true. Indeed. I mean, it's up to you, man. If if you want to enter, go for it. That's an easy birthday or Christmas gift. I think what Anthony's trying to say is he wants you to win, and then I think what Anthony's trying to say is enter me. And then he can, and then he can reap the benefit. Enter me. Well, that's pretty forward of you, Anthony. I mean, I didn't. Come on, SpongeBob, enter me. That's what he says, right? Come on, Goof, just enter for me. Oh, but come on, Goof, it's only an inch. <laughs> oh, come on, Goof, it only hurts a little bit. <laughs> what if we kiss? Alex says, "What if we kissed in the Adventures of Cookie and Cream?" And I and I agree. What if we did kiss in this game? Well, so 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 okay. So chat, I'm I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. Oh shit! Did Justin do it? Oh fuck I yeah! Did. Thank All right. God, it's chat, over. Chat, I'm gonna let you in on a little bit of a secret here over at Retro Roulette. Originally, uh, Justin and I were gonna play this game together. You can share one controller between two people. However, I've yet to talk to Justin about my true feelings for him. Therefore, I did not find it appropriate to be in the same room as him, sharing the same controller. <laughs> Um, but with that being said, we are going to do this again at yes. a later date. Because there is also <laughs> a very extensive versus mode in this game that is completely different from this. Yeah, I'm 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 very excited to try that out because ever since I discovered this game, I've always wanted to do it. <laughs> and as the proprietor of Retro Roulette, I'll also be inviting myself to this uh, to this event. Well. Um, he'll be sick inviting himself. Who are you? So some, sometimes when I cookie, I cream. <laughs> Dang. Imagine Brian spitting hot facts in this channel. Brian did it all for the cookie. Whoa, what the? Brian, here's an important question. Yeah. Completely off topic. Yep. Did you go with sushi or pizza tonight? We went with uh, sushi. We had umenoya. Nice. Because I was going to say, you were going to be having more pizza tomorrow. Yeah, well, I mean, we were most likely getting sushi. I just wasn't yeah. sure if Joe would eat sushi, but he did. Wait, Brian, Anthony, why Brian. did you not invite Peter? Oh, Peter, you want to come tomorrow? Excellent question. Well, uh, I actually, I would like to come. What time is it? everything going on? If Peter's not there, I'm Ooh, not coming. Ooh, that was a crazy save. save. Peter, you want me to drive that. you? I, if you if you're offering to drive, I will. Uh, yeah, I'll sure, man. I don't, would you okay. be able to drive him though if you're going for ramen, Sam? Because you'll already be. No, nah, I I I don't think I'm really gonna go for ramen. I. Wait, you I just know. said seventy five percent. I know. Okay, that but leaves, that doesn't mean a hundred. That leaves twenty five percent, man. Yeah, that doesn't mean a hundred. What changed your mind in the course of an hour? <laughs> Realizing I had to spend more time. With Wait, you. what? Dang. <laughs> Yo, we're about to. I'm kidding. No. Okay. Hard facts. If Yo. you want the truth, if you want the truth, <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> if you want the truth. My dad's having company over, so. Oh my god! So we're about to we're about to get into oh. a robot. Oh, wow, Alex, sick invite. A robot is really difficult to operate. Normally, oh, you'd have to use all the buttons on the control. Is that a armored core nod? Probably. Uh, y y probably. <laughs> Normally, you'd have to use yeah, all the I buttons mean, on the controller. Dang, the control Alex, are quite really. Simple. Alex Anthony, really what you, what, me Anthony, what do you and Betsy want for your birthdays? Burger with barbecue. <laughs> Burger with barbecue sauce, yeah. No, I can't do that. I can't do that. I, I can't do what that. What else would you like? I ethically cannot do that. I can't get I can't get I can't get you guys meat, but I can get you guys anything else. Bullshit. And here I was about to fucking ask for a Miyazaki A5 fucking ribeye, but I guess I only have fake friends in this fucking I only, chat. I, I'm sure that another friend. If I don't get, get to meet that, Peter tomorrow, can... I'm not coming. I'm sure your real friend Facebook will give you all the recipes. Dude, I'm getting mad going on you know, vibes yeah, from this. You know, this honestly, awesome. I know we joke about Brian becoming the Joker, but he will definitely become the Joker. <laughs> um, I, I will. If, if, if I get confirmation, that Peter, the joke. If I get confirmation that Peter's not coming tomorrow. I will go to party fair on my way and show up in full Joker costume. I I fucking I want you to. I kind of want him to do that anyway, but like yeah, you know. But I also I do want to go. Do that so. too. Oh my god! Wait, robot? Yeah, HK. That's what I've been saying. Yeah, HK. It's, it's from 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 always puts a robot in the games. They always put either a robot or some sort of mechanized creature in their game. Or some sort of skeleton. Literally! But, yeah, okay, but skeleton, like, is much more understandable in the fantasy setting. But literally, in Kingsfield, there's, like, 
mechanized creatures. Mechan e mechanized. But but skeletons, I mean, skeletons are always the best part because they're always goofy as fuck. Oh, how did that armor core to stream go? Uh, it was good for a man who was running on not a lot of sleep. <laughs> Well, I would say, like, there was, like, a, an actual honest review of it is there was a lot of improvements. Um, the only issue, the biggest issue I was facing was uh, something with the camera. For some reason, the camera would keep panning downwards. I think this may have been an issue with either the completely legitimate hardware I was running it off of or my controller or both. So I don't really know exactly. So I guess that kind of skews my opinion on it. But everything else was amazing. I mean, you got double the equipment in it. The lock-on seemed better. The weapon seemed cooler. Okay. Soundtrack that. seemed better. The menu was a lot better. And we got uh, the organization of Emerald because you know how you can side with different teams and organizations in that game. Mm -hmm. Well, there was one called Emerald who it was literally just like a Khajiit accent. And they kept rolling their R's like crazy. So whenever the voice actor would come on, uh, Bot and I were just in stitches. Because it was hysterical. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, Armored Core 2 was great. Uh, I really, it makes me want to play the rest of the series. It's like Jax has just joined. Hello. Like, oh my, whoa, what was going on there? Oh my god, it's Hi. Gex. Whoa. Howdy. Howdy. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of Armored Core games, but I would like to play a bunch of them. There's a lot going on there. And now it's now that it's basically been confirmed that they're doing a new armored core, it makes me want to play them even more. Yeah, no better time uh, like a present. Peter, that, to, to answer your question as to what we want for our birthday, uh, uh, really, like... Cocaine. Gift cards would be, would be, would be totally... Yeah, like, buy, uh, buy them yeah. $25 gift cards to cocaine. They'll love yeah, it. to drugs. Oh, <laughs> okay. Can I make this out to drugs? <laughs> Nuts. Yeah. <laughs> nuts. Yes. Really, really, right. uh, what I would really it. like more than anything it. is, it, it, it would be the Elden Ring. It's a, it, it's a sequel, it's a sequel to, to the Dark Souls. Soul. Yeah. I am not George R. R. Martin. Can we get Betsy to play Elden Ring? Is that a thing we can do? Uh, no. <laughs> no. Why not? There's I... not enough nuclear lasagna in it or whatever. Pasta, whatever. Oh my is. god, but it's Friday again, Garfy baby. <laughs> it's Friday and... again. It's Saturday, okay. Sunday. I only bring that up because the last game that oh, I Oh, I was supposed to jump over SDX here. Okay. Dang, Justin. The satis it's called the Satisfactory, yeah. <laughs> oh, I <laughs> called the Satisfactory. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! That factory had a gigantic quality of life improvement recently. I need to go back and try it out. Oh, but did they actually like, release the game? Is that the improvement? No, but <laughs> like, I'm just well, kidding. I mean, like, how do I, how do I even describe it? So you know how I, when you saw me playing it, I'd have to build things like one at a time. Yeah. You could just fucking like draw now. <sighs> it's, it's Ooh. Insane. Yeah, they, like they streamlined the fuck out of building shit. See, that's actually uh, that's more enticing. Yes, but don't get too enticed because the first the first chance you get of like, oh hey, I, I've got time, I can play a game with you, Anthony. It, we're playing Rise. Ha 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 
Yes, but yeah, no. I mean, Hi, Alex. I think Justin was holding off because yeah, of Alex. Alex. Let's see, right? Well, Justin, well, well, yes. Uh, well, yes. okay, but like. <laughs> But like, look, I will buy back. No. I'll buy, <laughs> You'll back. buy back the Switch copy. <laughs> I'll buy back. The, I can gift it to Chaz. Chaz does not game. Chaz what are we talking about? That game, and he also played Monster Hunter. So Chaz, hang on, hang on. Oh my God, I have a text message coming in right now. It says, uh, "Hi, it's your good friend Chaz. Um, don't know if you know this, but uh, I hate games now. Oh, that's so, cool. so I guess he won't be needing the copy of Rise." What world is this? I feel like I did more than four. Or maybe I just can't count. That's probably the case. Understandable. Maybe this is the fourth I one. I can't either. It just feels like I've been here for so long. Been so long. Same. Oh no, I messed that up. Okay. I gotta jump on here. <laughs> oh, my one mystical fan in the chat. <laughs> I'm doing horrible at this fucking fight. But yeah, I've basically decided that I'm not going to pick up Riot yet until there's a Steam sale because I I know that right now I've got a million other games to play, so like there's no rush for me to play it. And Capcom sales are usually exceedingly generous on Steam. Like, so I I can almost guarantee you the next like probably the summer sale that happens. Or maybe if there's a spring sale, it'll go on sale then, and I'll grab it then. I I assumed you had it on PC already. I have not bought it yet on PC <clears> because... <throat> Are you lagging, Alex? I, I'm hitching bad. I don't want to uh, don't drop $60 so. on it when I know for a fact I can get it on a sale, and I'm not in a rush to play it because it's just the base game right now, and uh, Sunbreak hasn't hasn't come out yet. Sunbreak so, is, uh, is that, uh, like, May, June? I forget when that is. Uh, I think it's gonna be, like, July, August. Oh, uh, okay. Like, it's, it's this summer. I know it's this summer. Yeah, but... yeah, I knew it was summer. I just wasn't sure. I'm very excited for that. The fucking, the fucking, uh, oh, what do you call it? I should the, uh, what, do you, what are they called? Flagship. The flagship monster. I have to, uh, awesome. fix some stuff after this match, Alex. Yeah, no worries. Brian hates Alex. Confirm. Update my graphics card. Last week, I might just, uh, I might just fix stuff later and jump on like Xbox or PlayStation or something to play it there instead. Now he hates us. Got it. So, no, so not like leave the chat. Yeah, he just, like, hate us. Switch things I'm playing on. No, oh, dude, you do not have to explain it. The Joker hates us. I can't believe I'm it's... getting to meet Peter tomorrow, and if he's not. Why don't you just? Going. Why don't you just smack me in the face right now? You know, like why don't you? Honestly, you can't. Get over with. I don't even know why you'd be here if you didn't do that. <laughs> I'm gonna hold Peter's hand the whole uh, time. Why don't, you, why don't you just pull my hair a little bit and like? Oh, fuck you know. no! Peter, do you like uh, do you like beer? Yes, I do like beer. I have some really nice pumpkin beers that I'd like you to try. Ooh. I like pumpkin beers. Some beers, some pumpkin beers I don't no. like, but a lot of them I do like. I guarantee you, you will like these. They're cool. very. I, I'm try. very, very picky about my beers, and I only Fuck. purchase like the highest quality shit I can. It has to taste that's good. Really so good I can you. almost guarantee you time, you're gonna like some of these. That's good. Half the time I buy Bud Light, so I'm not. Ooh. Oh food. my I goodness! Do, like, oh, but I do like, also like. You food. poor child. Yeah, I don't well, buy uh, beer unless <laughs> I like. I, I don't even buy beer. Really, I'm not going hear that? Good. He uh, he thinks Bud Light's beer. That's a good one. <laughs> me and William, me and William yes. Robert are gonna get the fuck along. It do be pissed. It. He do he do be pissed, Jesse, right? <laughs> He's like, He's pissed. Not, no, Bud Light is not good. It's not pissed. There are other beers that are Hold pissed. On, I won't Bud Light them. is oh, okay. Better than okay. Wait, didn't William Robert have Hang on, on y'all. Hang on, hang on. I got, I, I got something to tell you. Oh shit, yeah. William Robert. How's it going, dude? Oh, hello. Uh, hey, William. So, oh, so what, I like, what, what, I, what I was going to say is, okay. when I'm out on the road, I'm a firm believer that anyone who drinks and drives is reckless, stupid, and mm -hmm. an idiot, and an affront to nature. Right, right. Why, right. when right. I'm out on the road, right. I stick to Bud Light. Right. Oh, okay. Yeah, right, because it's not really drinking. Right, right, right. Yeah. I, I was gonna see say, William Robert as a pun. You can, son. Right. William just Robert, like... I distinctly recall in the last video I saw you in, you had a can hey, of Alex Budweiser. Here? 
I can't. Yeah, I, I think William Roberts. Yeah, but, but that's but that's Bud Weiser. It's not Bud Weiser. Oh my God, they taste basically the same. It's Bud. No, that's not true. Bud Weiser and Bud Light are two completely different things. One they're actually owned and by and different oh, companies. And could you actually I've get had Bud both Weiser of them, and they they, they, they taste like pretty the... similar. Okay, but what about Stella? Because... Oh snap! We got the next boss. My dad loves Stella. Ooh, next oh, boss. Like, Liquid communism. My old office oh, my manager right, used to love Stella. Why don't you party at our house? You go lie down. I can't hear you. Can't I'm sorry. That's bedtime. Son, yeah, I'm yeah. 45 uh, years old. I don't have a bed. Go to bed, William. You're you're, you're tired. All right, <laughs> shit. Aw. Trick Robot Bye, 99. Oh, what is that called? Oh, Reckless oh, Toy Breeder? I don't meet with. I don't meet William. Toy Breeder. Reckless Toy Breeder. Reckless Toy Breeder. Toy breeder. Can I make a new what? Tinder profile and put that in the bio? <laughs> I'm oh the reckless God. toy breeder. Gross. Haven't lost a step. Listen. <laughs> Just because. <laughs> I grew up with um, toys. From software, please. From software, really out here. <laughs> anyway, okay. Well, I'm I sad. William Roberts Rocky's gone. Got some kinks, man, but. I ain't here to shame. Say, like... So I'm so mad. William Roberts gone. Look, it's just yeah, he, 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 he's he's tired, and when he gets tired, he might say something raunchy, and you, you know, I I don't know. He, he he was getting pretty angry when 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 he looked like he was getting pretty angry when when Nick insinuated that Bud Light and Bud are the same thing. Thing. Alex, we have seven kills and I haven't played We're going like to pro, dude. It's I almost like the same company like makes months. them or something. I mean, no, he, he acknowledges that the same company makes them, but he says that Budweiser is a beer and Bud Light is not. That, that, okay. That's how he... Okay. That's, how, that's his worldview. I wouldn't challenge that. Wait, nine kills now? Um... You know, it's crazy, though, Ant. I think, uh... Who's that over your shoulder? Is that, uh... Is that George R. R. Martin? Also, still. Uh, well, as a matter of fact, Sam, yes, it is me, George. Oh Martin. shit, George! Welcome to Retro Relay. Welcome to the stream, dude. Oh, How's it going? Thank you. Thank you. Yes, uh, I, I'm. I, I'm yeah. very. I'm, I'm excited to see that you're all looking forward to the Elden Ring, which is a sequel to this game called Dark Souls. Yeah, yeah, right. dude. I cannot Thanks believe you worked on this game. Tell me how how uh, what did they have you do for this game? <laughs> Well, first they had me write a bunch of characters that you're going to really fall in love with, and then they had me kill them off. Oh, <laughs> oh that's, so... that's great. Uh, did, now tell me, like, did you have any part of, like, the world building? <clears throat> matter of fact, yes. You see, they handed me a napkin while we were out to lunch, and I wrote uh, the entire world's lore down on the napkin. And then I wiped, uh, I wiped my face with it, and, um, I, and I got some ketchup all over it. Miyazaki basically picked it up and put it in his mouth, and uh, he, <laughs> he, chewed on, <laughs> he chewed on that for a while. And right. um, and then after that... Oh my god, um, it's so crazy! Uh, yes, it, it, it is very oh, crazy. Oh no, but... this is an ice level. Oh, that's gonna suck. Oh god, I, I'm gonna apologize in advance, Justin. That fucking that that's bad. Okay, so here's what we gotta do. All over the damn place. Oh, what I gotta do is I go. I gotta. Uh, I think I got this. I gotta jump a lot because that will keep me in place. Jump around. And that'll prevent me from sliding. Jump around. Jump up. Jump so back, uh, so down. George. Get down. So George, can you give us a little insight into like any of the characters? Well, you see, the NDAs are, are very strict, Sam. But I can tell you this: um, you're, you're going to you're going to enjoy yourself, and uh, I, I think it's it's one of my finest works yet. And uh, if, now, if you'll excuse me, I have to get back to not writing Winds of Winter. <laughs> well, George, I really appreciate George, coming out to retro a lot. I just want to know how many uh, bags of Cheetos were killed in the process of writing. <laughs> In writing Elden Ring, I probably consumed anywhere between fifteen to twenty thousand bags of Cheetos. <laughs> fifteen to twenty thousand bags. Will I be able to follow the game if I didn't read the books? You're still a fan. I, I do think that you you are actually a fan, but I do think that you should read the books if you liked what you saw on TV. So basically, you just became the Cheeto guy for Toy Story guys. George, yeah. how big is your penis? <laughs> I haven't seen my penis in 25 years, I think. Uh, I don't know. George, is it true you named your penis Jon Snow? 
No, no, I did. I, I named it Summer Child. Oh, he named it John Blow. <laughs> George, is it true you left the coffee cup in that episode? <laughs> Dang, too soon. Uh, I, I am. Uh, I'm gonna play the fifth on that one. I'm gonna go to the box. Anybody need anything? I'll be right back. Here, use this med mist. Uh, I guess that oh. does something. Also, I redeemed hydrate like two minutes ago. Has anyone drank? Oh, I did. I've been. Oh, I've been drinking. No. Oh, worries. good. Okay. I just want to make sure my homies were hydrating. Yeah, I drank. Yeah. How do I, I water on even me. do this? I got that thing on me. Yeah. Literally got that I'm thing. Oh my god. Oh man. Down. Why can't I? I just want to do the strat. I just want to do the strat. Maybe I'm not supposed to. What? I can fight the boss head on, but it's not the same thing. Life's been real different since me and Brian became professional for that. <laughs> it's a little weird. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's been pretty it interesting. I also don't know how to get out of here. Yeah, it's like you guys don't even recognize me on the street anymore. Uh, are you playing Dang. Fortnite? Oh, yeah. the friend. Yeah, yeah. No. Oh, the friend. Fortnite. No, Fortnite. We're actually amazing at Fortnite. I don't care what anybody I, says. You guys playing Fortnite? Yeah, you want to come play Fortnite? Yeah. No. All right, fuck yeah. After this, after this round, come play Fortnite. With Only us. if you do the dances. Uh, we actually have to keep moving, Alex. Well, the dances are the integral part. There's a guy about to kill me. Oh, yeah, 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 I see that. I see actually, that. actually, no, I can't. I'm watching Shallow House. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> I can't. I'm watching Shallow House. I have one health. I'm gonna have plans. Okay, yeah, definitely. The guy, who, the guy who walks on all fours. Oh, I gotta, like, move right a little now, bit during this, too. Watch this. Okay. Uh, okay, cool. Got you. We'll pull this back. Shooting at me. Sam, what's I'm not too sure how I'm supposed to get past this right here. What's up here? Name the guy who walks uh, all fours and shall If I ask. may. What? Try going at it. I have to hit it at like the exact angle it looks like. Um, yeah, I was gonna say try try going in oh, at Oh shit, what the fuck are these guys? Oh, those are NPCs. Like that. There you go. Yeah. Oh you got the Spider-Man thing? Go. Yeah. Let's go. Funny. Oh, man, though. Let's go. I pull up. All right, Peter. I'm sorry. One more time. Guy who walks in all fours in shallow hell. His name. Uh, it, I think it's. Does it start with an R? No. Uh, does it start with a? Fuck. Wait. What's his name? You know who it is, though, right? Like the actor? I've not seen no, the actor, part of this game. like the character. And for oh yeah, no, of course, yeah, I know who you're talking about. Yeah. But uh, are but... we talking about Mr. Kirby? Who? Uh -huh. Isn't his last name Kirby or something? Are there? Not thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, fuck this run. I'm gonna For our next it. guest, we have none other hey, than what? Orson Welles, straight from the grave. Oh, Orson! <laughs> hey, welcome to Retro Roulette. Orson, how big's your car? Mr. Wells to you. Oh, Mr. Sorry. Wells, I'm, I'm so sorry. Uh, Mr. Wells, thank you for coming to Retro Roulette. How, how are you doing ever since dying? That's what I'm drinking. <laughs> <laughs> are you drinking a port? It was uh, unfortunate business, but you could say that I rather enjoyed it. Interesting, interesting. Um, okay, well, uh, Mr. Wells, now that you are alive, how long do you plan staying with us, and are you working on any future projects? Yes, you see. I'm My currently collaborating with an author called George R. R. Martin on the sequel. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, that's not good. Oh, you are, huh? Okay, cool. Yeah, he's he's very established these days. Yes, we're working on yeah, something called Elden Ring Two. Oh, oh. 
<laughs> Interesting. Well, to be critically acclaimed Elden Ring, which is going to be a sequel to this hit video game series called The Dark Soul. Well, well, oh my God, Mr. Wells, this is quite a re revelation for all of our viewers. Um, well, if you don't mind me asking, sir, what is your involvement in the yeah, project? Come, th come this way. Let's go around the mountain. I mean, I have to heal, so... Oh, okay. I'm going to be acting, directing, and starring in the, uh, the sequel. I'll be playing the majority of the NPCs, you'll see, and you'll find that, uh, the rest oh, of the staff... Oh, come on! Yes, honey? Find a hiding place if you can. Okay. Yep. I'll probably come to bed around midnight. Are you going to bed? I'll see you guys later, but... Dang. Dang. Alex Lee. Big, big dang. I don't know who said it, I'm just joking. Get off of me! Yeah, Keep the well, sheets warm for me, bitch. It is almost Betsy's birthday. That's true. It was relentless. It's Betsy's birthday in 14 minutes. Yeah. Wow. You gaslighting me? Exciting. You gaslighting Betsy? If, yeah, I don't get gonna... to hold, if I don't get to hold Peter's hand right, tomorrow, I'm riding. Let's call it corporate. Oh my god. <laughs> Me and Brian are gonna make all sorts of physical contact tomorrow. Yeah. It's gonna be fucking crazy. So good what? Dang. Hmm. Here, I, I dropped a ice level thing. thing is oh going my to god! Actually be oh. hell, Justin. Yep. Man, I want to stay been. up. I don't want to go to bed. Oh, I got sniped from the other side. I Are got so up? much damage on the guy on the left, though. There's a guy right. <laughs> oh man, uh, there. I jumped over that. Oh yeah, definitely don't get me up. Uh, they were in the middle, in the way. It's all good. Good try though. Fifth and we place. were, yeah, fifth place with like nine fifth kills to start. Place. Oh, so I can keep pulling it and get more platforms. Okay. Beat, are you That's ready for Fortnite? That's a lot easier now. Fortnite. Yes. Yeah. Actually, I actually, if I'm being honest, I do not have Fortnite downloaded on anything. So I can't. Uh, he's gonna play. What? Uh, what? Justin, I don't know if you saw. There's Download it while I'm there. You, what? While you wait. I yeah, I was. I was gonna I miss it because Fortnite right now. I tried it's to fun. get it and I fell in the it's water free. and it wasn't really worth it. Okay. Shit. I just noticed you kept like. It's gonna restart my game really quick, Alex. Oh yeah, yeah. No worries. Oh my god, that's a sign I should be done. So I gotta find a way to see. Sam, come play Fortnite with us. No. Come on, when was the last time you played Fortnite? Uh, hey Justin, what does Cookies and Cream know. have? What? Cookie. What, is, what does Cookie and Cream have that Dark Souls doesn't? I bought a little cookies, um, John. Wait. <gasps> oh! oh this is cookies. not Dark Souls? I'm gonna go get some cream upstairs. Game. What are you talking about, dude? It, it got cream. Does Dark Where Souls have cute cookies? bunnies? Yes. They, that does. eventually murder you. <laughs> In a video game. In a video game. Oh my goodness, Sorry, I wasn't paying yeah. attention! Oh, The answer we were looking for is Alright, let, let's restart that. I I was not not paying attention to that at all. Sigh. <laughs> I got very distracted. But it? yes, Dark Souls doesn't have color. And that's one of the things that turns me off of Dark Souls. It just you has know? subdued color. It's not enough for me. I want my no, colors loud and bleeding. Well, well, Elden, never well Elden Ring! Never that's... mind, I think Anthony should go to bed now. <laughs> Elden Ring does have big hands. Elden Ring has big hand creatures. <laughs> big hands. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know where that hand creature is, but I can't wait for it to fight it. No, like, I, I, like, like honestly, I get them, the right? whole color like, thing, but like, I, I, whenever I look at like these these games now, because I used to feel the same way, but whenever I look at them now, I kind of like, I like the level of detail in them, just like in the environments and stuff, and also like. That, like, washed out kind of look does remind me a little bit of Shadow of the... So I kind of dig that. Yeah. What? So. What? What is this? Yeah, I don't know. It's a game. G, G I wonder. G, I wonder. G, G, I do wonder. G, 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 G. G, 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 G. When a girl asks you what she wants. Anyway, uh, Orson Welles, where did you go? I'm right here, Sam. I've been. Oh, through. oh, there you are. Yeah, so with Elden Ring 2, uh, can you provide any insight to the story? Yes, always. Oh, cool. Okay. Oh, so I'm not What kind of insight are you looking for? 
Are you looking oh, I just want to know, like... Insight that will grant you the ability to see things that cannot normally be seen by no mortal eyes? Mr. Wells, are you familiar with Bloodborne? Yes. <laughs> fantastic. One of the greatest pieces of media that I've ever seen. It's a masterpiece. The cultural significance of Bloodborne is one of the greatest things that I've ever come across. Man. Oh, really? You've played Bloodborne, Mr. Wells? No, I don't play playing video Mr. games. Mr. Wells, how big is your penis? Uh, you stop see. asking him that. He's not Milton Burrow. Holy shit. That's a joke for all the young kids out there. Oh, I was just a split second too late on that. Okay. Shout it again. There we go. Yeah, wow, the video is way behind, even in Discord. Oh, wait, no, that's on Twitch. Never mind. I don't know how to pull these wedges. Uh. Come on! Yeah, there's one. Come on! Four! Three! Oh! With three seconds of spare. Go, 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 yes! Oh, baby. Woo! That was just the first ice level, wasn't it? I got three more. Oh, my God. I'm so sorry. Did you have any other questions for me? I have to go soon. Yes, Mr. Wells. Uh, how long do you stick around for? How big is your penis? Now listen. I don't know where you think, who you think you are to keep asking me about the size of my penis. But I'm not going to tolerate it anymore. You continue to ask me inappropriate questions, I'm leaving. Oh, Mr. Wells, we deeply apologize. He's, uh, he's got issues. Um, what, uh, what's your, what's gonna be your next, uh, what's gonna be your next masterpiece? Well, after I'm done working on Elden Ring 2, I'm going to be, which is going to be my first endeavor into the video game industry. After that, I'm going to be returning to film. Oh, got, got any prospects yeah, in the pipeline? Of course. There are several What's projects up? that have, I started when I was a young man that never got to see the light of day because I had many enemies in the film industry. Those enemies are dead now, Sam. I no longer need to worry about them. There's nothing to inhibit me. And because of my legacy and my greatness, there will be people jumping at the opportunity to work with the name I Orson love this Wells. snowman. That's a polar bear. They're dangerous, so be careful when you pass by. Yes, anything else? That's true, Mr. Wells. Well, I appreciate you coming out to Retro Roulette. Okay. I'm surprised we're not doing anything else with that polar bear. Naturally, Sam. The pleasure is all mine. I hope you enjoyed the Elden Ring and the Elden Ring 2, which is a sequel to Elden Ring, which is a sequel to the Dark Souls. Yeah, <laughs> I very I very much will. Thank you, Mr. Wells. And uh, may you rest in peace. Who's your penis? <laughs> Guys, I don't know uh, if you just saw that, but Orson just kind of fizzled out of existence. Oh, well, I'm glad you got to stop by, you know? Yeah, he's, he, oh he's very busy as a ghost these days. I think he's got a. I think he mentioned something about having a commercial in 15 minutes. Oh, okay, gotcha. That makes it. It makes sense, right? Yeah. Anyway, I'll BRB. Well, uh, Sam, your BRBs are usually pretty long, so if, in the event that I'm not here when you get back, good night, and I'll see you tomorrow. In the event that is true, good night, my friend. And tell Can't Betsy believe. I said happy bongi. I'm not gonna be in the same car as Sam and Peter. I'm riding. I can't come. Uh, if you if you drive to my house, I'll drive you. 
that's a that's a that's a hard baby with us. actually. Carpool with us? Honestly, that sounds pretty fun. Well, yeah. Ooh, My, I, oh, I will let you know. I'm, I'm, I will exclusively I'm, play the story so far in the car. If you let's go. I do, I do be loving the story. So Level far. three. Yeah. I'll take I'll take my shirt off in the car. Do, 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 <laughs> anyway, I'll be right back. Do, do, You're doing pretty good, Justin. That was that you handled that one way better than the first one. They do be a good band. Yes. What about them? Which band? The story so far. Yeah. Oh, they're they're pop punk. They v good. Huh, that sounds terrible. If you're a sad boy, <laughs> you'd love them. They're not terrible. Well, I know story of the year, <clears throat> which is a different. Losing band. points yeah, on pop punk they're... already, but you know they they do be a different is, band. Is, is, is I didn't know Sprinkle to... listen to pop punk. Uh, a lot Jim of Joker people game. listen to pop punk. Wretch. That's true. I love pop punk. Oh, it means you just have to stop what you're doing immediately, oh. which means but I'm not the biggest fan of that. And stretch, everybody stretch. And I think Sam would need to hydrate set. as well. Or if they made us more Actually, I need to hydrate. Oh, oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> this game's giving me a workout. <laughs> my, uh, my In a good way. <laughs> no, oh my goodness, cream. I didn't mean to move cream just yet. Alright, that's fine. We got 50 seconds. 50 seconds on the clock. Don't forget to move cookie. Oh yeah, I am. I'm doing like little flicks every couple seconds. Or rather, every couple frames. Was that clairvoyant? Well, hey, has anyone here ever listened to a band called Danger Kids? Yeah, I like Danger Kids. I haven't heard okay. of them. They're pretty similar to they're like a they're like a new gen Lincoln Park kind of deal. Really? Yeah. Sounds they're like uh interesting if that's they true. do they they're they're very like you could tell they were very heavily inspired by Lincoln Park. What? Man. To move by the that canoe same Lincoln Park excellence. To move the yeah, canoe. Yeah, da Danger kids, Danger kids. Like I was really into Danger Kids when me and Sam worked at Best Buy. If you they wanted were, their first first album. I've listened left. I've listened to some to, to an album or two of theirs and they're like a much heavier Lincoln Park. Like they're really like, mm. like if the, if they're if they're like, if you can compare them to Lincoln Park, that's fair. But they th their music is way heavier. It's like it's Lincoln Park with more screaming. Mm. Yes. Yes. Yeah, okay. Oh man, this is um Ape Escape all over again with the canoe. I don't know if they still make music. I I remember their first album and then like their second album kind of came out and it was like. I don't remember it being as good, and then I don't like. I never heard anything again about them ever again. Danger Kids? Yeah. Uh, they. <laughs> the only reason I know anything about them is because they actually did some music for uh, Sonic Forces. Oh, interesting. So, and they well, had. That's also kind had... of an older game. No, not really. That was the last Sonic game. When did that come out? 2018, I think. That's four years ago. Yeah. That, yeah, but that's what I'm saying. I haven't heard any, uh, I haven't heard anything from Danger Kids in years, so it's like I don't know if they're still making music or not. Here, let me. Let, I'll Google it for you. I remember their first album and their second album. I don't remember anything after that. But you know, this is also like very long ago. What'd you say, Jess? I really wish Modern Baseball would come back. I never got into yeah. Modern Baseball. I didn't think so. They have some good mm -hmm. stuff. I really miss. Oh Modern my goodness! Baseball. I hate. This is Ape Escape all over again with the with the rowing. I hated it there, and I hate it here. I got disowned. So, uh, yeah, there are two albums. You're you're not wrong. Yeah. So they and, and their second album came out when like forever ago, right? 2017, actually. Yeah. Like so, I haven't heard anything from them in forever. Well, they have that's that's because they haven't done anything in forever. I remember their second album being like okay, and their first album being like really catchy. I actually Damn only it. listened to their second album, and I really liked it. You should definitely Try listen to their first album, and I remember first. enjoying that more. So, okay, cool. wait, what band is it? Danger Kids. Okay. Danger Mouse. <laughs> you should and listen to their first album. What does like any of this have to do it from? What's up? What does what any of this have to do it from? What did you say, Jess? No, just asking what it like. What what are like they similar to? Like, the they're just they're just like Linkin Park with more screaming. Okay. Oh my goodness, they're both on me! Uh, so you want to know what any of this has to do with Brom? Yes. Well, 
I can explain all this, but it's going to be a little long-winded. So, the, re the way I can link this back to From is because um, this game is really, really hard. It's kind of almost like, you know, it's, it's super difficult. So, it kind of reminds, and the controls and the aesthetic kind of remind me of a Sonic game. And like I said, uh, Danger Kids did music for a Sonic game, so that's that, that, that's why I asked about them. I remember buying their first CD at Best Buy, like, ten years ago. Also, I okay. might have just wanted to relate to Brian about music for once. You should listen to their first album, man. You'll probably I never relate to anybody about music. I might, I might check it out. <laughs> So what kind of bands do you normally Except for Sam. Except for Sam. Sam, I really hired my vinyl collection. Huh? What kind of bands does who listen to? <laughs> I guess anyone. Uh, usually just Christina Aguilera. Vinyl collecting problems. <laughs> <laughs> Justin. Or Paul. I know. Uh, and Obama, it was me. me for a win. We listen to Big Ag and no one else. I used to have Aguilera. Big, Ag. Big Ag. What about Beartooth? Like I do love Bear Tooth. They're really good live, honestly. They I really fucking are. Love oh my goodness! Tooth. Why did they have to copy Ape Escape with this? Problem. And then I Prevail is pretty good live too. I Prevail is so good. I was listening to them like, the like oh, I've been no. listening to Come them so on. much this week. No, they I don't give me never this. know that the price I paid. Look into yep. my eyes. We are not the same. Yeah, this is where you fall apart. I saw yeah, them a so couple good. years ago. I think it was the year before COVID broke out. It was in Trenton. Um, it was the. I think it was the. What do I even do here? Was I'm it back. the day to remember? Hey, you're still here. I did not yeah, go to that, back, but I do here. love I Prevail, and I do yeah, remember. Like, it was with the day to remember. I think something I can. It was something swim the band. They were the openers. I will prevail. That sounds super familiar. Come on, come on, come on, yeah. come on, yeah. come on, come on, come on. No, no, give it to me. Come on. No. Oh no. I love come on. No. Oh my goodness. Have you heard of Turnover? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not listening to them now. I like Turnover. I watched that. I that was like painful. Turnover's like, you know... is The controls are like awful for this. Windows down in the summer type vibe. I fucking bet they are. It's a, Again, it's literally the same shit that Ape Escape pulled. And I was terrible at it in this game. I'm terrible at it here. My favorite band is Architects. The hey, sequel uh, to Archel. Sam, have we figured out how to do gift commands yet? Yeah, but uh, Justin Probably doesn't have them to, uh, on his end. Architects and Mayday Parade. He just has to add. He just has to add the links in OBS. I love Mayday Parade. Mayday Parade actually, um, they're doing a COVID comeback tour. I know. I'm. I have. I have tickets for two days in a row. <laughs> of course you do. Me and my sister are going to Starland to see the, uh, both both nights because they're doing uh, they're they're doing their. Sec second and third albums in three I agree, years. HK. Yeah. I agree. So we got tickets for yeah, both nights because, like, I fucking love Mayday Parade. Oh my goodness. I'm the kid that would literally just blast Oh Well, Oh Well. Why in the can't. Car. So I get oh well, oh yeah. well. So I do, you, do you know, um, hold on, I'm gonna name three bands. Do you know Turnstile? I've heard I of them, I've never style. listened to them. I fucking love Turnstile. Do you know Mom? Their new album. Their new album. Do you know who? Like, fucking fantastic album. Yeah, Peter, they're I, really... I mean, they're, their older stuff is great, too, but, like, their new yeah. album was, like, that was a game-changer, Glow On. Like, and Mom Jeans I just had a new song come out, too. That's cool. I haven't heard that yet. Mom uh, Jeans, I haven't I like Turnstile a lot, though. What about Hot Molly? Hot Mulligan? I've been meaning I, to check them I don't out. Know who I, really I don't know who they are either. I don't know who they are either. They're kind of, they're like, I hate, like, the definition of this, but they're, like, Western emo. <laughs> Interesting. What? I get that. Yeah. <laughs> Have you heard any Cloud Nothings? No. Before? I definitely recommend checking them out. It's, but you uh, showed me big, another big band, game. Peter. Anxious? I, really like I think I told you about. What was it? it? Anxious? Was it Anxious? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was them. I think they knew yeah, the control for pads, so they deliberately like made made the enemies docile. Yeah, they knew. <laughs> they knew. There's a reason why they, they're giving me all these clocks out here if I can freaking reach them. Safe to say what? I think it's safe to say you like the one you them. Wait, say that again? I think it's safe to say that you like the Wonder Years. 
Uh, yeah, I'm not. I I, I haven't listened to them much, but I do Ooh, like the one I'm of your more slaps. Of like a, yeah, more. I'm yeah, more I'm, of a I'm, real friends knuckle puck state oh, champs neck sli deep I'm kind of guy. On Wonder Years, I need to actually. Wonder Years is yeah, great. I, would, yeah. I prefer real friends over the Wonder Ooh, Years. Actually, yo, yeah, first I do be liking real friends and. Yeah, I think they're a little better. I like neck deep state champs knuckle puck story so far. All those. Puck yo, puck I bands. fucking love Ben Barlow. Oh, I met him. That man. There's a picture of me with him on my Instagram. Wait, what? Yeah. yeah. What'd you say? You guys, I mean, you I, guys, uh, if you like... I, years ago, I paid for a meet and greet, and I met him. I met the whole band, what? but like, I only cared about meeting him, so I took oh, a selfie with him. Oh, my Wait, goodness. Wait, you have that on your Instagram? Mm -hmm. Yeah, if you scroll down really far. Thank you. Years ago. Hold on. Dang, Justin out here gaming. I, I, I fucking love that. Out here gaming. Yeah, that was I pretty like, epic. Oh, I had, like, no! I was, like, so nervous to meet them. Like, my friend, I was with my friend at the time, and he went around and got his vinyl signed by the whole band. And I, I was like, that's too intimidating for me. I'm literally you. just going to get a selfie with Ben. So I waited online and got a selfie with him, and then, and then like, left the meet and greet. Amazing. Hold on, I'm scrolling way down. Jesus, you have a lot of photos. Yeah, I do, I do be posting. Um, <laughs> why did you do this? You be quite the poster. <laughs> Why would, did you take this from Ape Escape? Oh what my year god. Is it? Oh god. It was, it was a while ago. You Let's might have to go. scroll a little bit. I mean, I have, I have pictures with a bunch of... I used to... When I was in college, like, I would pay for meet and greet for every band I liked. I, I met Bullet for My Valentine. I met Ooh. Sleeping uh, With Sirens. I, I hate met, Bullet for My Valentine I met, so much. So, I love Bullet. Uh, I met I, so many bands. My, only, be problem, huge my only problem with Bullet for My Valentine is that they always get confused with My Bloody Valentine, who is, like, my favorite <laughs> band of all time. Yeah, I, whenever I, I bring, so. Whenever I mention My Bloody Valentine to people, they think I'm talking about Bullet for My Valentine, mm -hmm. who I think are fine. Like, I like Bullet. I, I like Bullet. them. Um, I like both my Valentine. Oh, thank but goodness. A very different thank band you. Valentine. Yeah, they're a very different band. And, uh, yeah, <laughs> like it always happens whenever I say that my bloody Valentine is my favorite band. So, that better really, not come back really from really the cool boss. Do you know what year it was? I can't wait for it to come back from the boss. Um, I'm like really. It, it, yeah, I'm it's gonna come back from the boss. Just to uh, spite me. You might just have to keep scrolling. After this Fortnite game, I can look and send it to you if okay. I can find it. But if you keep oh, scrolling, okay. you'll see it. Yeah. If it's there's like other pictures of me with other bands there too. I was like, well, uh, every time I got an opportunity, I was like, yes, I'm meeting this band. Wow, and Brian never met my. I'm band. on the Hazley uh, picture. Hmm? It was who else did I meet? I met a Trey. Brian never. Brian never met Change of Heart, which is fucked I up. I didn't. I met Bless the Fall. <laughs> I met. You know what? <laughs> You know what? Oh, like, I mean, red. Yeah, I get it too. What? Never shout never was like my thing, and then like some people it was like sleeping with sirens. You know, like oh, kill me. <laughs> I was I was big into yeah. sleeping with sirens for a hot minute. I have a lot yeah, of their I, like, I have a, a lot of their albums on vinyl. I wasn't like in love with them. I definitely like my my biggest thing was never shout never at one point, and it used to be one of the damn. <laughs> Oh I'm no. Sorry. Oh yeah, we've talked about that. Okay, so oh, I'm gonna no. have to restart. How do we this. boot Jess from the chat? <laughs> Alright, let's restart this. I mean, Honestly, some gems? So. <laughs> I'll hear nothing of it. Nah, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. No, I know you are. Do, 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 do. Oh, I hate nah, that they gave me two. Fine, just texted me, sections. no, seriously, how do we boot <laughs> Jess from the server? <laughs> 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 Can I believe this betrayal? <laughs> Bet <laughs> betrayed, betrayed by Avenged Sevenfold is playing in the background right now. Dun, 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 dun. Dude, when was the last time Avenged made good music? Never. Oh my it's god. Back country. I love yeah, not, probably, uh, pro probably. Yeah, I mean, I mean. All right, I'll, I'll, I'll be an apologist for Nightmare. I loved the Nightmare. Album. I'm not, I'm yeah. not, I'm really, not going to be an apologist. I'm I'm very not, Nightmare, not Nightmare is where I end it, but Nightmare was only, good because of really like the. Like Nightmare was okay. so Because of the emotional impact of it. Like, Nightmare with losing the rep, you know? I think this is the photo, Brian. January 14, 2012. Uh, I mean, you could post it in voice channel chats and I will confirm. I mean, if it's if it's me with Ben Barlow, it's the photo. Oh, it's with... Oh, you're in it. I thought it was just a picture of him. Okay, hold on. No, no, I, I met him. It's just, it's me taking a selfie with him. Okay, I gotta look. No, it's him, with it. ben, it's him with Ben Gazzara. <laughs> Um, was Ryan with Ben Shapiro? I see the a... Best Buy photos. 
It was a state. Just chance. talking with my wife about Brinkle and. Uh... All right, hold on. Let me find it. No, Brian, I got it. All right, I'm I'm yes, I'm, I'm mid Fortnite match, but this is important. Other way. I'm mid nutting. This is not important. Where is it? <laughs> it was a hot minute ago. Are you are you humming the story so far? <laughs> I am. Yeah, yeah. He's, it's clairvoyant, I think. Fake fam. Fake fam. What are you talking about? God. <laughs> out of <laughs> all out of singing? all songs to hum, you oh, choose that. I just scrolled all the way back to the top. Uh, you hate me. You choose that sad, sappy piece of shit song. Dude, that's a good song. I'm kidding. It is a good song. Come on, come on. I love everything they do. It's what he sings to Amanda 24-7. And honestly, I don't know. You can slide like Apex style now. I didn't know that. Did you how? In Fortnite? Watch me. Yeah. Look. You really? Oh. I'm jealous. Are you nipple like, whipping in day night? Wait, who did I meet? Memphis Mayfire. Oh yes, I did beat Memphis. And you guys like Joyce Memphis Manor. was my favorite band. Ooh, uh, yeah, I, yeah, I was listening to Joyce Manor. Yeah. That's why my yeah, Instagram. That. That's why my Instagram name is Challenger because of their Challenger album. That was my favorite album for a very long time. Yo, speaking of me, speaking of Memphis, uh, the Hollow in college was like my fucking jam. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, I'll be right back, guys. I'm getting a call. Okay. Mm -hmm. right. Yeah, I listen. I listen like in Brookdale. I listen to the Hollow constantly. Dude, the Hollow fucking slaps. Yeah. How did this become what bands we listened to in college? In high school. I still. I still I think. Mean, uh, well, I, think that, <laughs> I don't know. Good question. That's me. It's gonna be. It's gonna get weird if I start talking about bands I listened to in college. Yeah, I mean like, that was just really one of cool. many, but that was like, definitely was, like, one. <laughs> what did Jintoka said? I drug myself from melatonin. Oh no! <laughs> Understandable. Well, well night, Jintoka. Good night. Good night. And, uh, Where the fuck is my? You have a good night, buddy. Marlo. Thanks for coming by. Yeah. Oh, Jin, did you did you uh, enter the Elden Ring giveaway? Yes, the uh, it's it's called the Elden Ring. <laughs> Wait, are you still here? <laughs> the ring is coming yeah, for I'm you. still here. Oh, come on. Tell Betsy I said happy birthday. I will. Um, you're actually the first one to. This level is just fucking horseshit. Oh, that does not count as it's because I or... don't understand how the rowing works yet. Oh, you did? Okay, good. Yeah. Okay, cool. Have a good night, dude. Our fingers are crossed for you, Tyler. Cool. Yeah. And, we'll, and don't worry, we'll rig it in your honor anyway. <laughs> I'm so confused. Did I like dream this Man, happened? The reason and why Tyler had happen? to use melatonin to fall asleep is because clearly oh, we are way too entertaining and engaging. Or and he got bored of the conversation we're having. Uh, understandable. <laughs> <laughs> Have a nice night. Yeah. Yeah. Understandable. If he got bored of the conversation, he wouldn't need the melatonin. Oh god, yeah, I was what gonna is say, doing? yeah. Okay, but uh, you're okay, gaslit. but um, if you don't care also, about pop punk, I'm actively being gaslit right yeah. now. <laughs> also, Justin, I, for the record, didn't mean for this to just spiral into uh, this kind of long conversation about music. I, I just, I had a thought and just wanted to. God yeah. forbid. Understandable. Have a nice day. Yeah. Understandable. Have a beautiful evening. Uh, Jess yeah. joined back. That's oh, what I. I haven't played a Souls game since so dying a million times in the first Demon Souls of Decker. Oh my god, so you're, so you're, you, you're that's some OG first? shit, okay. Wow. What? Alright, well, Jin, the good heal. news is you might be playing Elden. You can heal with the pizza party thing. Pizza I, have party. The, uh, I have this thing. The okay. spray. So, let's roll. Okay, okay, okay. Night, Jen. You take care. Night, Jen. Tidy night, friend. Bye-bye. Right, what? Oh, I just, just deleted all the messages by accident. Let me no tell one, you. No oh, yeah. I, just, I saw some pictures for a second, then they were gone. I, I, I posted them back. I, once, I posted the Ben picture twice, so I, actually, I tried to delete it, but it deleted all of them. That's oh. me with Sleepy with Sirens, and Bullet from My Valentine, and Ben from Neck Deep, and the lead singer of Broadside, and Aaron Gillespie. We're top Am 10 by the way. You're quite the, in... quite the pop punker there. Iron Gillespie was an asshole. <laughs> Understandable. Oh my goodness. And, he, and Brian's never met me. It's fucked up. It's true. I, well, I'll, well, I'll rectify that less than 24 hours from now. I don't like yeah. to meet bands anymore ever since that incident. Oh god, he that kissed Kellen on the mouth. 
No, I'm kidding. Oops. You meant R. Kelly? No. <laughs> was Sam in the closet? <laughs> no, but I, I had I had like Sam a I had like, I had like a really weird kind of realization. Um, yeah. <clears throat> you might want to bring yourself like something to eat because we're I know we're getting pizza. There's gonna be chips and salsa. Um, so I know that's what? vegan, but I just yeah. I, wait. Is I, pizza I not vegan? Well, Sam, yeah, it's no, not pizza's vegan, not vegan. Right? It's made with cheese, cheese on it. Um, yeah, it's true. It's Sam, made with moose I... knuckles. Sam, what time do you want to go tomorrow? Like, uh, I was probably gonna go. Uh, go probably like a couple hours before people showed up. Well, what is that time? Like, I, that's still not a number for me. Like, like, like you were gonna be here at like what? I don't know, like three, four. Or, oh, okay. Let's go, okay. Peter, cool. do me a favor. Text me your address so I know like where. Maybe just like. Because I'll have maybe, to backtrack a little bit, but I don't. It, I don't mind it, at all. Stop at KFC on the way and pick up a a, a Beyond yes. Nuggets meal. Oh, oh we could do yes, that. Please. We could do that. I'll I'll buy it. Like, I like them. Actually, no, I don't know if I. I don't know. If I, what I, kind I of pizza are we getting tomorrow, Ant? Uh, that's good to be up to the queen. Is it the same thing as last time? Okay, but I'm the queen. Well, it's the same place, but I don't oh, know yeah. if we're gonna get the same pies. I'm not eating any pizza. Oh yeah, My you still have is... not told me what's going on. So what are you gonna eat instead? Uh, I'm probably going to get like a sushi burrito uh, from Poke Ocean, or I was gonna. Well, I was thinking about maybe having Sam pick me up a sub, but when I think about it, it I'd probably just be better off, um, uh, uh, just getting a um, uh, a fucking. What do you call it? Help! Um, Back burrito. to the canoe a bag for me. of dog shit. Uh, should I pick? Should I bring anything? Uh, no, I can't think of anything. We have chips. We have. Well, you we have bring chips. any like? Just, just bring, or just bring like, money to help pay for the pizza. Yeah, you just tell me how much I got, light. Venmo. Yeah. Uh, should I bring any light any light drinks light. or any dip or any okay, nice cookies real now. or anything? Take care, Jinzoki. Shopping tomorrow, okay. so. Uh, uh, if you oh, you know what? I still have some ciders here, so you can drink those. Okay. I am back for. What kind of dips are we gonna I'm have? I'm back. I have three dips. I've got Only two salsas. I've got three salsas, and I've got a. Uh, a nice no, 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 no. What about no spinach dip this time? I'm rioting. I think my wife yeah, is where's the spinny dip? <laughs> I'm right. I will say, Anthony, Anthony, <laughs> considering the circumstances tomorrow, maybe it'll just be a vegetarian day for me and not a vegan day for me. So, well, my wife is. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. 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 Right. Now Peter's going to spice it. Ooh. 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 Beater might eat pizza. It is insanely pizza. delicious. Beater might eat pizza. Beater might eat pizza. Pizza, pizza. Peter might eat pizza. pizza. We're gonna stop at Little Caesars on the way. You, you should. De I've never had Little okay, Caesars. Yeah. You should. You should definitely get get some Beyond Nuggets on the way though. <laughs> beyond it up. I'll be honest, not worth it. <laughs> yeah, uh, well, it's it's basically like the, the same thing as Domino's, which is the same thing as Papa John's. It's not even close food. to what Domino's is. No, you guys have that bad of a Domino's. I refuse to Or you to just don't know it. what food tastes like. It would like. be like yeah. a horrible Domino's. Which yeah, is completely they're completely possible. So they're not great pizzas, but they are definitely not the same. The crust, well, Domino's crust is very Domino's different from yeah. what we will call you have pizza. Enough, Hut. Will you have enough chips to eat a bring? Or have enough for are you saying that Domino's is better or worse than Little Caesars? I'm saying Domino's is far better than Little Caesars. Little Caesars doesn't even taste like pizza. So basically, just bring your own tofu, Peter. <laughs> so you're saying that the mascot yeah, lied to me when he said pizza, it, pizza? I'm <laughs> gonna get yeah. shit for pig leaking. I know I'm gonna get shit for pig leaking. Oh, you yeah. are. You are. Uh, sure. But you have to understand, I've lived in New Jersey and Pennsylvania in the Northeast my whole life, which is basically the pizza capital of the world. Domino's which is why you eat Domino's no. every weekend. I've like, had Chicago pizza. pizza. I can tell the difference in, like, good and bad pizza, yes. man. But, like, I'm telling you, unless you guys just have the shittiest Domino's. I mean, I've had I mean, Chicago pizza before, and it just tastes like, like, it's just like cake. If that makes sense, like. Well, yeah, I mean, it's a pie. What are you talking yeah, about? Of course. That. Like, it just—it it wasn't like that great, and like the <gasps> sauce is like on top of the cheese. What? That's so yeah. good though. I—I I don't know. I kind of—I like that. Like, I think. Alex is reeling. Like, I, right now. I think it's good. Uh, I'm reeling. <laughs> 
I think it's great. I heard the sauce over the cheese, but it was just like too bready. It was like very like thick. Oh, um, okay. I mean. Uh, what, are you, what are you what are you referring to, Jess? Are you referring to like a chicken? I downed one. Thing? So like you a one? Like, Let's a, go. like a deep dish. Let's yeah, see. it's just like it's like you're a cake. Somebody, Alex is correct. You're talking to somebody who had a diet pizza for dinner tonight. Alright, so <laughs> Alright, this is now about Moe's like, with Chipotle. Let's go. Alright, Moe's okay, wins. Oh, um, uh, we're setting this up again. Chipotle rules. Alex has cracked at Fortnite. Alright, Moe's kind of like Chipotle really and Moe's Chipotle and Moe's good for different reasons. Listen, Moses Moses. Is better, though. Actually did me, Moses did me pretty well last time I went there. Moses is better. Uh, uh, Look, I know if I'm having a bad day, I can just walk into Moe's and be greeted, but like... That's Chipotle true, they like, scream in your face. Yeah, yeah I mean, but, actually, but but these days I they don't even greeted. say... They don't even say welcome I, to Moe's, they just go... Blah, blah. I was not <laughs> That's honestly my kink, though. They literally... But they... It's so true. <laughs> like, <laughs> they don't even say it anymore. It was like a mere month ago. Nobody said shit to me. When I walked in that building. You know what's good though? Bubba Goose uh, burrito. Bubba Goose is good. Oh, okay. uh, Bubba Goose rocks. Bubba Goose, I would say Bubba Goose way over either of those choices. Yeah, I was about to say. They're way right. over those oh, no, choices. Have, is. Dude, I've got a Bubba Goose like way. five minutes from my house. Dude, Bubba Goose, Bubba Goose, Bubba Goose fucking rocks. Bubba Goose so I'm glad that like some form of equipment. Okay, come on. Bubba Goose for Yes! Yeah, yeah. Finally! Oh yeah. Oh yeah, Justin, you got it. They have vegan stuff. Thank the Lord. Yeah, they have good vegan options. You gotta get those Beyond Duggies. You can get like Boca Burgers. Yo, Justin, epic gaming moment. Ooh, I do be loving Boca Burgers. Looks like his heart is just like like racing. Holy shit! How many levels you got in this game? So, so I think I have two more worlds left. Do you need anything for tomorrow? Oh sure. Yeah, they just decided to borrow the ice cap. Any chips? Any cookies? Any 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 drinks? Oh, I, those are my favorite Doritos. Oh, the, the spicy sweet chili. Oh, oh my yeah. god, yeah, I would I would the rub them all Doritos. over my body. Are they really? <laughs> yeah. Take a bite. Oh, How is that possible? Not my favorite flavor, I, I got, but they're great. Yeah. The you know what Doritos. I will need? Polar Teddy. I need people to just keep an eye on the door. That's all. Jess, you come tomorrow? No. Actually, but I didn't even know. Um, it's adorable. It's adorable and it's terrifying. So, I'm going bowling um, tomorrow with the bumpers up. <laughs> I didn't pay attention to like how to beat this guy. Just someone check the door tomorrow, please. That's out. all I ask. I will. Thank you, Sam. No problem. Oh, that's actually really creative. Is he sending right. Arnold Schwarzenegger to the door? <laughs> yeah. Do I not get any time? You See, it's the new cameo yeah, where like, like they actually show up. Bonus. Give me the filet. It's a Nico Kato in real life <laughs> cameo. Anthony, do you want a Nico Kato cameo for your birthday? Do it. I would actually rather die. I'm calling corporate? <laughs> in a video game! Hi! <laughs> it's like immediately mukbangs noodles outside your door. <laughs> now that I would pay like, for like, 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 what <laughs> Without any prompting, he just. <laughs> I love the you way can... he says hi. The, the, I know. <laughs> the thing about cameo is like so dangerous. Like I could literally be like, I could literally be like, wish this person a happy birthday and also reassure them about their small penis. And like they they just kind of like go with whatever they, you say. They roll you know? with it. They roll with well, what do you mean that's dangerous? That's awesome. But like it, it puts the they listen to you. Problem. Remember. The what? The what? I said hmm? Brian has a money spending problem. Remember? Uh, I don't remember. All right, Brian. Uh, we'll talk about this off stream. <laughs> okay. Do, do Do you need me to bring anything though? I can stop at Target tomorrow. Yeah, cameo for Golden. Mike, Yo, if, Mike... if Brian goes into Target, he's not coming out. That's true. That's I went true. into Target today and I dropped like a hundred something dollars. Brian, I'll get back to you. I'll ask Betsy if there's anything. But last time, this is just friend, how it goes whenever. Okay. Yeah, let Anthony. Let me know too. Yeah, lose this number. Let me know too. Okay, yeah, so... lose this number. Magic world really, nice. Sam? It would just be great if you could make it to ramen tomorrow. Okay, no, I, I, I can't. I can't do that. I can't. I yeah, I wish I could make it tomorrow too, but Justin, I un you don't need to say anything, dude. I we we, we all completely understand <laughs> what you have to do. Okay. Yeah, man, it'll be sad, but we get it, dude. Mm -hmm. I hate y'all. Who else is gonna be there tomorrow? <laughs> understand. <laughs> uh, you know, just some friends. Just okay. the usual group, like me, myself, and I. Just the. 
you know, what are, uh, to, what are, Tanuki's flying it. What no are the deal. festivities? Yeah. What, we're, we what, do? what we're doing is we're, we're keeping it limited to a very small group of people because Betsy just wanted it to be a core group of people. I'll explain. I'll explain that that Peter's coming, and I'm sure she'll be okay with that. But um, yeah, Mario. Betsy just wanted to keep it a, a very small core group of people because. Uh, of both the pandemic and just because it's, it's on my yeah, her, sure. it's actually the party is falling on her birthday. Yeah, she just wants like a nice small thing. That makes sense. Yeah. So, Anne, you never called me back yesterday. What's going on with you? What? I would rather not talk about it on stream if that's okay. Uh, it's not okay. Chat, uh, Egamon. Just the uh, oh, no, no, it's it's okay. Talk to you later. Yeah, it, it would take it would take it too long to, to 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 type out. But long story short, well, I'll just put it this way. Long story short, there's something very wrong with my tummy. I don't know what it is, and I'm going to need to go to a lot of doctor visits uh, soon to try and get to the bottom of it. And it could be anything from super serious to not serious at all. I'm not in any pain. So that's good, but I don't something know, is not right. This? That's that's basically that's basically take this out? what uh what I I wanted to say. Okay. Okay. Oh. Okay. Watch out I for masks go inside. Once they catch sight of you, so, they'll but, yeah, but now I a just stupid question for you: How do you? How are you like things. saying like I can eat sushi <laughs> but not pizza? Like how do you monitor like? It, without knowing what's wrong with you, how do you know what's okay to eat? Do you know what I mean? I'm eating as bland a food as possible, so sushi's sushi, okay sushi because not that's bland. Like literally just rice, raw fish, and uh, rice, raw fish, and like seaweed. That's not inherently harmful, but pizza's got like a lot of grease and fat and shit on it, and true. fat seems to be what I need to avoid right now. True, true, true. So. That, that's what, what I, that, that, that's kind of what I'm, I'm kind of trying to stick to as simple as possible. Like, I would imagine that a sandwich would be good too. Sam, but like, you're, might... aren't you going for ramen tomorrow? Doesn't that have like the most sodium out of anything that's I ever am... been created? It, sodium's not necessarily the problem. <laughs> out of anything <laughs> created. <laughs> <laughs> I, I love how like... I am going. I am going for ramen. I am going for ramen tomorrow because Robin's over. And I've been really wanting to go to Terakawa. Is it because Robin rhymes with ramen? Get ramen. I'm probably going to get a rice. Well, look. I mean, I, 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 I get the whole like looking after yourself thing, but I mean, as long as you're not eating like deep fried, gas station fried chicken, like you're, you'll probably be fine. Yeah. You know. I just don't want to take any chances. Right no, of now. course. I, I understand so, that. Yeah. Yeah, you really so, shouldn't. Like, yeah. So, so Sam, I might, as far as needing you to what bring anything. Yes, I let me know. What do you need? I might take you off on that. If I decide to, could I ask you to stop over and freehold at Sorrento's and grab? Yeah, absolutely. Plate? Just let me know. Well. Just let me. Just let me know before like one o'clock. That's yeah. Fine. Also, let yeah. me know if that is a plan because I might ask mm. for a sandwich as well because I, I have to. I, I okay. apparently yeah, have let to me try this tuna or something. I don't know what the fuck's going on. But oh, the tuna. Yeah, yeah, tuna. yeah. yeah. I, I have to see if it's better than Jersey. All right, Man. yeah, let me, uh, yeah, let, uh, let me know in the chat. Yeah, that's fine. Let me know in the chat. Well, no, I'll write he, means, he means the RR channel. Oh, yeah. Oh, I thought, I thought you meant, like, the stream. Like, yeah, let's see I'm answering. I'm posting yes. it. Yeah, let me, <laughs> let me know in the stream chat. Oh, that's true. And, and then Peter, oh, they, probably have, they probably have good options for Peter at Sorrento's, right? You can get, like, a, uh... Is eggplant oh, parm I'm vegan? Sure got a salad or something. Like nah, we're getting we're getting the beyond shit. Oh, Don't sure. even worry. Don't even worry. I do like eggplant parm though. All right, look. Plant parm. If you do end up getting the beyond chicken, save me one nugget. I do want to try one nugget. I but I also I also I'm if you're going to Sorrento's, they had pretty good eggplant parm. Um, I don't know. Oh yeah, Peter. Um, they do have really amazing eggplant parmesan. So like. I don't know if I'd want tuna because their eggplant palm was so good, but I do like tuna. These are hard Dude, choices. Try, I want all of them. Just trust me. Try it, the tuna. Well, they do a half eggplant palm, half tuna sub for Big Old Daddy. Um, hey, Peter, let's let's, yeah, let's 
Peter, let's split Elvin a Elvin is still alive. Let's split a, a tuna and eggplant parm sauce. Oh, really? Yeah, no kidding. That's vegan, right? <laughs> my god. All right. Good night, everybody. All right, night. 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 I'll see you tomorrow. I'll see you whenever a, I get to see you. In a video game. In also, video chicken game. bite. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, and Justin, like you said, if anything changes and it happens to be like 7 o'clock or whatever, <laughs> just come. Like, it, it's fine. You, you can show up late if you end up needing to show up late. But if you also cannot make it, again, totally understand. You um, take care, was, okay? Uh, All right. Thank was, you. Yeah. I, See you, man. Good night, everybody. Night, night. Night, Ant. Night, Ant. So I was, I was away from some of that, but I was also listening. Um, tuna mm -hmm. and eggplant farm are both not vegan. Um, uh, you're gaslighting so me. That. <laughs> <laughs> also, also, you're gaslighting also, me? That's vegan? <laughs> what? It's like, fine, go to Sorrento's. Let's, let's I actually that. have a huge grudge against Oh, Sorrento's. you do? I forgot about I that. I do. Yeah, I, I, I'm sure I told you guys about it, but um, me and you my brother, me, we, me, the sure. Quinton brothers honestly feel that the people who work at Sorrento's are big mean jerks. And they always have been, and they probably still are. Wait, I don't know. Really, have I heard they, about this? He said it like a few times ago. I remember it. Before. He definitely said this like super who recently. Judge your, who judge your sandwich order, or whatever you order there. Oh, and, yeah, um, okay, yeah. Unless you don't, unless you get, I remember like, you talking about this now. Unless you get like a like, fully loaded Italian sub with all the works, they always have some sort of attitude about it. Really? And, um, yeah. Well, of course, because yeah. they probably want more money. Yeah. Yeah. They're still not okay. Like No, I I know. Like, I'm just saying. You have a sandwich shop. It's like somebody just wants a turkey sandwich with lettuce and tomato and like the mayonnaise on it. Like that's not something to like be judgmental about. Yeah, like, yeah if I agree. Order, yeah. If you want just an order of fries or order of onion rings, like Oh, we do be like... needing fries and onion rings if you go tomorrow. We need to That's really fries. stupid. Why like why are they going to be judgmental? That sucks. I, I mean Look, okay, that realistically sucks. speaking, this could be me and Vin projecting on them, but at the same time, we both independently came to this conclusion and felt this way. So there's gotta be something to it. There's so something, there's something there, there, yeah. There's, so, there's, there's something there. Our lives does not feel that yeah. way. Me and my brother have both felt this way extremely, like, potently in our interactions with Sorrento's. Oh. Is it like maybe well, just like the staff I mean, that was working there that day? I mean, if you yeah, maybe they're having a bit. If you go tomorrow, been different people. There's like that's people interesting. There who were like, I remember there's been like one guy who was like a real like kind of like gruff Brooklyn Italian American guy, you know. But wow, shocking for Sorrento. And even when that guy wasn't there, there were like other people who seemed like younger and maybe they'd be like more accepting and they just yeah. kind of acted the same way. So. Hmm. I don't know, no, man. Maybe if you stop there tomorrow, you can go in and see if it's the same. And if it, it and if it no, is, you should, a, you should I'll leave go. a you should leave a Google review. And if they, and if I get any sort of sass from them, I'm willing to say something. Yeah. Be like, do you know who I am? Well, Peter, Peter, do you do you want me to purposely wait to pick you up and then go there? <laughs> it's if you whatever what, Sam, whatever works for you. You know. Well, Sam, you also don't know if you're going yet or not. If so Sorrento's is, if, if Sorrento's is on the way and you want to Shit. stop there first, by all means, like. I don't oh, know. Peter, um, uh, do text me your address, because I, I, yes, I, 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 right I have a decent idea of where you are, but I've never actually been to your I'll house. I'll do it right now. Yeah, you've never been to my house, so I'll just text you my address. But I know, I, like, I know the area you're in. I just, I'm, yeah, I'm sure Peter, exactly where you are. I've never been to your you house, are. but text me your social. Yeah, um, yeah, if you could divulge your credit card <laughs> in the chat, yeah. that'd be just great. Just stalk yourself? I'll just send you guys my your checking Oh my god, it's a little hamster! Oh my god, doobie! Yo, I'm a sucker for carousels. Yo, in Echo Knight, you were on a carousel too! Yes! You Where did were, in go? fact, on a carousel. Yo, from software, from software really loves their carousels, don't they? Elder Ring did Jess, like, the leave? Carousel. I missed that. Yeah, Jess seemed to have left. Uh... She hates us, got it? Oh shit, understandable, have a nice day. Okay. I'm a Fuck you. Okay, let me just, uh... Wow. Oh, that was nonsense. Oh, come 
Come on! Come on, come on. This isn't really what we planned on. Come on, come on. Tell me we'll be okay. All right, Peter, so you're about 16 minutes in the opposite direction. That's not uh, bad. That's okay. not bad at all. You're what? Cool that I definitely would appreciate definitely not yeah, so no, uh, yeah, I'm cool with it, man. Thanks, man. I like driving. Depending okay. on... I'm depending driving. On... <laughs> I'm driving. I'm Wait, driving. So, I'm driving. Sam, when you say opposite direction, is Peter closer to me or farther? He's, he's, he's near Marlboro. I mean, I'm in Marlboro. Oh, okay. Yeah, well, I, <laughs> I, I don't want to directly dox you. Right near. Yeah, what a yeah. sick dox, he's, bro. So he's none, of these, none of these people watching the stream understand. Oh, that. they. Oh, there's one dude who's been following us who's in Jersey who wants to kill everyone. Oh, is there somebody who wants to dox Jeez. all of us? And, like, yeah. Our so, lives? Uh, so fucked. Which one is it? Is it, is it, is it, is it <laughs> we know, we know yeah. we're kidding. We know. No, it's a joke, but it, just the way that you said it was like so. Who just wants to kill? It was everyone. so matter of factly. Yeah. Okay, well, because it's true. No. <laughs> um, Sam, because I'm. James. Anyway, yes, so the cat's out of the fucking bag, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Depending on time, I was gonna see yeah, maybe I'd like, bro, like go to you so I could drive together, but I think you might be going way earlier than I planned on going. Well, I mean, I'm only going like two hours before the start uh, time. Come down here. Yeah, I just have to see. So meet him and have to go to like Costco, do like grocery shopping tomorrow. So here. How I dare am. you be a father? Um, but if it's like if if timing aligns, like I might be able to swing it where I can go with you. So I'll I'll keep you I'll keep you. Yeah, no, here. let me uh just yeah, hit me up and I'll 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 drive you. Yeah. Road we'll road trip together. That'd be fun. That would be pretty fun. <laughs> I'll be drunk in a video game, but it'll, it'll uh, be what? come on, come on! I want to yell at the Sorrento's people with Peter. I know. I would love that revenge. My brother would love that. My brother is actually more mad at them than I am. I could see Vin being really mad at them. Yeah. Okay. But is it really goddamn party? Sorrento people? But is it really a party without DJ Marco Penta? Vin definitely ordered a plane. Yeah, that's true, actually. And got yelled at, and he's really mad at it still. That's what Jess is sending to the house. You're gonna open the door, and it's just DJ Marco Penta standing <laughs> Can we can we get Marco Penta in the chat? Oh, that would be so funny. Messed up. I messed up. Oh no. Oh shit. Uh, go into this porta potty and you teleport out. Apparently. Uh, well, I mean that just goes without saying. Like obviously. Oh yeah, yeah. I, I did not know that was gonna happen. If you get in an underground porta potty, like you're gonna yeah. teleport. Oh, through let's space. take I'm, this thing. I'm just kidding. Uh. <laughs> Fortnite's so crazy. I love Fortnite it. is fucking weird. I don't even know if it put me with you or like another like random. No, yeah, it put us close together. <laughs> Anthony, I brought Doritos and DJ Marco Pet. <laughs> <laughs> Anthony, you'll never believe it. <laughs> I brought DJ Marco Pet to the bar. <laughs> No, it's so Nile. funny. Niles. Niles. Niles, DJ Marco hey. Pettis at the door? I mean, I don't I don't really think he'd be that upset over that. No, DJ Marco Pettis so. in just... the house. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go, Niles. That's so funny. Okay, good. Open you. Come on, come on. I'm restarting that. No. I'm stopping by Joe Fadero. <sighs> Empty my bowels to the raging fire. I'm stopping by uh, Federa's place tomorrow, Sam. Are you? Uh, just like not. I'm not going inside or anything. I gotta. Uh, Kelly was. Uh, Kelly's doing like a month or a few weeks or something, and uh, uh, they were supposed. To I was gonna say, it. aren't they having a kid soon? Yeah, they were supposed to have a baby shower, but they canceled it because of the pandemic. So we're just. I'm literally gonna, on the way to Costco. I'll, I'll go to Costco down south and drop off like. 
baby gifts for him at the door because like they're he's basically like they're like kind of like not going anywhere like to be as safe as possible before yeah, the baby's born sure. so he That's said like good. literally the one one thing he's doing before is see oh my god i just got wrecked is he's going batman. to anthony's party <laughs> no i'm seeing batman so but uh oh nice but yeah i'm gonna drop that stuff off by him okay cool i'll tell him you say hi yeah tell him i say hi if he remembers me i'll tell him hello from binja i just got fucking wrecked yeah <laughs> I don't know why you're 10 miles from me somehow. That's weird. I don't know how I got that far. Yeah, tell, like, him, tell him Ben just said what up. Yeah. It's like a giant dragon here. What the hell? Well, you did die by a resurrection ban. Can anyone hear m music through my mic, by the way? I'm hearing something weird, but it might be Justin's. Oh, uh, okay. I, I want to make sure I wasn't being too loud. But I, my either. game is kind of loud, too. I've been kind of really focused. I'm listening to underground hip-hop. Then never mind. No. No, we're okay. not hearing it. Okay, perfect. Oh, are, you listening to, are you listening to Skinny Pete and the Douche Caboose? <laughs> Skinny Pete and the Douche Caboose. I just made that up on the spot. But I feel like that could be real. Yeah, I know, right? It sounds. It I feel like thing. that could be a thing. It sounds right, like like. It does. It does sound. I correct. just that's that's Sam's new SoundCloud. Bet oh on shit! It. I'm in hit. Sound. Um, if everyone could follow me, that'd be great. Very cool. Very cool. Damn, this level is ridic. I can hate you. You over here, it does hate me. Okay, get out of here. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I don't know what I'm doing. Ooh, very nice. Hello, Reggie. Very nice. I can't believe over 400 people had to look at my face in a Norbert shirt. Very bad on my part. <laughs> this is terrible. You should take advantage of the situation and just at yourself in the thread and say, yes, the carpet does match the drapes. <laughs> I, was, I was actually... I was like, you're gonna send a reply to it and say, any single Norbit fans on Valentine's Day hit me up. Mm. <laughs> I'm actually gonna start getting ready for bad friends. Alright, right, dude. Sam's well, posting uh, any gamer girls question mark hashtag how you're doing. Peter, I'll let <laughs> Peter, I'll let you know for sure, like, what time I'll I'm gonna go, later. and then I'll let you know. Right, Me and um, Peter are gonna lady and cram some purple Doritos. Oh yeah. Alright, night friends. No. Have a good night, dude. Bye bye. Oh, bye bye. <laughs> oh, mid intense online matches. Damn. Oh, come on. <laughs> I'm in the da Daily Bugle. Damn. So am I supposed to, like, jump onto that thing? The Daily Boggle. I don't understand what I'm supposed to do with this. Come on, come on. Good, good, good. Good job. Wake me up inside. Good job, sir. Wake me up inside. Save me. I can't wake up. I can't wake up. I can't wake up. I can't wake up. Shit. Shit. The daily poop hole. How rude. <gasps> How rude. Fortunately, okay, Bob yeah. Saget has passed away. They asked Mary Kate and Ashley for a comment, and they responded with, "How wooed!" Oh my God! <laughs> I can't. I can't believe this. 
you you would say that, wouldn't you? Well, they're not. They're not gonna comment. Yeah. Oh, no, they did. They did. They had like the a press comment. Did they now? Yeah, they did. Did they not? Did they not get along with them? I'm honestly no, no. They, they said well, like a nice, I mean, they said like a nice I mean, thing. they basically accused him of shit. So <laughs> I think they said a nice thing about him. Well, they might have said a nice thing about him in whatever you're talking about. Yeah. But they've accused him of shit. <laughs> did they accuse him of shit, or did people like? Well, it him. was both. It was apparently a thing had happened, and then one of the twins went on record and was like, Oh, well, yeah, it's true. It's like, no. I don't know about that. Anything's possible, I'm sure, but... <laughs> Let's see. Um, didn't expect the second shot. Notorious? Did not expect <laughs> that. Do-do-do-do-do. <laughs> We're close to Zeng again, they had a very special relation. Okay, well, so far, I'm seeing a source says they said this. I could swear there was like a, like, they reached that, like, I don't know if it was We are deeply sad in that he is no longer with us, but know that he will continue to be by our side to guide us as gratefully as gracefully as he always has that's something that their agent fucking concocted yeah yeah that, that, that wasn't that, a statement from that them. that's what i'm talking about like like 100 100 percent like not quote them. unquote they yeah. released something but yeah. i don't think that they actually said it yeah i mean i mean it, that is such like and, and it's crazy that they don't even have any scruples over that like they basically owe their fucking career to to that show and that man and they're just like Yeah, I guess like a month after it happened our agent will just type up a generic statement. Like <laughs> No, I think that was like the day of or the day like it was like in line with when it happened, but I I mean maybe I think they were, I think they were at the funeral. I could maybe? be wrong though. Maybe probably. I don't know the facts. I oh, could be. I, I listen. I could. I could be talking out of my ass. I probably am. <laughs> you should Google and see if they were at the funeral. But let's see. I mean, I really hope. So. I do hope so. I do actually hope so. Let's see. Looks like a funeral. I mean, because that really did... that would make me happy. I mean, if you really did harm them, then, like, I wouldn't blame them for not going to his funeral. Yeah, no, I mean, I don't... Yeah, whether they were actually harmed Yeah, or I, don't, I don't know. I, I don't know the extent. Oh, come, come on. Did, but... Get off of me. Okay, let's see. Mary-Kate Olsen seen the first photos after his funeral. And it okay. doesn't matter because it was three seconds anyways. In her first public setting since attending her full house co-star Bob Saget's funeral, blah blah blah. But they did attend it. Is that what it's saying? Since well yeah, it says in this article it says since attending. So yes. Held the coffee on her way. Oh, this is a couple days after. Okay. Alright, cool. Light, light epic. Oh, well, that caught me. Oh my gosh, I can't believe. Can't believe Brian orchestrated believe this whole thing. <laughs> okay, let's move in the house. Let's blow that up. Cool. Well, hop inside. Yeah, the clock. I want to watch Jackass 2 with Amanda tonight, but she's like addicted to Supernatural now. <laughs> Out of nowhere. Hell oh, yeah. Oh, I want to start Murderville tomorrow. Oh yeah, I forgot that came out. I really want to start the after party. I wanted to watch an episode of that tonight, but my sister left early. Oh, you want to watch it with your sister? Why I not me, dude? Well, listen a minute. I, I literally invited you over. No, oh, I fell. I'm the Joe You didn't say the after party. Me and DJ, DJ Marco Pentis sat outside your house for weeks. Dang, you're right. 
He put together a mix of outside yeah. Samsung. It was just uh, a Vici. Oh, it's an Apple TV exclusive. Come on, the connected that connected made looks off, look off. so good. Okay, but it's Apple TV. It's it's with Ben Schwartz and Sam Richardson and Alana Glazer, and it's a, it's it's um it's a murder mystery show that's a a comedy with songs. Oh, I messed and, that up. Oh my god. And goodness. every episode is from a different character's perspective, and the <sighs> oh, the songs in the show were written by Taco from uh, the League. Like it's like an all oh, nice. it's, like it's, it's an all star cast. It's getting like rave reviews. They say it's so good. I'm so excited to watch it. I think like the first three or four episodes are out out of like eight. Actually, I gotta uh, I gotta finish the league. The league is great. Shiva Kami, that. Soma I tried watching Kanda a few Krom. episodes of the league before. And I was like, yeah, hey, maybe it's because I'm not into like like the fantasy league like sports or something it's but i it, but see you know it, what's crazy it, about that is i'm not either and it was still somehow able to resonate with me yeah i don't think you need to be I, maybe I, it I, is because i, I, I got I in think, on like an episode that wasn't like an maybe it was just like random too random yeah. for me to like start watching yeah. on an odd episode or something that might have been it also yeah probably but i was like i felt like i was like completely out of the loop whenever i watched it yeah, but I don't, I don't, I don't know which, I don't know how many seasons there were, but the last episode I watched was, um, Raffi and Dirty Randy yeah, together. Yeah, there was still a bunch left after that. I so, think. so that was like probably in the middle of the show. Uh, I think later than the middle, but yeah, I think oh, you okay. still had a good, I think you still had some. Finally! Uh, next time you come over. Yeah, let's see, the, the league the seasons, uh, seven seasons. Three more to go. You should check what episode that the Dirty Randy one is. I know you're yeah, talking, let me, like, let me go Did they like that. go to a library or something? Let me see. Yeah, yeah, they did a library. They did a bunch of shit. They were in like an empty pool. Yeah, they, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, let me look that up. Is Justin gaming right now? Okay. I don't believe in gaming. Like... Yeah, gaming, gaming is a mess. Any gamers? Let's see. I was the... trying to get that. I don't know how to get that 50. League Rafi, Dirty Randy was season 5, episode 4. Yeah, so you still have like two and a half seasons left. Okay, I mean, that's not bad. Yeah. That ain't bad at all. Not invited at all. Alright. Well, I got it that time. You are my cookie. You are my cream. Uh, say so goodbye. That was sick. I think this deserves some more shoes. This might be my last game of, of Fortnite. I might try to hit, hit the hay a little earlier since I'm going to be driving all fucking day tomorrow. Makes sense. Makes sense. All right, all right. Yeah, man. All right. Um, I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. I fought the nut, and I opened up my eyes, I fought the nut. Oh, you know. oh am I supposed I like to... Oh, maybe I'm supposed to jump on... Say that again, Alex, what? I uh, like the part where we got first place, doesn't it? That means, yeah, it was, uh, for not having played in so long, I'm happy we got a win. Real long, yeah. Okay, that's what I gotta do, I gotta try to bounce on that ghost. Here, Alex, come in here. He's bossing me around. What do I do about <laughs> it? Yeah. Uh, it's spraying everywhere. Daddy, Honestly true. Honestly true. It <laughs> won't stop spraying. Looks like the Tommy Lee Pamela Anderson biopic in here. <laughs> <laughs> Is it, is it bad to admit that I kind of want to watch that? I wanted to. Joe oh, P said he watched it. And he said it was, it. It was well, I'm, I'm very, I'm very, very big into biopics. Well, do you, but it's like, do you know, like, it's like silly too. Like, I want to tell you something. I don't know if it's a spoiler or not, but did you see the casting? Yes. Did you, did you see a specific casting? A specific cast. I like. I don't want to say any. Like, I'd rather. I guess I'd rather you just go in blind without knowing what I'm going to say. I'm, I'm not going to. Uh, gonna... Nope. Looking it up. All right. All right. I'll just tell you that it's a. Uh, so, like, uh, I guess Sebastian Stan has a talking penis in the in the movie, and uh, yeah, I, I heard it's about voiced that. by Rafi from the League. 
<laughs> Amazing. Yeah. Uh, Manzukas is really getting some good work these days, isn't he? I love Manzukas. Oh, a super I underrated. They that, and I thought they were kidding. No. All right, true. folks. I'll have the bet for tonight. Super right, underrated. Take care, movies, HK. Uh, and with the all right, hey, have a good Kibishi. night, HK. Not HK. Hello, Hi, HK. Oh shit, Kabishi. What up, Kabishi? Hey, Kabishi. Also, have a good night, HK. Yeah. Thanks for chilling. Like a villain. Uh, Mansukis is great in fucking everything. <laughs> oh, so good. Yo, close enough? Have you guys watched Close Enough? No. Oh. Do it. If you like regular show at all, do it. I do like regular oh, show. Actually, you don't even have to like regular show. It, it's it's a standalone great show. So that's from the from JG Quinto. Yeah, JG Quinto. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's uh, Spock from Star Trek, right? It, yeah. <laughs> yep. Yeah, JG. Yeah, I told you know what, Brian. You're right. I totally forgot JG Quinto was in Star no, Trek. No, it's, it's, it's it, it, because no, because it sounds like Zachary Quinto. That's why I said that. I thought you said. Wow, GG. epic, epic joke. Uh, Sam, I'm suing Sam. You can sue me for all you want, yeah, baby, but you ain't gonna get much. Anyway, uh, in a video game. Man, fighting games do be hard and require a lot of concentration, but you know. uh, they, they do be bad. Yeah. Uh, they, except for this one, is good. What you're playing? Guilty Gear. What What do you think I'm playing? Uh, I, I mean, I play a bunch of fighting games. That's why. I <laughs> that that this is what I man. I want to go back and play more fighters. Though. I was... Oh yeah, dude. It's pretty great. Let's friggin' do it. Yo, Kabishi. If you there right now, hop in this voice chat. I'm not, I'm not in Axel. Name. I should play Fighter Z more. I I'm guess he doesn't. Fighter Z, Fighter Z fucking rocks. I'm just. It's I, I, I think it it's is like the so good. The scene only ever. issue I have with so Fighter Z is uh, netcode. Is netcode okay? Yeah. The net the netcode is not great, but you know, that's fine if you play it like single player. <laughs> also, game. the lobby. Also, I'm just like not. Uh, I'd have to get used to Fighter Z. I, it's, mm. it's on sale for Switch again. I was thinking about. I, I just I, I just like I've talked with people about this, but I just don't understand why f modern fighting game lobbies turned into such a weird experiment. Oh, like why can't why can't we just dial it the fuck back? Like I why can't it just be know. like me versus someone? I think a lot of you it is. You know what I mean? Uh, <laughs> there's always going to be an air waiting area, so they're trying. Yeah, I mean, okay. I get it, but. Got yeah, like the Xenoverse thing where you're like a little. I just, I, I just, I just want, I want some OG shit. Like, just keep me, keep me in a lobby looking for someone. Like I don't, I don't, I don't need the, I don't need whatever's going on in most of these modern fighters <laughs> lobbies. I just like, I think like, it's like so beautiful Fighter Z. Like those graphics are just. Oh like, yeah, you know, no, it, it's. I would say Fighter Z is probably like one of the most faithful interpretations. Yeah. I have it for Xbox, series. but I kind of want to get it for Switch. I have it for Xbox, Xbox yeah. too. If you ever want to play, I'm down. But I also like. Yeah. It's super cheap on Switch right now. I was thinking about I just started installing it. On what Xbox? Xbox, yeah. Yeah, we should uh, we should all jump in a lobby sometime. I have it. I have it too. I'm I'm down. Maybe uh, maybe maybe Sunday night or something because I don't know how late we'll be out tomorrow. But if not tomorrow, maybe Sunday or something. <sighs> Sounds pretty fun. Like I love the beginning of the story mode or whatever, but like yeah, as soon as I get in that lobby system, I need somebody to, like hold my hand and tell me what the fuck to do. Honestly, I got so lost at that point. Yeah, it's 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 fucking all modern lobbies, man. With fighting games, it's I I, I don't know what happened, but like, it's just, like why? <laughs> that thing happened with Xenoverse. Like I wanted to to like that game because it's cool too. But yeah. Yeah.
Okay. Let's try this. Also, thing. I like these giant spike ball traps. Oh, yeah, they're cool. This looks yeah, pretty the... neat. Actually, yeah, this is sure yeah I this this sure area you're in right now in the game is is very, very cool. <laughs> I, it's it's on sale for super cheap on Steam and, and Switch right now with some of the characters. So I was thinking about grabbing it. Like I only have like the vanilla version on Xbox with like no no DLC characters. Maybe I'll, I'll have to see if maybe some of the characters are on. Or, uh, Alex, if you're on this Xbox store, you should check if um, are any of the is the DLC on sale at all or no? Oh, I wasn't in the store. Um, I just uh, went into my my uh, library. Oh, I got you. I got you. I got you. But I mean, I can look like later. Like they have you... so many cool characters downloadable, but I don't feel like paying for each one separately. It's so annoying. Yeah. I just bought Bardock when the game like first went on sale. I think because I like I don't have Bardock like literally design. any characters, just like the base game. There's a specific Trunks design that if they had, I would maybe pay for that. But Super Saiyan Two Trunks, uh, Future well, Trunks. Uh, yeah, Super Saiyan Two sounds right. Well, he's got a ponytail. Oh no, I like the 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 spiky hair one more. Like um. Cell Saga Trunks is like such a cool design. Yeah. I think it was my first DBZ action figure I ever bought. <laughs> yeah, grow, growing, so up, growing up, I loved uh, Goku Trunks and Krillin, and I still really do. Like, the, most of the cards I collect are around, like, Goku and Trunks. I, I just bought, like, a really cool uh, graded Trunks card. That's and like I still really got a D for that. Stuff. Hell yeah, let's go. I wish I could find my old Goku cards. I had some. Justin working on the speed run. Yeah, some of the new cards are beautiful. Only. I just bought the, the new Japanese heroes cards are fucking gorgeous. Let's I just bought a bunch of them. That. I like. I like couldn't hold myself back. They're so nice. They're unbelievable. DBZ like cards? honestly, the new DBZ heroes cards are like the nicest cards I've ever seen. Honestly. I have the Hollow Goku with the Halo at like King Kai's place. Oh, that's cool. Um, the, the first set of the DBZ trade. You should card see game. if you could find that shit. If it's in good condition, well, you got it graded. It might be money. I mean, dude, I'm sure if it exists still, if I have it somewhere, like it would definitely be worth money. I just don't know where I would have put it. I mean, like, you found your Pokemon stuff, so you should look. I did. Right. Right. Pokemon stuff. I bought a really cool Goku the other day, where he's like powering up to Super Saiyan against Frieza. So cool. Uh, I want to get that graded. I don't even know. Like, it's like a rare Japanese promo or something I paid for that. Like, I, I got to get some of these cards graded. Just like the problem is people are into cards so much right now that the grading fees went up tremendously and the wait times are crazy. So I have to be smart about where I send my cards. Like, the yeah. most people send Dragon Ball Z cards to um, BGS, but they're like literally the cheapest is like $30 a card and you'll get it back in like nine months. It's like fucking insane. I would never do that. What the hell I, is this? I, wait, I, I sent my cards in at like 10 bucks a piece to CGC and my Pokemon cards and waited six months to get them back. I they, all, like, they all came back, but it was it's scary. I don't have the patience. I would like lose my mind. You have to like pretend that they don't exist. Like, it's like hard. You have to like pretend that like like just like forget about it, and then when they like show up at your door, it's like the best day of your life, you know. What I do with a lot of packages, especially now. Like, yeah, CGC is a hard grader though. I sent over a hundred cards in and did not get one ten. I got like a couple nine point fives. I did pre-order this Boba Fett Black Series, but doesn't come out till like December. Like my God, that's gonna be forever from now. Yeah. I'm sure Amazon will cancel it just like every other fucking oh my retailer. God, dude, I just got melted. Bullshit. Yeah, they're both shooting at me. I'm yeah. fucked. They were, yeah, they were good. Gold, dude, gold, gold fucking gold, gold, gold yeah. 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 I'll, I'll chat for a few more minutes, but I'm gonna turn off the nut. But I had fun. It's fun. I'm gonna look and see if any of the DLC is on sale at all first. Is uh is Fighter Z crossplay or no? I don't remember if it is or not, but wow. it's on like every system what the for hell sure. Is this yeah. obstacle right here? I don't oh, know. Because but if I can get it, all the DLC cheap on one console, I'll play it on. Uh, let me... 
Oh wow, he just went straight through. I didn't realize he dealt that much damage. Oh my goodness. Does not support cross crossplay, but it allows players to play on consoles that are part of the same hardware family. So like, so you can like play on like around it. Xbox X or Xbox One or Xbox blah blah blah. But damn it. Xbox. Horribly now. Jeez. Yeah, you and me both. I am not getting. Should not even be on here right now. Let's see if Fighter Z has any DLC on sale for. <laughs> Uh, wait, I'm confused. Let me sign in. Damn, I kind of want to turn on my Xbox now and play Fighter Z. Oh God. Oh my goodness. Those guys are the worst. It's on Game Pass? What, Fiber Z? Yeah. Oh, it might be worse. I have no idea. Alright, so add-ons. Uh, they're all like 10% off, but it's like 550, $4.50 a character. There's some oh that I no! Really want, though. Oh. Like I really want like, like Super oh, Saiyan Blue it. Vegeta. I do, oh, I do way like too soon. Man. Yeah, so that's Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan. I want the Gogeta for like, it's like five bucks, and I, I really want like. There's a there's some really cool ones, man. Fuck. I'm gonna get Rugby 22. Yeah. Let's restart that. Damn, I kind of want so many of these characters. And Xenoverse 2 is on sale for $9. It's crazy. I want all of these characters. Just let me pay like 30 bucks for all of them. Like, why do I have to pay so much for like $5? And I want Ultra Instinct Goku, the, the white hair Goku. So cool. Okay, cool. Very good. Is that like... That's his is most that powerful form. What? Oh, good. I didn't know if that was like a canon thing or just Yeah, like no, a... so it goes it goes okay. like it goes like Super Saiyan, uh Super Saiyan two, Super Saiyan three, Super Saiyan God, which is the red hair, and then Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan, which is the blue hair, and then Ultra Instinct, which is the white hair. Oh god, Brian doesn't even know his lore. Yes I do, I just said it all correct. No, you didn't. <laughs> what, because I didn't mention Super Saiyan four? <laughs> and then your response will be, oh, it's technically not Ken. I don't know if it's Ken. Four is the black with the red body yeah. hair, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Newsflash, were you in middle school Googling Super Saiyan 5 Goku? <laughs> <laughs> but, dude, like, each character's four. Because I, I was. Want, I want all characters. Dude, I want I want the Super Saiyan oh Four Gogeta goodness. and the Super Saiyan God. All right, well, Saiyan right now Goku. you're not cheering Justin on because he's going through Rings of Fire right yes. now. Yes. Okay, but I want all these characters, and I want to play this game I with you guys. had such a good run, and I'm also I'm very it. confused. Dang. Why are Goku, fucking ruined it? Why are Goku and Vegeta like downloadable characters? Are they not in the game? Yeah, they are, but they probably it's probably just different forms. They have different forms. Yeah, it's yeah. literally just regular Goku and regular Vegeta. Are they not in the game? No, that's not possible. Look at the look at the it's DLC. Not, regular they're, Goku. They're in the game. <laughs> regular Goku and regular. No, Vegeta they're they're in the, they're they're in the game. Hundred percent. So weird. Hundred percent. They're in the game. What's this? <laughs> Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Goku, and Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Vegeta unlock is it's only is only two seventy. Really? That's not bad. God, I just want to drop Wait a minute. What the fuck characters. happened there? Oh, time up. Okay. No, because um, I was supposed to jump what off, happened? I guess. Oh, okay. I was wondering. I, what I didn't know that. <laughs> Alright, we're all buying all the characters right now. Come on, let's go. Uh, in the video game? No, yeah, well, yeah. Jump, jump, jump. Come on, everybody start jump, buying the game. Everybody start jump. buying the characters. Okay, cool. Come on. Nice pass. What are you, you waiting for? Come on. But I'm down to play that next time we chat. Looks like the and best deal is to buy the Ultimate Edition for $16. No, 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 no. Okay. Phew. 
Does oh, that give you close. one of the fighter passes? It says eight characters. But I still think that like there's still a ton that you're missing then after that. Because that's what oh, I was thinking about. No, yeah. no, please, please. I, okay. I think there's three fighter passes. I think that comes with the first one. Because like I was looking at it on Switch and like I they have the ultimate edition on sale for seventeen right now instead of a hundred ten, okay, but so... you still have to buy a bunch of extra characters with it. I literally like jump first. It's fucking wild. Shots, dude. Those screenshots are gorgeous. It's the I I honestly think it's top five most beautiful games I've ever played in my life. I just am so bad at fighting games. Dang. Okay. Yeah. Um. That's like me with this this game that I'm playing now. Looks like Hero's bad. I'm playing Guilty Gear. I agree though. <laughs> <laughs> what the game the game the that they they made there? after Dragon Ball Fighters. Hold on. <laughs> Which I agree, like Dragon Ball. To all right, so let's all get get it for and Steam and, and for <laughs> and for Switch as well. I think I actually have it on Steam already. I just I, haven't played on Steam. I've only played on like. Oh well, my stuff in. Let's all get it for Switch and. Oh, Steam night, 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 night stuff. Night stuff in. All right, let's try it again. Excuse me. But if we do I... play this and I like it and I get the hang of it, I will be buying a bunch of characters. So. Yeah, hopefully. if you if you like playing. Play it for a while, it's completely Oh worth no, it. come on. Oh, I gotta get Dang. both of them over. <laughs> oh no, it's a soul. Oh cool, we got the new stage. I'll uh, I'll install it and we'll we'll play it next time. I'm excited. Make sure you install it, Sam, if you don't have it installed. What? Uh Fighter Z. On your Xbox. Oh yeah. my goodness, I gotta no, I, hold I, it I, and then I gotta hit but yeah, make sure okay, you have let's it restart this. I own it physically. No, no, I'm saying make sure you have it installed, though. This is crazy. Yeah, no, I, I'm, I'm saying I have it installed, too. Yeah. I, I don't know what you're saying. Uh, you're guessing at me? Oh, uh, true. <laughs> Actively gaslighting. All right, guys, I'm going to head to bed. I love you guys. I'll see some of you tomorrow. I'll chat with you some uh, night and things okay. and download Fighter Z and I love you and good night. Jump, hop, jump, Bye, jump, 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 jump. Okay. Let's zoom in. We're going to we're gonna want to jump around this. How the hell did that hit me? Wow, I am having the worst luck with this one right now. Yeah, I don't know. Game bet. <laughs> Game bet. Ugh. Except it doesn't really matter since I lose the same amount. Okay, that's one. Let's get the other. Okay. Cool. <coughs> I find that it's easiest to jump first and then move. If you move then jump, you're probably gonna bump into this. That was a pretty good match. <coughs> okay. Excuse me. So shit. this part Excuse is kind of bullshit. What I gotta do is. I gotta jump, grab onto it, and then at the end of that, jump. Oh, uh, did I did I make it that time? Did oh okay, so we can walk through this. Except they can just corner me. Can I get? Can I get that? Can I get that? Can I get that? Twenty seconds. Overhead. Okay, come on. Really? They put a gap there. I couldn't see that. I don't know which one, which level I dislike more, the ice level or this level. All right. 
cam. Dang, indeed. Dang. Dang. I'll just go ahead and say it. Dang. <laughs> it's gonna be... Uh, yeah. Throw it out be there. That guy. Be that guy. No. Oh my god, I am having the again, I'm having the worst luck on this. Okay. So that's one. Let's get the other one out there too. Okay. What? Okay, cool. Oh, come on. Just as I was gonna, how are you gonna get two hits on me? Beautiful. All right, cool. We're back up here. Let's see if we can do this. Awesome. All right, so we want one of these guys to come out here. All right, perfect. Damn it, I was so close. Why isn't anything happening with the slubber? Oh, they're gonna move interact with this, I guess? The bridge looks awful heavy though. I think it'll be too heavy for just one of you to lift it. So do I have to get both of those over there? Is that how that works? It might be. Who knows? Trading off grabs. Except me because I created the game. It's because I created so, the game. Okay, you see so... it's a sequel to Yay. Okay, so I think what I gotta do is I gotta <sighs> basically tired. hop off. There, there we go, that's how we do it. I might be too sleepy to keep on playing this game. Especially in ranked, holy shit. No. Ranked is tough sometimes, you know? What? I got a lot- I got so, like, I'm clearly- I'm clearly slightly better than this level. <laughs> I definitely need to, uh, do more stuff. There we go. I was pushing it the wrong way. Put in the work. Put in that extra work to rank up. I just haven't played ranked in a long time. Oh, it's not like Halo. I actually goodness, somewhat finally. care about ranked in this game. <sighs> <laughs> oh, Bobby. Yeah. Whoa. Uh oh, there's a fence blocking the way up ahead. Do you see those two balls just behind it? It looks like you'll have to get on them. Carrie says, good game. Yeah. Yeah, Thank you. you. Hey, did I even get inside that? Spinning dance, that's a great emotion thing. Great emote. <laughs> that I just got. Oh, I think we both gotta jump into these. Oh, they're good. Y'all really about to pull this right now? My controls are reversed during this. My controller is busted. Okay, that's one down. I do have to say though, this 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 lobby on Guilty Gear Strive has kind of grown on me in some way. 
It's not like the worst thing. <laughs> it looks pretty cool in some ways. It's good. It's not too wow, bad. Wow, I ran out of time just as I got the clock. And it's fairly simple for what it is. It's just kind of a pain in the ass sometimes. <laughs> Excuse me. All good. This thing needs to start giving me some, like... <laughs> some actual, like, songs again. Am I that, like, out of songs? I can hear styles. Oh my god, this is like actually insane. Right in pain. Speed! We got the speed emote. Speed. Wow, this this sucks, man. Guaranteed one new everything. One new anything. Impossible. Huh, I okay. know what that is. Maybe I should focus on trying to get rid of these guys, because they're gonna annoy me. Oh shit, I unlocked momentary life. That's a good song. <laughs> no, don't don't that, fall. That's the Guilty Gear uh double X X core plus R Viking song. That's a very good one. Now, if only I can get Rokumon. The basically the best song in just about in all of you. Yeah. No wonder they gave me three clocks here. Oh, come on! Don't follow me over here. No, come on! Don't follow me over here. Don't follow me over here. Oh, okay. So I'm supposed to go there. Yeah. Yeah, no wonder they, they gave me a hundred seconds. Yeah. Holy crap, dude. Seeing this, I'm just like, what? Yeah, why not? Why not? I'll try. I'll play one more match. If this guy wants to. Oh, I see what I gotta do. I, I think. So I gotta grab it, and then yeah, I gotta, I gotta time that. Whoa. Okay, so I gotta pull, push this up here, and then just barely make that jump, basically. How I made that jump, I have no clue. Generic ass chicken sounds. What do you want? I love it. Shit. Hmm. I don't like this bear. I do be bad. Oh my goodness, both of them fell. What the heck? Well, at least the bear fell in there, so... What the heck Fucking... is going on? What? Yeah, the internet is not great, apparently. Oh, that's not good. Alright. Okay. Okay. Hmm. What the heck?
Dude, what is up with this match? Okay. Now let's get her up there. You know what? That clock isn't worth it. Just keep going. Get used to the speed of this match was like weird. these guys. Okay, perfect. Alright, I'm actually doing really well on time. Okay, perfect. Did that in one shot. Awesome. Hell yeah, you did. Damn, fucking weird timing. Okay, I wasn't paying attention to him, so... What? So, how do I do this? Mm. Yeah, I gotta get the timing right with this thing. This thing looks pretty... nuts. God, what the hell is going on? This this dude is like lagging all over the place. I guess I'll play him one more time just to not like. barely miss it. Alright. I get it. Alright. You know what? Compared to other puzzles in this game, this one wasn't that one wasn't as bad. This level was I I'd say this level was overall easier other than that first oh, section. Oh, oh man, this head. guy Boss just at the head, I'll let the old guy fill you in on the details, but let me offer you a little advice. He uses cloning magic and is quite quietly. You have to find the real one as fast as you can, don't be fooled by the fakes. The fakes have no shadows, if you hit a fake, you'll get hurt, so be careful. Red is okay, but blue is not no good. That's it, go get him. Alright. Golin! Cutscene time. Oh. Oh, a bitch, this guy. This is very annoying because I feel like I'm not losing to him. I'm stupid bad internet. What? <laughs> what do we. Okay. Um, uh, running far away from that guy. I'll try this one. Clone performer, double weasel. Double weaser. Weasel. Oh, double the, weasel. the canes make a heart. Double weaser. <laughs> double weaser. Oh, I see. So we gotta <laughs> figure out which one's the right one. Jeez, this is an interesting one. <laughs> Yeah. Oh. 
Oh, I hit the wrong one. That's that's what happened here. All right. Let's try that again. Okay. What the heck? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. good at that one. Part of the reason I, I haven't been on. One? Okay, so the real one has a shadow. Yeah. Maybe I'm supposed to just hit the red ones, I guess. <laughs> oh my god. I'm on Twitter and I just saw a a hard drive article. I can't oh, no. <laughs> it said <Can't wait. laughs> confirms director of GTA six hasn't even been born yet. <laughs> <laughs> Which honestly true. <laughs> oh, thank you for having mercy on me, game, for once. Have mercy. Oh, I can't even attack that. Ow. That's not nice. That's not nice, game. Oh, didn't we do that. And we won. Hey. The bosses were actually no. really fun. I will give this game that for sure. But man, some of these last levels have been trying my patience to say the least. I, I need to hydrate. I'm like out of breath after all that. Holy crap. I'll be right back. All right, sounds good. Sounds good. How's this person on this one? <laughs> oh, wow, of course. Oh, look at all the chickens. Save complete. Tumble world. All right. Oh, am I ready for this? Mm.
All right, let's do it. Oh my goodness. I was not paying attention. Okay. Yeah, we're off to a terrible start. <laughs> and yeah, this is actually the last world, by the way. Wow. <laughs> Crazy. Yeah. My deck or something is really off, though. Alright. I should probably tell it not. Yeah, I probably won't be playing this much longer. Yeah, I may only be on this game anyway, but because I'm like very tired and I should not be trying to do rank whenever I am this sleepy. Because it is not. It, this, is, this game is way too intense in rank, especially for that. <laughs> Ugh. I gotta practice more again. I'd like to get a bit better than I am. Hey, what? <laughs> this part is hard. In order to move ahead, you'll need to hang on to the balloon strings. They balloon just keep telling strings. you it's hard, and you, you, yet you still conquer. Eventually, anyway. Justin prevails. Mm -hmm. To for a string to string, press a jump button. To carry on, carry on, sir. Also, I will be button. right back one. Key. Oh, no. Oh, this next part sounds ridiculous. I think I get what they want me to do. And it probably will be. This sounds like pain. Holy crap, I did it on my first try. Cookies and cream. No, definitely the hardest part of this level is that I I don't particularly care for the color choice of these clouds. I can't see like what I can step on and what I can't. An electric fan, it can be used to help you advance. Vision Crane's probably isn't strong enough to carry cream on her way, but it might be enough to move that cloud. Watch out though, if she speed up the fan too quickly, cream could lose her footing. That's actually a pretty cool puzzle. Damn, that took me all the way back here. Holy crap. Yeah. We will restart that. Time up. If I'm reading this walkthrough right, apparently those little like flying things that keep stealing my time won't show up in this world. 
so I can cool. kind of just take my time, which is Lovely. awesome. Yeah. No wonder I am getting tired. It is getting pretty low. Yeah, it time. is ridiculously oh, hey, low. Understandable. <laughs> I mean, it is Friday, but still, I'm just yeah. like, wow, it's just like hit me like a truck. Yeah. That's why I haven't called it a stream like an hour ago. I'm like, whatever, it's Friday. I could stay up a little bit. Exactly. Friday. Friday. Each freaking Friday. Maybe I should try that dude in Sekiro again. That's a terrible. No. Yeah, it sucks. Sekiro is bad. But that dude do be hard. <laughs> he do be tough. <sighs> Maybe I'll play a little bit more uh, Castlevania while I'm just kind of chilling, <laughs> winding down. Yeah, well. Because that's a little bit of an easier game than Sekiro and Guilty Gear. <laughs> Sensations that you are doing something you have done before. Whoa, who is this guy that Brian's with? Oh, they fall. He said, but I don't, I don't know. I could never, like, super get into a lot of those pop-punk bands. I mean, I, I get the appeal. Don't get me wrong. I do. But, um... I just not, don't like my fave. get how I'm supposed to like, go up there is all. Rowan Jins of Iron Ozzy <laughs> What? Okay. What is that meme that Peter I guess <laughs> that Oh, come on! Okay. Oh man, the cat dice, though. I'm right there. <laughs> Woo, I was not okay, paying cool. attention to voice channel chat that whole... I was just, like, zoning out. I will take the E on that level. Fair enough. Mm. Sometimes you just gotta. You can get better another day, right? Yeah. There are other times. Um... Oh my goodness, we Donkey Kong now? Um, sir? Check out that sleek flying machine. Hop on board and prepare for your assault on the Sky Castle. That's where the moon is hiding. I love that stupid Colin Mockery gif, by the way, Sam. <laughs> <laughs> I know, it's, it's great. It's like right? one of the best Who's Line scenes. I know. <laughs> Milk Dud spotting. Who is he? <laughs> this walkthrough says stage four is very difficult with one player. I'm oh dying. boy. It's a sign you should have played with me. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> I was scrolling down through this chat and the make sure that my okay, hold on. and then I scrolled down further banana bread is that was just like the perfect presentation <laughs> the <banana bread. laughs> that is the yeah. perfect thing to scroll turning. down to cream controls elevation so cookie controls are turning oh I can move back so, why is he making different shirts for every wrestler? Oh, because that's Blake. He just does that in his spare <laughs> time? That's that's just the thing he's doing currently, yes. I gotcha. Does he, like, do, like, design for a living, or is he just using some, like... Yeah, no, he, he owns a uh, clothing company. Oh, that, that's cool. That's his profession, yeah. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Oh shit, that Ghoulie Jack one is really cool. Yeah, uh, Loudmouth Threads. That's that's his uh, full-time job. Nice, nice. Yeah. 
Yeah, these look oh, simple enough to just, okay. just like, okay. most of them just like, throw out on the- That business money mo money okay. one, hope- Okay, okay. The that looks like that he actually drew it up or something. Justin, you got this. Yeah, no, business mummy he drew. Like, straight yeah, I was up. Gonna say, it looks like he just drew that up. Yeah. Also, this part of the game, I. Like, are you just supposed to. <laughs> you know what? I'm just gonna watch. <laughs> Don't question no, it. no questions asked. I'm just I'm gonna, gonna be watch. honest about this part of the game. It, it kind of looks like it's really hard to tell what is. places where you fall off and. Yes. That's why I'm just gonna watch it instead of yeah. ask questions. Yeah, what 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 is a platform and what is not? Kind of what it's like. To me. Yeah. But I do dig. This That's what I was saying. Stuff. Like, the color palette really wasn't the best for this. Yeah. Did this just become a cute em up? Just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> In a way, it kind of did. Oh, gee, I didn't mean to be a, what did you say? A blobo. <laughs> Dang. I wish I could have... I've, I've never actually heard that term. I love the little bird aircraft you're in. I do too, Wait, really? I dig that. I didn't get the, I didn't get the clock? Dang. I went right through that! <laughs> <laughs> okay, but did you know rain makes corn? <laughs> <laughs> right through that clock. That was bullshit. I'm just so that, like, how did All this right. pick up? I don't care how. You it's just the funny. clock, so you're not Doctor Tenma. I mean, come on. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on, dude? I will say though. Oh my god. This level so far hasn't pissed me off as much as the last two worlds. One of the servers I'm in, people are like, we need a wreck now, and I'm like, fuck that. Fuck that, play, dude. Play some other game, shit. Fuck that, dude. Pretty much. I, I don't need anything. I'm good. I, I gotta finish <coughs> Final Fantasy VII and Sekiro, and I got plenty of other stuff. Play. I got Anias I've been playing. I got, I got Backlog. Mm -hmm. That's that's what's up. True that? That's what's actually up. <laughs> Besides that, we just got oh, like no. two like two different new trailers from Nintendo, didn't we? We got a new like Why can't no. I grab any of those clocks? Grab grab what now? Uh the clocks. Yeah, let me try it again. Clucks or clocks. It's just like, like it's hard to get it when I'm in that little plane. I guess maybe I should stop trying to focus on getting the clocks and just focus on trying to beat it or something. Yeah, like just getting through it. <clears throat> I have to shoot that wall three times. Oh holy shit! Somebody in um, <coughs> somebody in the pizza party Discord, Sam. Just posted like my kind of gif. You guys are gonna love this. This is great. Great. Wait till you, wait <laughs> you mean till it's you. not me? Wait till you. Well, I mean, no, it actually wasn't this time. I was. I'm very. Su I'm surprised. I'm surprised. But look, look at this shit in voice channel chat. This is. I can't believe. Understandable. It was made, it was made just for me. It was. It was made. Oh yeah, I saw that. <laughs> it was made just for me. And everyone else. But listen, but listen, you have to understand, Arby's is good. It really is. It really, it really like... It, it's really just every, the best place to eat. Every, every, every other fast food place can pretty much go wherever, I don't care. Just like, I, I'll be fine with that. Honestly, <laughs> okay. true. It's okay if you don't like it, but you know what I do. <laughs> as far as like fast food goes, that's that's like my place. We've established this. 
It's at least a B tier on the list of all. Nah, I, I was actually low key upset when they closed down near me. Oh my Dang. goodness! <sighs> yeah, that that oh does God. suck. But no, I. I oh, I, that I was the end of the level too. <laughs> oh, that was so freaking close, dude. You got it this time. Yeah. The run. Yeah. The yeah. Run. Oh man, cookie and cream. What are you doing to me? Cooking cream, prepare to time out edition. <laughs> I gotta say though, this this music is like quite calming and Yeah, this music actually is pretty nice. Pretty awesome. This reminds me of like some oh. Kirby music or some shit. It does suck so that good. I keep getting hit by those cannonballs, and <laughs> for whatever reason, I can't. Oh my god, I keep getting hit by these things. You have to like collect a certain number to open the gate. Is that what's up? Uh, no, I have to get this bomb and then shoot it at the gate. Oh. While avoiding all that other bullet fire, and I can really, like raise and lower my altitude. To kind of dodge it, but at the same time, I got a bit of an arc. So it's kind of. Gotcha. So, like. It, it's hard to explain. Yeah, I, I understand. And. This game seems to have a habit of hitting me at just the right spot. Where I will take damage. Alright, one more. And then I'm almost there. Oh my goodness. These. These things know exactly where I'm going to end up, I swear. I oh, come on, I was trying- Ah, oh, I was lo I lowered my altitude for that. And, yep, I'm going to run out of time right as I get to the door. Dang. Dang. <laughs> ding, ding, ding. At least it's a short level, though. Oh no, I didn't mean to go in the dude's mouth. That was bad. That was been, It would have been, gee, it would have been nice if, like, this game didn't put me right in the line of fire for those. So I could start the level off with some damage. Well, that's lame. Okay, I better go. Okay. Let's lower myself. I'm gonna take off okay. and watch some TV, but good time. Alright. Alright, Alex. Sounds I'll good, Alex. Have a good night, yeah, mate. Have a good night. Night, night, dude. Peace. Alright, cool. Big invite. Now I'm finished. Okay, yep, this, this is gonna be the one. Yeah, I'm honestly Perfect. not sure how I'm supposed to fight this dude. Yeah, this is the one. Ugh. Oh, here we go, here we go. You got it. You got it, Justin. Good. Good deal. Justin's out here? Justin do be out here. Oh, no. Holy crap. Holy crap, Rowan. <laughs> what is this, even? I know someone who once said that. <laughs> Wait a second, I've heard this song before. It's from Eternal Ring, damn it. The sequel to... Never mind. I feel like I've heard like a YouTuber <laughs> use this song before. The prequel to the Dark Souls. Shit. <gasps> wow. Um... That was insane.
<laughs> that line just smacks me. I can't see anything. Oh my god, we're fighting knights! Into your dreams? Dude, it's like- Into your dreams? Come on, come on. Not sure about that ability, dude. What am I supposed to do with this knight? It's the best strategy to call the knights in the chandelier room. This guide right here, it's just kind of impossible to do both sides at once with one player. I believe that. Yeah. Alright, so... Yeah, it looks like it's very, very difficult to do that, at to say the least. what this level isn't quite as ridiculous as I expected it to be despite me falling there despite me falling twice let me restart that that's fine like it's tricky but it's not impossible yeah Let's see what you mean it's like the last few levels were like super gimmicky This is not, yeah, this doesn't look nearly as bad. Damn, they take three hits to kill. <laughs> okay, cool. Welcome, yep. welcome, welcome. The return of Jess. Oh, hey. Oh, it is. You know what it is. Okay. Hey, you know what it is. Black and yellow. <laughs> I better get away. Nope. <laughs> cool. Yeah, keep going, keep going. Almost. There we go. <laughs> For me to leave. Keep okay. going, keep going. Oh, which is time. Is that some like praise king? Keep going, keep going. Mm hmm. Um, this is a family friendly stream? I'm kidding, I'm sorry. You're in a video game? Just I'm kidding. Sorry. <laughs> Oh, he's playing a game still. Yes. Uh, Same game. He's playing a game still. Oh, damn. That's got some range. 
do be they do be ranged. Okay. So Oh my god, really. Oh wow, they can just combo you. Like a combo meal right now? Yeah, I think it's best to get them near each other and then try to like chain bounce them. See if I got an item. Nope. One more. Nothing. Sleepy. That works too. I am yeah, very too. sleepy as well. I was probably gonna hop off soon. Yeah, same. Alright. Oh, we got a mini boss again. Damn it. That would that would be happening to me. Whoops! I'm not too far away from a level though. Apparently. Oh my goodness! I uh, I forgot which rabbit I was controlling. Um, the rub rabbits. Okay. Yeah. Let, let's. Let's reorient myself. Okay. I have found the secret to beating guy with giant ass. Yeah, we, we can restart that. Right Let's restart this. That's fine. Oh. Okay, cool. <sighs> what do these news things do that okay. I Okay, you know what? I'm okay with this level. Mothman, numerous sightings, indicate that it's drawn to intense light. <laughs> Flying humanoid, huh? Yeah, I'm gonna go to bed, guys. Oh, okay. Well, have a good night. Alrighty. Good night. Nighty night. Okay. Isn't it letting me. Break. The what? Oh my god. Let me leave. Oh my god. Hold on. My. Boy. Boy, you leave. Jesus. I guess it won't let you leave, huh? No, it's not. Uh. I'm not sure why that would be. You're on mobile, right? Yeah, but like the, um. Where I hit the X, it's like you only see the cut of the X. Silly. Interesting. Mm, Hold on, let me totally try in and out of the app one time. <laughs> okay. Yeah. No problem. All right. Well, there we go. Good night, guys. Good night. Good night. Thanks for hanging now. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna leave too. All right. All right. Nighty night. But, uh, but enjoy the nice rest man. of the cookie and cream, my friend. Yes. yes. We'll see if I actually beat this in. <laughs> you, you might. I you am might. very close to the game. Okay. So. If, if, if I'm coherent, I'll put you on in the background. Don't worry. Cool. <laughs> Nighty night, y'all. Nighty night. Nighty night. Right, let's, get the, let's get these guys close, because then I could, like, bounce on multiple. Yeah, we could do, we do that. Yeah, that's good. Oh, that's crazy what this werewolf just did in this game. Perfect. Then give me that time. I just love his... I love their instruments just hanging off their backs, too. It's really great. Didn't say that the whole playthrough, basically, but I am now. Awesome! Oh, that was perfect. Nice. Okay. Do that. And then let's let's get them both on the same controller side to make it less confusing for me. Okay. 
get you to move. did hit me though god this boss seems like so hard to do without another person oh he, damn this dude just comboed me oh my god i see it now yeah yeah all right i'm dead they're not that bad it's just for whatever reason i couldn't seem to get them with the platforms yeah like it looked like they were just brushing against him and not really doing that doesn't seem right. <laughs> I guess I gotta hit him just so, maybe? I don't know. Mm -hmm. Okay, so apparently I have to hit this guy with with all six of the freaking wood things. So, like, just doing the same one over and over doesn't yes. for it. That's kind of kind of dookie, but I get it. There's a challenge. Oh, no. I was so close to doing that perfect. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Oh, okay. Let's restart that one. That was bad. Yeah. I see. You got kind of like... It looked like you kind of got frame trapped in that a little. <laughs> yeah. Just a, just a bit. Just a tad. I forgot how hard it was to like collect souls in Castlevania Dawn of Sorrow because like they don't drop They do not drop often. very often at all. They really don't. I I, <laughs> I thought like I guess I played so much of whenever I was um, younger that I just kind of like backtracked a lot and naturally got a bunch. I remember getting like just a ton. I feel like I got like close younger and played this but playing it again this time I'm like yeah no wonder this game took me so long back then it was there's a lot going on there, there's a lot of not easy to get drops in the game that's a very good run on that actually oh wow yeah that was a very good run holy crap okay let's do the hard side first Flea man. A flea man.
Oh, no damage whatsoever at that distance. That's pretty cool. I don't know how I get him in the corner. Oh, come on. I had that. Okay, cool. Oh, you know what it is? I gotta have him turn around, so let's get him over oh. here. Oh. Yeah, yeah. That that will hit him. Oh, I see it, yeah. I, I, exactly I get it now, yep. I, I get it now. I probably won't win this, but at least now I understand it. Now you'll know how to do it, yeah. So you can definitely, like, do it a lot easier this time. Yep. I almost had it there, too. Yeah. Really good. Restart that. Oh my goodness. I don't know why I can't do this part. <laughs> this is the easy part. Okay. Hey, it happens. We Indeed, have our, we does. all have our bad runs. Yeah. Yep. Cool. Oh. Cookie. Oh my God, cream. Oh my God. For a second, I forgot which analogs did who. Oh. Yeah. Let's let's restart. Yeah, that I one. feel like I would get disoriented a. Yeah, honestly. Oh. Oh, I, I forgot which one was which. Alright. I got this. You got this. I got it. I got this. I got this. Okay, good. Get into that square. Right in front of it. Oh. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Try to jump, dodge that. Yep, that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Oh, I did not mean to get her that far up. So I lost a little bit of time with that, but let's see if we can make up for it. If that was gonna hit me or not. Okay. Right. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, not quite the cycle I wanted, but I'll take it. Mm. Okay. Dang, I was so close to beating him that time. So close! That's what I need to use the next time, though. Mm. Uh, 
Oh, I hate that move. It's so bad. I'm just not getting this guy to go where I want him to go. Exactly what I'm supposed to do on this fight that I'm in. Yeah, it's like, the hitbox for this thing seems very finicky. I'm watching a video of somebody play this fight. Oh yeah? Curious about that. I'm gonna try... The nice thing about this game I'm playing is that I can change out loadouts a bit, and like... disoriented for a second. I was not in sync with my characters. Oh, I see. Uh, yeah, I bet that's easy to do, especially like now that it's later and there's likely losing focus involved as well. Okay, you're down. Oh, that's spooky. What is that? Grab you. got that down pack.
what that actually hit me okay okay weird mm. that is not what I meant to do Jesus Christ why did I do that Oh, well, it actually hit cream that time. Oh, that just barely hit me. That, I do, any devil. Huh. Got him in position now. Hopefully. Dang, I guess it not. Yeah. That's it's... stinky. Oh wow, I, I kinda got comboed right there. Yeah, see that now. Yeah, that sucks. Yeah, that that's it. <laughs> oh. <sighs> One more time. And if not, then maybe I'll pick this up tomorrow. Yeah. Is there anything on the schedule for tomorrow? I don't think so. I didn't think there was, but... Probably not, not since sure. Anthony and Sam are going to be busy. Yeah, that's what I was kind of thinking. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I think I'm getting to a point where I no longer am in sync with these characters. <laughs> yeah. It's late. I completely understand. So I think I'm just yeah. tired. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty close the same way <laughs> as you with my game that I'm playing as well. I'm like, what is going on? Yeah. The things right. that I was doing okay a little bit ago, I'm. Let's. Call it quits here, and depending on what's going on tomorrow, maybe I'll stream it. If not, I definitely want to finish this, at least on my own. Just like yeah. um, Eternal Ring, I want to finish that on my own. In fact, I made a little bit more progress in that, too. Oh, really? Since, nice. Yeah. I'm very was, close to the end of that game. I'm like, watch. Right, I'm, to see that. I'm like right near the final boss. I'm just kind of grinding and uh, trying to get some really good stuff so I can beat it very easily. Nice. Okay, cool. So this isn't like Mega Man where you gotta do the whole castle stages in one go. Yep, so let me save again. And yeah. So we can call it a stream here. Damn, almost six and a half hour stream. That's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, thank you guys for watching. And I'll catch you again next time. <laughs>